Let's go. go. Aesthetics is the philosophical study of beauty and art. Although it may appear that art implies the idea of beauty, a little introspection reveals that they are in fact very different things. Alex slits through Alex heart Alex heart. Yo, what's up, Captain Hook? Thank you. And Tony Moon, thank you. S3 Punk with the 17 months, John Ortiz with the 12 thank months. Thank you, Alex. You helped me a lot past years throughout high school. I couldn't have done it without your online mathematics tutorials. Alex Hart. All right.
my secret stream last night. Oh, what, on General Emu's channel? <laughs> yeah, bro, I have an alt account where I do all of my streams on whenever I'm not comfortable to, like, go live on my main. <laughs> I know that's a thing. I should think about that. I need a lot more subscribers, though, I think, for me to make a second Twitch channel. I kind of don't get that, though. Like, yo, Minyari, thank you. Because the concept's like, oh, I don't feel comfortable enough Been loving the streams lately, Alex. to go live, which is fine. But then you go live on like an account where you, I guess the idea is like all my real fans know about that account. But then it's like, like who's a real fan? I guess like only people you tell, like maybe your friends that would know. Love you, God tier streamer. Your second channel, Moichi, and place TSCO. Okay, dude. Use a second channel to do other stuff and not mess with their main account metrics. Yeah, that seems that seems legitimate. I'm not sure how that works for Twitch, if I'm being honest. Because with YouTube, people make a second channel for like like that specific content, you know. So you're like, oh, here's my Minecraft channel, but then here is my uh, like vlogs and hobby channel. I guess that makes sense. But then on Twitch, it's like. I guess if you're like, oh, I have a Fortnite only Down Twitch channel. I guess you'd also then have a second channel for like, here's where I play other games instead of Fortnite. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, that probably makes sense. I don't know. I don't, I don't think it's that big of a deal. Uh, basically get the server surprisingly quick. Uh, I didn't stream at all yesterday, obviously. That was my bald spot, bald spot check. Didn't stream at all yesterday. Um, didn't stream it all the day before that. I said hello. Sure, sure, she'll pop in here soon. She's probably just chilling downstairs eating her bowl of uh, kibble. Give me a second. So today we're going live. Uh, that her? Yep. You saw it. You saw the tail. You noticed your hair falling out? Uh, not until you said that. Okay, everyone's everyone's joining me in here. Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. What a big dog. Pet doggo. Okay. Pet and doggo. Doggo's getting pet. Doggo's happy about the pets. That's it. Oh, don't pull my headphones. How did you step over my headphones? What the fuck? My headphone cable, I should say. Uh Okay, 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 all right. I see you. I see you. Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh double trouble. That's what I'm saying, bro. You got two of them in here. How long before a meeting? I mean, our last speed record was like right before mission row. That's our uh I think that's our PB any percent is outside of mission row. Like on the stairs, so I don't think I don't think we're gonna see. Yeah, I don't think this is WR pace. WR pace would have had to have probably started at a different time, probably later in the day, um, maybe after tsunami. I think those are the the like the WR conditions, because then there's a lot of people that would probably want to call me, and also after tsunami would be like in the middle of some other RP. You know what I'm saying? Or if Julio and Mantis are around, because they're notorious stream snipers. So they'd be the ones to call me um, once they know that I'm around. Tsunami? Dude, I don't know. I can't say Tsunami for whatever reason. I keep calling it Tsunami. Tsunami. I think it's since I was a kid and Tsunami existed, I don't know. I don't know what it is. And I thought it was Tsunami, but it was Toonami. Listen, I don't want to talk about it, honestly. I don't want to talk about my speech impediment at, you know, the first 11-minute uh, mark of the stream. It's just not what I want to do. I want to do other things. You know what I'm saying, chat? Hey, Alex and chat looking real cute, Alex, Chuck. 
I'm good on that. Chat, stop bullying Alex with speech impediment. That's what I'm saying. Thank you. Thank you for standing up for me, gold wonton. <laughs> Six eighty five will look for the body uh, if uh, somebody wants to help out uh with Chase. Alright. Wicked shit. Tip for I got glasses Rocky that were too angle. small for my head. I got a big we're, ass yeah, head and they've given me headaches every single day, dude. Medical attention. Uh, the driver of the vehicle just warned us that we choose between either saving him or catching him. So I need you guys to take air one or something there as soon as possible. I'm about a minute out from there. Left up one just took off. Why can't I? What can I do zero anymore? Oh, it's because we're in the. I'm, I'm literally right here. I'm gonna go ahead. Dan, you just help uh, Angel and Fred with a chase. We're gonna be in an active 80 southbound underneath Sonora Freeway along Grapeseed <sighs> Avenue. Let me see that smile, boy. We're gonna be making a left hand. Yo, Jerky, thank you for bound. the 23 CU months. Road. Mew Ausik, the so 21. Dan's Sandy ace. Shores. Uh, Danny needs to poop with the five months. Thank you. Penny Wyatt, 32 months. Bibbly, six months. They're making uh, a right. Raylant with the prime. Go ahead and take primary. Rubar Thaz with the 11 months. Four. Dope They're Talents with the 17. One PYC with the 1,000 bits. And again earlier, Minyari with the five gifted subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Four fifty seven is gonna regain secondary. We're gonna be passing mission um, we're gonna be passing DCSO building that nobody uses, continuing westbound East Joshua Road towards uh Stab City. What's with the weather recently? What the fuck? Still continuing westbound. Oh, didn't we turn weather off? Didn't weather get turned off because it was like too much? Is it back now with the latest update? Right. Eastbound Marina Drive. It's fixed. I'm gonna be traveling right next to Alamo Sea and Sandy Shores. Where's your umbrella? True, do you ain't to get that shit key binded. Do we have a unit up with that 911 call? Camp 4, we're uh, code 6 for the uh, 47. Benzo, hop in and use my camera. Continuing mm -hmm. southbound Panorama Drive. Alright. Uh, oh my god, what the hell's going on out here? Westbound Route 68. I got him. He's, uh, he's under air one on this rock. Yo, Shanny with the Y. With a Y. Thank you, the Prime. With the Y. Appreciate it. Charger. I just haven't been, like, I haven't been liking the Charger recently, man. I don't know why, dude. It's just so, I don't know, it just kicks out. The back end always kicks out on me. Speaking of uh, driving things, we got the, uh, we got the, um, <laughs> I'll call it the race rig working. Uh, I was fucking around with Dirt 2 last night uh, to try to make it work for this weekend. But uh, I don't know, I'm not really feeling it. It's weird. Like, well, first of all, I took a Camaro out as a uh uh on the test track and the thing just for some reason just couldn't stay on a fucking dirt road for the life of it even though you know uh, uh anyway that's not really the point i then i played need for hey, speed Bob. and it feels like shit how are you i'm good i'm just gonna go kill the people who still could hurt southbound someone okay NASCAR iRacing Pro, it's because you suck. Okay, no, listen, what I'm trying to say is that there's a huge difference between uh, some of these games, okay? Like, some of them are, like, hardcore sims, and others are not very good. And Need for Speed Heat, it's kind of funny. It's a funny game, but it's not, you know, realistic. Do you do iRacing? I don't know. I don't know what I should what I should do, I guess. I guess I'll probably look at... People were saying Assetto Corsa i racing um i don't know pro i don't know if someone mentioned project cars or gran turismo or some shit i, don't, I have no idea dirt 2.0 or dirt rally i think it was uh what the fuck did i get it was dirt rally 2.0 it's 
funny if you turn the uh, track to wet and you take out a mustang you become uh one of those uh youtube clips where you go off the road and hit a bunch of pedestrians forza f1 I'm just trying to figure out what would be like actual like I kind of wanted something where I can like progress through a story and like be my own racer and go through like multiple tournaments to prove that guys I know how to drive a manual car because that's one of the things I have a eight shifter as well so it's not it has panels in the racing wheel but I also have like an actual shifter where you know I can stall the car out which is kind of interesting so um, I, I gotta figure out what uh, yeah it's the Logitech one it's the Logitech uh, G290, I think it is, or 29, whatever the hell is it, 920, 2929, I already forget the fucking numbers. F1 Career, F1 Career has progression, would you guys actually watch F1 Career? It would be really cringe, dude, I have no idea how F1 cars even remotely drive. I thought dirt would be funny because it's like rally, but dirt just has so many sub menus that I I couldn't. Fu I guess there is like a couple that I like a career, but it's just more like here's circuits. I'd watch you peel potatoes. I think that could be fun. I know that um dirt's coming out with a new game in October as well, so I'm kind of that's kind of one of my other reasons for it big rigs okay how about i don't drive a okay we can save the fucking i drive a cat hairs up my nose we could save the uh i drive a semi truck through uh utah uh, for a different stream okay i know everyone's dying for me to drive a fucking semi truck which by the way sounds like the most boring ass shit i could possibly do for a stream but i'll concede that there's probably some entertainment value in it i don't need really to do utah because i actually like utah i think utah is a dope state I'll say it. I'll go on record. I think it's underrated. Uh, so that's one reason why I drive a fucking, uh, you know, semi truck through it. But F. Okay, I'll look into the. Uh, it's just called F1, right? I mean, is, is there is there is this like part of some other? This like other game that has the career mode through it. F1 2020. <laughs> I'm already regretting it, dude. Okay. sound stuffy uh it could just be like the dry weather there's entire streamers that only truck sim there's always an audience for everything i know it's just okay it's just it's 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 just play f1 with londo driver mclaren does it on twitch yeah i've seen i've seen uh Lando uh, stream before some of the stream clips, but obviously I've never met him or anything like that. <laughs> I, just, I just don't think I don't think I don't think it's gonna be good. That's all I'll say. Doesn't Lando watch no pixel? Yeah, they actually uh, they actually imported uh, like an F1 type car uh, into GTA when they found out that he was uh, uh, like watching and stuff. In case he ever did decide to come on the roleplay server, I'm pretty sure the devs would probably let him have an F1 uh you know uh racing vehicle to just like hit the gta streets with which actually could be kind of funny break into becoming a formula one driver true dude you gonna play cyberpunk on stream i'm not sure man I'm pulling out axes All right, i'm gonna go straight to polito Wait, is there like a racing vehicle up there as well Horse all wheel drive, baby. Although the charger has all wheel drive as well. So I don't know. I wish you could just set the modes on it. The fuck is going on at pillbox, dude? No, 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 no. Save it. Save it. So fucking annoying, dude. Watch out for one acting you on the right hand side, Dan. Watch your right. I don't think I can even salvage this, honestly. 
It's on a side like this. Not really, no, it's not a side. Oh, okay. We actually got it, sweet. Iron Eagle, I just landed air one. I'm at the exit. If they come out this way, I can shoot them. One's down, one's got in three. Nice. Nice. Two down. <laughs> I need to, uh, uh, take this car. Okay. I don't see the other one running up to the ten. What if I have a gun? Give me the fucking car, man. There's a bank robbery, uh, when batch number is 309, you can just come to Mission Road to get your car back. Thank you. Listen, listen dude, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do, okay? Okay. I wouldn't do this if this was anything but me as a sole responder to a Polito bank okay, robbery, uh, okay? Right, so be advised, all of those cultists will have cyanide pills under their teeth. There's like a whole other situation the going on, I just want to give the Polito bank robbers some RP, sure they, they assuming that that's what they want. The well, they're probably gone at this right. point, so... I'm making siren horns. I'm just gonna turn my hazards on, okay? From Is that not working? Stand by. Less than doesn't have uh, hazards. I've seen anyone in this direction been done. This whole, that, that whole tunnel side is... Wee who, wee who. <laughs> Watch you get pulled over. I don't think I'm gonna get pulled over. Because there's no cops to pull me over. I don't need to transition back to K9. I got one up here. He's like walking with one of the people we have down. Okay. Oh my it's god, somehow Brent's down. Del Perro. Yeah, I think he went after the pet, shoot him. Down, they're down. M4, if we have all of them in custody, let's get them loaded up and uh, brought to a single spot. Pulled over by a local, dude. What's going on? Why did this guy just... What the fuck? Some of these drivers actually just do like dumb shit without me even having to be in a police car, ironically enough. So that's good. Yo, stick zero. Think of the 15 months. Oh! Hey, you still here? Hey, stop the car! Okay, all of my... That's a cop right there. What the fuck? And what they officer? Did you see the guys that robbed the bank in Polito? Yeah, it was us. <laughs> yeah, it was us. Stop the car, stop, it. stop the car. <laughs> Tony Corleone, don't forget the name, bitch. Tony Corleone, I'm putting out a warrant for you your arrest. You back up here, you fucking pussy ass bitch. <laughs> Let me see some ID. You want to see some ID? Let me yeah. see some ID. Let me show you my dick. <laughs> you better call some back I don't want to see your bitch. fucking dick. Wait, hold Jesus on a second. Jesus Christ, Bobby, what the fuck? Hey, did you just rob the bank up in Polito? No, I was, I'll, I'll be honest with you, I was doing the street lace. Oh, oh, okay, alright. Do you need a ride? Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Where are you going? I don't know, police station somewhere. It, it, it Mission Row? Sandy Shores. When you can, uh, Sandy Shores, alright, yeah, close there's, uh, there's one Sandy Shores. Close your eyes, I'm gonna play a radio station that sounds like really fast cars. Oh, so realistic. Yeah, doesn't it sound good? So you were street racing, you know that's illegal, right? Uh, I said allegedly. Uh, well, allegedly it's legal. I don't actually know. Let me... Is there even a fucking charge for illegal speed contest yet? No, I've been trying to put one in. They just see it as reckless uh, driving or speeding. It's no real... So you know you know about the uh yeah, the Liberty I'm Walk GTR, right? Yeah, yeah ten four they, they came back, I just cleared the vehicle. They, uh, and he oh no, there's no. a street racing charge. Oh there is? Uh using public roads during the automotive 
race for sport and or material gain. Well, at least the definitions of the fucking charges is getting better. Um, no, what's the liberty uh, pursuit of happiness? What are you saying? The, the liberty walk, uh, GTR? Otherwise, we're... It's supposed to be the fastest car in the city. Oh, okay. I just beat it three times, allegedly. Ooh. Well, allegedly, congratulations. Thank you for the ride. I appreciate it. In a yester. Yeah, no problem, buddy. Don't tell Brian I gave you a ride, though. Uh, I won't. All right, thanks, man. All right, let's see. Why do you hate me and wish I was dead? Who is this? This is Justice Chief Justice Katya. Bam. Hello, Chief Justice Katya. Bam. How can I help you? No, I said damn, not bam. Damn. Sorry, I have bad service up your weather and all that. How come every single time we talk, you sound like you would rather be jumping off a bridge? Because it's never good news, Judge. It's never good news. Okay. We used to be friends, Bob. We used to be friends back before the power got to you. Now the you're power? The Chief what Justice. Are you about. Now that you're the chief judge, things have just gone downhill between us two. You're taking the power uh, way too literally, you know. Name one single time I've done that. Uh, when you didn't give me my full budget for the fourth quarter of, of the police term. Because you don't need that. Yes, I do. Okay? You realize that our mayors, one of them is a crack whore prostitute, and the other one is, I don't even know what he is. All right? We got, yeah. I got a budget things around here. I'm basically the mayor right now. Well, you can't give me a budget and then, like, hold me accountable afterwards. What are you talking about? That's so fucked up. I hate you. Look, I need a, I need a bigger so budget so I can... Pay more lawyers to sue the state. Okay, well... So need, How, like, what budget do you need? I don't know. I, I haven't thought of it yet. I just want to complain about it, too, since you called. All right, listen, Bobby. What are you doing right now? Uh, I was trying to stop Polito bank robbers, but then I crashed my car, so then I had to uh, borrow one from somebody, and I promised to give them back. But then I crashed it because speed racers drove into me off of a ditch, and then they told me that they're the ones that robbed the bank and uh, started drifting around me, and then they took off. And that's when another speed racer came by and scooped me up and asked me if there's going to be a speed racing charge at some point. Now I'm at Sandy Shores by myself hanging out. Okay. Well, what are you going to do now? Mm, I don't know. I'm just kind of vibing. All right. I need to have a very long meeting with you. Okay. I'm bored. You cannot get any doctor's a pill box. Okay. Make sure to get him uh, with nice. All right. When do you want to do this meeting? Right now. Okay. Okay, I'll see you at PD. What a big goth! Alex, you rock. Alex, you rock. Alex, you rock. Alex, you rock. Yo, Artsy, thank you for the six months. I even think of the two months as well. Yeah, <laughs> the reason they asked Tony for the ID is because it's probably Tony, but him saying it's Tony and sounding like Tony isn't enough in the state of Los Santos on NoPixel to be able to put out a warrant for somebody that gives me enough reasonable suspicion, but not enough probable cause, unfortunately. So if he had shown me an idea, I could have put a warrant out. And I think that's one of the issues that we have with so many people that are like, you guys never put warrants out, but you're, you know, if people are running around as masked dandies, like we can't. This goes back to Al Saab uh, being at a crime scene, identifying himself as Al Saab, wearing a helmet, talking like Al Saab, Six different officers called him Al Saab. He responded as Al Saab. Was with a crew without his mask on as Al Saab. But when he put the mask on, I guess there was enough reasonable doubt that this crew swapped him out with somebody that sounds and looks like Al Saab for a job. At which later when they were shot by police, that's when the real Al Saab was swapped back in. It's just so fucking dumb sometimes the logic and the reach that uh we have to like uh i don't know trod through to be able to like arrest and convict somebody not all the time i will say sometimes it's as easy as hey i saw that guy pull a gun and then we can just fucking raid him but other times it's like well you need a picture you need his id you need a vehicle that was registered to him it's just 
I don't know. I don't think there's ever going to be a standard that's set forth. So it's just easier for me to be like, well, if you want me to put a warrant out, just tell me all this information and I can definitively have it stick. Uh, Amy, thank you for the five gifted subs. Appreciate it. Reasonable doubt really shouldn't be based on a 1% probability. Yeah, well, it keeps being based on a 1% probability, hence the court case that we just had, where it was based on not not the, lo not the logic thing of gangsters were going to kill each other literally anyway, and they've been killing each other for four days. They're going to keep killing each other. So what, isn't that more probable that they would continue to kill each other rather than a cop would try to arm them to incite chaos? on the eyes of the Justice Department. Even when it's put on record. Even though when criminal records were put into court because OTT says, we're all gangsters, we're all criminals, we do crime every day. Even when that's put into court, it's still somehow, I don't know, a reasonable argument that a cop would try to uh, incite chaos. I feel I sorry for you, Keck. Three hours meeting. Here we go, Keck. Why want a meeting, Gus? I am bored. Classic. Yo, Anonymous, thank you for the 50 uh, bucks. Yeah, man, I mean... Be advised, you may have uh, two down from these poison capsules. It's, uh, it's what, uh, you know, it's what I should be doing as the uh, COP, so it's... Not surprising by any measurement, you know what I mean? It's all good, though. It's all good. Some of these meetings are very productive. Some aren't. Um, you know, like the other day when we spent three hours investigating ESB because we were trying to push SNS warrants and that whole court case pretty much threw them out the window. That Those were un unproductive meetings. But then sometimes you're like, hey, can I get this law and uh, all this other stuff? Do you see any WoW trailer? No, I have not seen the new WoW trailer. I saw the uh, Twitter post from Blizzard that... Announcement dates in uh, October, so I'm kind of stoked for that. Hello. Hello, Chief. Hello, Chief. So, I know you have, uh, let's see, what, four more days? Until I quit? Okay, well, if you're going to quit, I don't you know. What? Is that what you're doing? I don't, I don't know. I, uh, I haven't figured it out yet. Well, maybe you should think about it. There might be just too much corruption and ill will happening in the city for me to continue to ethically be the chief of police, you know? How that, I don't know if that really... Like, my budget's been you. slashed. I have to fight the Justice Department and their corruption. You didn't use your entire budget. I mean, at this point, I might as well just step down because the whole city's against the police department, you know? You are being so ridiculous right now, you know that? I gotta tell... I gotta go out there and tell my cops that, hey, listen... Your family and you aren't getting a pay raise this Christmas, okay? In fact, I'm going to need to fire some of you because of how heavily our budget has been slashed. That's not true. We That's literally what I have pay to them. Do. That's what I will have to do. No, you will not have to do that. And if you do that, that would be very unethical because that is not the truth. You do not pay them. The state does. From okay. Well, you, okay. you keep telling yourself that. <laughs> no, I, I literally sign their checks. Oh, you don't? I sign their checks. No, I sign them. We both sign them. I believe 4570 is peeing. No, I, I remember you won a court case and you told me that I signed the checks. Now you're signing the checks? Okay. What, what court case? It was the court case where you guys were trying to like look into our SOPs and some weird unethical shit. Okay. It was over the whole Jordan Steele thing where he got fired, but he didn't receive pension. And he sued us because of a fucking bulletin board in the kitchen. And did he win? Yes. No, he didn't. He didn't get any pension. He got disability. So. Mm -mm. Okay, got him. He got disability for an injury. That's all he got. For 10 weeks for an injury that he got, even though he was fired. Right, but he was still injured. Just because, you know, you, you have a potato and you wrap it in tinfoil and call it a, a tinfoil potato, it doesn't change the fact it's still a potato, Your Honor. You know what I'm saying? Are you saying that? Injured people don't deserve some type of compensation for their injury. I'm saying or... he should have filed with the state for disability or whatever he was going for. Not sued us and then somehow got money out of it. He got disability out of it. Out of suing us. He got a W. So you're mad that he got a W? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, Bob. Anyway, um, so this civil case... <clears throat> now again i don't have anything to do with this um okay but uh actually i i i guess larry would be the one to deal with this um the criminal charges no no no, no. i'm talking about the civil 
Uh, no, that's uh, that's that crane guy. Right. Crane and so, Braun. On, so on the state side, he, Larry would be the one to deal with this. Yes, but, to um, push the criminal charges. And and I mean, the state is being sued. He's a district attorney. He, you're literally suing Larry. That's in this, in the civil case. Yeah, if you're filing it against the state, then yes, you're. Oh, yeah. Larry is the one who has to pick that case up. Okay. Okay. So is a settlement something he spoke to you about, or is he going through with that? I don't know what he's doing. Yesterday he was like thinking for three hours and like eating a sandwich. So I don't, uh, I don't know where his head's at. Okay. Is a settlement something you'd be interesting interested in? At the settlement being the car. Okay. <laughs> like, is that, is that where you're telling me the settlement would be? I, you'd have to talk to my lawyer. The police okay. department lawyer. I don't know. I mean, I can do that. Like I said, I, uh, I'm letting them handle it. Cause my name's already on too much of this. Yeah. I mean, I, I think it's not, uh, a good idea for me to even suggest that to you. I'm just trying to find a way to come to even ground. Look, it's not about the your car. department and my department. Right. But you know I'm 50% the head of this now, so I want, I don't want myself and yourself, as well as my department and your department, to continue to have this uh, toxic relationship. <laughs> yeah, just like don't, you know, change the definition of things and then like base your verdict off of it. I think we'll be good. Well, that's not me, but. Well, I know that's not you. That's why. I... That's why I, I think we get along. I mean, I don't think I don't think you and I not being friends anymore is toxic. Well, I don't understand why we're not friends anymore, Bobby. I don't know what you did. Why did you, you do that? You told me we're not Some friends. Gamer. You didn't even ask me why. You, you just me. said, okay, we're not friends anymore. No, you you said something about like, I didn't like the way you were dressed or something. You, you had this whole narrative and we weren't ever going to be friends. And you didn't even care. Yeah, I did. Lost, -uh. I lost like a day's sleep over it, I think. And then you went on vacation for like three months. Mm -hmm. Where did you go? I went to uh, I went to Colorado for a uh, police convention where I did a panel on excessive force. This is new to me. You told me you were snowboarding and shit. Well, let me explain. All right, I did the panel and it went so bad that I took the next two and a half months uh, as a ski vacation paid for by the government. So. Well, excuse me. I took a ski vacation. I had a lot of fun, all right? I'm a ski instructor. Wait, I paid for that shit? Look, I think what's in the past, plus it's over the 30 days at this point when I initially took the vacation, so. Although I think Artson did tell me that em embezzlement or something like that wasn't going to have a statute. Why? I don't know. He just told me one day, I was like, theoretically, if a million dollars was taken from the Justice Department, by a previous chief of police and then they spent that money on like a mansion and cars and it's over 30 days could you still investigate it and he said no for something like that there's not going to be a statute of limitations when it comes to police department embezzling money there's also why I, I hired a female uh, accountant so okay what's her name beck Deck? Beck. Deck, like that thing that you build? No, like Beck. In the backyard? No, the, the B. 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 Oh, okay. Beck. Beck. All right. Hmm. Huh. So she's doing all the accounting for the uh, police department office. Okay, has it been two weeks yet? No. Oh, okay. Well, you could have said yes. I wouldn't have known. Okay. Uh, also. Uh, I'm, me and Buck are going to be working on some new, possibly some new laws. Uh, Drifting is illegal and punishable by death. It's already illegal. We have this fucking conversation every fucking time I walk in here. It's already illegal. It's There's charges in there for it. Look. I've, sp I've spoken to the people of Los Santos. 
and they agree it should be illegal. I don't have okay. a list of names or I don't have any evidence of this, but they definitely think it should be punishable by death. I didn't say it. It's just all the people in Los Santos think it should be punishable by death. Allegedly. I think you should be punishable by death. I won't go on record and say that. Why not? Because. Because why? I don't know. What's this whole thing with cops and contempt and lying on stand? Mm-hmm. What's 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 the deal with that? I I, I keep Why hearing it me? because it's it's I, this isn't the first time I heard it, but uh, what is our testimony not worth shit anymore? Because a cop has lied before or something like that. Is it a thing? Mm, I I mean, there's perjury and there's lying by omission. Well, we don't have any proof of that. But yet I hear from judges that cops lie, so I'm trying to understand. Well, which cops? I don't know, they just say cops lie. Like, during the court case, uh, for the fucking East Side Ballas and all that stuff, it was somehow more reasonable that a cop armed a gangster and started chaos, as opposed to, I don't know, gangsters were already at a war with each other and they were going to shoot each other the minute the cops left anyways. And that was solely because... It was unbelievable to the judges that cops were in the area and didn't hear them taunting or something. So it was so, it was more plausible that the cops heard the taunting and decided to incite the chaos rather than, I don't know, a cop wasn't paying attention to somebody threatening somebody else and armed them. So when an officer gets on the stand, um, and this isn't just officer-based, it's, it's witness-based entirely. When somebody gets on the stand and remembers every single detail... Uh, of an incident, except for the incident that could, you know, uh, implicate them in something or show their fault, uh, that is lying by omission. When you remember every single detail, but when the detail that matters is like, oh, did you, uh, you know, did you give them the knife? Yes, but I didn't know what was going to happen. Okay, did you taunt them? Oh, I, I can't recall. That's lying by omission. And officers have been doing that for a long time. Not just officers, everybody. But in the eyes of the courts, it's very difficult, especially after the whole Jordan Steele era, okay? It's very difficult to deal with that. Okay. Does that make sense to you? Yeah, I mean, I, I can believe that. I usually try to... Uh... Tell the truth. Um, but you've but seen, I, I know my you've officers, seen officers would. Do this. Yeah, I've seen officers not be able to recall information. But again, I've seen that happen during court cases that may have taken, I don't know, uh, three weeks before they get on trial. And then, yeah, the cop can't remember certain details as well because it is hard, kind of hard to remember stuff. Yeah, uh, I mean, I take that into account. I mean, you guys go through it's different from criminals, right? I mean, I don't know what exactly they go through, but you guys go through 20,000 calls every single fucking day. What is that? So I'm not going to expect you to remember strict? every single what the detail fuck is that three message? weeks, four weeks, even, you know, a week later. Um, but when you can recall a lot of things perfectly, and the one thing that matters to the case Especially cannot be recalled, it's, all the it's a tricky situation. Uh, Especially when that one situation could imply one that the right officer now. maybe didn't yeah. follow their SOPs or <laughs> did something interesting with twenty bucks. Well, shit we like thought that. one was deceased, but he just started moving, so I don't, I don't really okay. know. Okay. Um. Gotcha. I guess uh, as long as the verdicts aren't based off of a lot of officer potentially uh, lying by omission. Yeah. I mean, criminals are held to the same standard. Um, defendants are, are held to the same standard in my eyes. I know that not every uh, judge is perfect, and and unfortunately, I cannot control that um, unless there's some serious crimes going on. But uh, yeah, maybe stop telling me all the details of your cases and I can be on them. Well, I mean, you have other judges, so I figured if I, you know... Can trust yeah, you, you I should be able to trust, you know, a, a judge to make like a, a verdict based off of 
the logic in the conversation and not like a feeling that a cop lied so he's gonna stick it to him or whatever the logic has been in the past i agree with that i agree that you shouldn't have to uh unnecessarily deal with that part of it but um you know when i was the da i i would judge shop and your district attorney should be doing that for you i don't know what larry's doing what is he doing uh he's taking on cases I think. And then he's training some other guy to take on cases, but nobody likes the new guy, so he'll probably be stuck as the Why DA does until like the new guy. I don't know, because he's the new kid. And he mumbles. You can't treat him like that, though, Bobby! I can, especially no, after Cameron with his new shoes and trench coat used to walk no, in through here and waste they will everybody's quit, time. And then when Larry quits, then you will have nothing, and then your officers will be standing in court not knowing how to defend themselves. I mean, they already do that without Larry's help, to be honest. Well, when Larry's there, it goes well. Uh, I guess. What do you mean, you guess? Yeah, I guess it goes well. I mean, it would have been nice if he was part of this other bench trial that shut down, like, four of my warrants and... And did you contact him? Uh, it was it was too late at that point as the trial had already started. I wasn't part of that situation as well. I had just... I was part of a different investigation when I was talking to you, so... I had no way of contacting Larry for that. Yeah, but... I, had to, I had to contact him for the original search and seizure and explain to him everything that I needed while the bench trial was going on. You remember that bench trial where I asked you if you would contact the district attorney? You you straight up asked me why. I have and been, though. So I have been for, like, everything, and I tell everybody to contact him for everything. When they are requesting a judge for a bench trial, they should also be requesting a district attorney. Period. To be honest, I didn't think it was going to go that awful. I didn't hear the details of it up until they were at bench trial. It seemed pretty obvious that a gang shootout took place and cops responded, but hearing the details obviously muddied things up, and it was too late for me to like get Larry to be on that as I was trying to get him to sign off on two other warrants. Well, something important to remember, and you should be telling your officers this, if there is people, I mean, look at the Constitution, it states in there, if all witnesses are That's not available dry. that are crucial to a case, you do not have to do a bench trial. You can uh, wait to file those charges and have Larry deal with all of it. That way you don't even have to spend fucking four or five hours dealing with bullshit. You can literally be like, okay, Larry's going to deal with this, let him go, and then go about your day and go shoot people, whatever you want to do. That's why I keep getting stuck. And bench trials and meetings, Bob. You need a fucking assistant. Well, I I don't really know what an assistant would do in this situation, to be honest. But yeah, I, mean, I, I guess I could have sent them off. Mm -hmm. To have, but the problem is that we needed that bench trial to take place. So maybe if I, I don't know, the whole thing was a fucking mess. I was taking over, like, midday shift when snow went to bed and. I don't know, whatever the fuck was going on. So the whole thing was a shit show. Who's your ass chief? Uh, Tom Metzger. Well, where the hell is Metzger? I never see Metzger. Where is he? He's like on really late. Really, really, really late. And he helps me shoot at like Chang Gang. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But uh, otherwise, right now, it's Malta, and he's technically my assistant to the assistant to the assistant chief of police. Can you fire him? Malton? Yeah. I, I've, I've definitely contemplated it multiple times, but the issue is he actually does the work I tell him to do, so I don't have a good reason to fire him. You know? I would like a written apology. Okay. From him. Yeah, he can do that. He's good at writing. He's very... He was very rude to me. Saw that. Well, I heard about it afterwards. And I used to love Malton, but now I will forever hate him. I think he's... Forever. I think he's jaded after uh, hanging out with me. So I, I can take blame for that. Well. <laughs> well. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry that Thank somebody you. here was mean to you. Yeah, very rude. Very rude. I too. cried. No, you didn't. No, I didn't. I really don't. No, you didn't. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I didn't. So, are you going to fire Bailey or what? Well, you got to get me the goddamn thing. Anyway, these new charges I'm talking about here. Um, what new charges? I'm thinking of uh, money laundering. Um, 
I think we have an embezzlement charge. I'm going to be adding it if we don't. This is for, like, kind of the far future. Um, oh, for the new charges, I see. Uh, money laundering, embezzlement. I mean, any type of... I'd like to see if we can start going after people's accounts. I don't know if, like, we can. I mean, this whole subpoena yeah, in the fast lane the was the actually hall. very interesting. Damn for you. We're... What the fuck is going on the radio? Uh, it was very interesting that uh, so many people were sharing information about businesses, using each other's repo departments, buying and selling cars as repo men, not cataloging the sales. Some people were receiving different commissions than other people were. Not sure who's what manager of which department. There's a lot of money just happening or, or being transacted that's not being accounted for. So you can uh, request a subpoena to look into bank uh, rever- uh, records you know, upon reasonable suspicion, probable cause, etc. Three of the 95s have woken up um, and walking away. What I would like to see happen is... Uh, Corruption, bud. I don't want to say bank robbers, but people who don't have jobs who are uh, continuously doing crime and are millionaires um, tax fraud I mean these people don't have jobs and you know look at what they have so if I see someone with a supercar I can hit them with tax fraud if they're unemployed maybe okay. I mean maybe. I I'm Is gonna try to get that system in place cuffs. I've been trying for a very long time now I don't know if that would fit uh the way the city is, but I'm hoping maybe when shit, when new shit comes around, maybe I don't know. Um, but yeah, tax fraud, uh, embezzlement, money laundering. Um, we have a fraud charge in general, don't we? Yeah, I don't think I've. I can't remember the last time somebody pushed fraud for anything. Pug. Mm-hmm. I mean, we have a casino. You know what I mean? Like if. People really were afraid of the government looking like into clean the, the money. Yeah, I guess they could do that. Um, mm-hmm. If I was a criminal, you know what I would do? I would take $50,000 to PDM and I would invest in PDM. And anytime I needed to launder money, say like $20,000 I got from a bank robbery or something, I would go to PDM and say, hey, I need to hide $20,000. Can you give me $20,000 um, and say that it's an investment return on my $50,000 I gave you last week? There's shit like that. That's what I want to see, the Bob. Pro- the problem is, like, uh, literally everybody is a fucking criminal scumbag. And I could very easily go into anyone who's been arrested in the past week for bank robbery and say that they are a serial bank robber and that's how they make all their money. Right. But if they so, had a way to launder money. Right. They're not they're not doing that, that. But I'm saying if I started going after people now, just out of the blue, I well, think yeah, our uh, internal revenue operation would shut down within 24 hours. Oh, yeah, definitely. So... That's, yeah. I, I tried that when I was a district attorney, and I was told absolutely not. So I'm not saying that's what you should do, but I'm saying hopefully in the future with a money laundering charge, we can at least get something like that rolling. Maybe not for your average bank robber, because maybe they shouldn't have to deal with that. But, you know, the big fish that are out there, the drug dealers, the, the gun traffickers, the fucking hitmen, all that shit. I'm walking anyway. out there, sorry. Uh, that's all for me. Make sure your accountant gets uh, everything over to me. I think in a couple of days you're going to be due for your budget again. There's like nothing that we've been... Well, I guess I, I was trying to get the therapist in here. I don't know where the fuck he's at. We were going to buy the cars from Fast Lanes. We got cucked on that. What happened with that? Uh, Well, they're just not allowing any more cars to be imported. Oh, actually, I want to talk to you about that as well. If you, we're going to have to figure this out because if you yourself go down to fast lanes and buy a car and then you try to use that same car for undercover work, 
I feel that some of the Fastlane's employees who have access to uh, records there might put two and two together. Well, I mean, we talked to the new owner, uh, Miss Strong. She came down volunteeringly um, to talk to us about the investigation. I guess she's a new owner now over there. Uh, it became part of management, like, beginning of this month, around the 3rd. Um, unless she's going to be giving out those reports to other people, which the previous management did, I guess then we can worry about that. Yeah, but the way it works, um, I was talking to Alan about this a long time ago, and I'm very certain it works the same at Fastlanes. Any uh, employees that work there that handle payments or repossessions have a list on their, uh, you know, Fastlane's app that shows them who owns what kind of car, what the license plate is. So if someone is trying to do some street racing and they're like, oh, hey, we just sold that car last week. I can't remember who owns it. Let me check my fucking, my records. And it comes up as Bob Smith. They're going to be like, what's a fucking cop doing at the street race? Yeah, well... So I don't uh, think the, it would the be whole a good the idea. whole issue is complicated to be honest with you. I mean, we can buy we can buy these cars with a different uh, name registration as well. That's what I'm suggesting. I think. Yeah, uh, but the but the issue is like the previous management was letting PDM people have access to their books. So like the PDM's yeah. repo department knew which like cars fast lane was, uh looking for or selling and things of that nature when they shouldn't have been well i'm planning on starting up uh auctions i think repoed cars need to be auctioned off um that way it'd be a lot easier to pass around cars without them being tracked yeah um, it, would be pro it, it would be weird if like say a guy that works repo at pdm knew which cars are up for repo in fast lanes and then went and told someone's in fast lanes to put a government issued order on the website and then when they did that they went and talked to a judge about it and then the judge decided to repo that car that day and then they went themselves repoed the car and then they went down to fast lanes and begged the person who's in charge of selling the repoed cars to sell the car to him mm -hmm. that'd be pretty uh, biased process with the uh, state's involvement allegedly well i don't know how this conversation ended up here um, my, what I'm trying to say to you is, I'm just saying it's, you know, that's the way it's been done. So I'm just, you know, anything that's different from that would be miles ahead of right, where well, we are right now in terms of you know, criminality and, uh, and state what exactly involvement. is Buck's involvement in this? Uh, the allegation was that, uh, Buck had, uh, known that this, uh, took place. And, uh, once he found out about it, he did nothing. Uh, he tried to uh, push it under the rug, and then when I confronted Buck uh, at the pier that day about the repossession, he uh, made it clear that everything was kosher and that uh, no tampering took place, uh, and that I should mind my own business, or something along the lines. I mean, you saw you saw the cross chat with Bailey as well, so very hostile with us uh, doing our investigation under, you know. Okay, uh, do you have any... I don't know what the fuck I was trying to say. We're justice and all that. It's not about, it's not about the cards, it's about justice. There do you have you any current or new evidence uh, regarding Buck's side of it? Because I would like to handle that first. Uh, no, we need to uh, interview people. We need to uh, bring in uh, people today. So hopefully they'll be around. If not, we'll have to send them some emails, get them in the city and talk to them. All right, well... God damn it, I just need you to hurry up on this if you can. Look... Your Honor, okay, uncovering the corruption in the Justice Department is very hard work, all right? It takes a lot of money, too, so... Why is your belt so skinny? It's just a slim-fitting belt. It's weird looking. For a slim man uh, like myself. I don't know about that. Um, yeah, I just... Two, two shots fired in the hospital? I would it's like to handle Buck, since he's he my right hand right now. I, I need to be able to trust him, and if I cannot do that, I need to know. Well... I've got a doctor what I can say is assistance. that uh, transporting to the morgue, I'm going to escort. He may or may not be guilty. Uh, assistance with what? Okay, well, we already know that. Transporting so, these guys to the morgue. I don't know if that Transport. makes yep. it easier uh, we'll, for you uh, or not. We'll no, it doesn't. 
I need to know if he is or, or uh, not. It's just something happening. Someone you work with may have been trying to cover up a crime. Snowing. He's not somebody I work with. He is my right hand and my uh, co chief justice. He's that's all I'm trying to say. Is that your co chief justice. And he's my new best friend. Uh, well, he, he may or may grab, not be doing grab crime. Grab the one in the uh, so. center bed. I'll grab the one that you're currently next to. And then we need another crime would that officer be? to assist transporting at least one officer. Obstruction, probably. Two or two. I've True. got the one that's already out in the lobby. You're right. 10 4. I will be coming back. All right. Well, that's it. Four. I'm going to let you get back to it. All right. If you have any evidence, uh, let me know as well of crime. Well, I can't talk to him about it until you guys figure out what you're doing, so. Well, I can't talk to you until we figure out what we're doing. Well, you just did, so jokes on you. Is it what raining is swords this? out there? What is I haven't this? Been around what is this? But just is this rain or is this hail? Pixel peeps in their chat. You guys got the sweet community over there. The I'm not going to love everyone else. Oh, oh sorry, and sorry. you look in like a whole shenacta day, Mr. Hurt? Alex. Streamer. It was it snowing. Feel good. It feels like needles, but oh, it looks like it's just raining now. What is going on? It was storming and then it started to snow, which is very weird. It is nighttime. The sun and the weather changed. What the hell is going on? Oh fuck that! Nope. And two, and three, and three. Um, I'm sorry, sir. Anyone have an umbrella? I don't have one. Excuse me. Pardon me. What the fuck? <laughs> Just what? what the fuck? Oh. I'm dancing she in the okay? rain. Oh, oh my no, God. she's not okay. Oh my God. Uh, PDD EMS. Can I get a 52 at Mission Row? I think a, a judge just slipped and hit her head on the Chief sidewalk Damn. Uh, from the weather. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. <laughs> yeah, she like, she, she stumbled down the stairs and I think the rain caused her to slip and now she's hit her head and she's on the ground. Hey, son, what's your badge number? 719, sir. Is your face gonna look like that if you ever get hired as a cop? What do you mean? Just a bad looking face. I don't know how to take that. I've looked like this for over two years. Yeah, I just, I'm just saying you could do, probably do better. Like what? I don't know, different hair, maybe. I, could, uh, I mean, yeah, I could get a haircut. It's not that big of a deal. Yeah. I could probably grow my facial hair out differently, I guess. Yeah, just anything besides, like... You know, default Daniel, but anyway. You look like default Daniel with blonde hair. What do you mean, sir? Hey, listen, all right, keep up that attitude. You're never going to be part of this department. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and clean up your car. You, uh, you can see that now, Mom. Morgue, by the way. Uh, it's oh okay, God, bro. It's gonna be the blocks again. It's They're okay, gonna try and bro. kill us again. It's just scuff, bro. Did you guys see it start snowing? <laughs> Did it was snowing? Yeah. yeah. I said to one of the. Is this judge okay? Hey, I Mina. Said, this is Chief Justice Cassia. I have to go oh, change my face. I think she head. hit her head too much. She's Why? making up names the for herself. The chief of police said if I want to change the PD, I have to change it. All right, and well, that's a lawful order. Here. Go change your face. Seven, if you could grab I don't think it's a lawful order. It is. You might have to go get some plastic surgery uh, from uh, the last one. Other yeah. than the one Ripley has who uh, takes care of himself. Is she a doctor okay, anymore? Did you get attacked a a by a bike? Or... Yeah, I tried getting you by car and a bike just flipped to the air and murdered me. It's the wind. The wind, you know, carried it. The wind carry a bike and have my head. Do you want to go to the we're like mid monsoon right now, it wouldn't surprise me. I don't want to go to Pillbox. No. <sighs> You're gonna be okay. <laughs> that was really funny, actually. Yo, Juicy Wilbur, 18 months. Haven't been around as much, but recently met a few no pixel peeps in VR chat. You guys get a sweet community over there. Much love, everyone. Oh, you looking like a whole snack today, Mr. Alex. Streamer Sir Alex Check. Yo, I appreciate that, Juicy. Yeah, Krykos with the 18 months, appreciate that as well. Trash and Anonymous gifting uh, 70 bucks. Guys, thank you so much. Merry birthday. 
appreciate you. This content is not worth that money, but hey, <laughs> you know, I'll fucking take it. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but actually, thank you. I do appreciate it. It does mean a lot that uh, you're dropping uh, bills on your boy. You can buy a, a bed skirt for my bed now. <laughs> Haven't had one. It looks like shit. Oh, I recovered the uh, trash bin, by the way. I guess a neighbor just had it and they just like left it out for trash day. Like they kept it and then like I didn't have it. So when it was trash day, like I couldn't put my trash in it. But then there, but the, like my trash bin was next to my garage door. Which is actually nice because um, I would have had to have made a police report. So I was uh, contemplating going down to the police station tomorrow and filing a report. Because once you make the report and you call up your trash company, that's when they send you a new trash bin. You need to make a formal police report though first. So I wasn't looking forward to it, but yeah. Uh, luckily, uh, I don't know. I got it back, I guess. So not a big deal. Uh, 202 from 320. Go for 202. Uh, we're currently in the incinerator room on the far north side of the, uh... Complaining about the trash bin, I remember the first time I got yeah. old. No, my trash well, bin got stolen, dude. Boxes. It got stolen. Boxes. What's That's not being old, that's just being... I don't know, that feels like a young adult thing, dude. You know what I'm saying? That can't, that can't, that doesn't make me old, bro. Come on, Elvis. It seems like there's always some sus activity with the neighbors and trash wherever you live. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of true. There's just a lot of kids here. And as a result, a lot of sus activity goes down. I don't know, it's like, there's like, like, 10 or 15 fucking kids at any given moment out here in this neighborhood. And I'm just like, I'm just trying to chill, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully I don't need to have any more Just attracts the bin gremlins. Uh, Next time it'll be a call about loud music at 2 a.m. No, the, the two times I've called the police out here was one time when some guy was like, like riding around with his buddy at 2 a.m. peering into car windows and trying to jimmy doors. And I was like, I was up at like 2 a.m. And I was like, I saw this like head, the, I saw headlights of a car go by my, uh, you know, window very slowly. And I was like. That's weird. Why is someone driving so slow right now? So just like getting on the road like a normal person. And I looked out the window and there was a guy like looking into windows and his buddy was pulling the car next to him very slowly. So that's when I was like, all right. And that's when I called the police department. I was like, yeah, this guy's like doing some sus shit. Um, and then the second time was like, I used to have these very, very loud neighbors. Uh, meaning that like, They'd always be outside yelling and shit, like at each other mostly. I heard a lot of uh, interpersonal two, two, drama. Uh, and this was out here. We are ready to incinerate. And uh, it was like, it was getting well. It wasn't. It wasn't later at night, but they had a couple kids, and I think, I, I, I'm not sure how it worked, but like I think the dad was like a stepdad. I, I can't remember exactly how it went. But basically, they would just be out there yelling all the time. So my window was like. Pretty much across the uh, across the street from where they lived, um, or across the uh, sorry the driveway from they lived, and so because it's a it's a, it was a complex right it was townhomes and shit, and uh, they'd be out and they'd be like oh like you fucking you know you asshole like you know my real dad kind of shit so it was whatever but it wasn't until uh, like Block just robbed me and said he's gonna murder cops for me for. <laughs> Uh, we're just down the hall. I, I'm not really in charge. So. PD from EMS, do you have any fuel to burn the people or do you want me to bring something? Uh, oh, we've got worry. some. Don't worry. Don't worry. Stand don't stop the show before you miss us there with the fire extinguisher. No, this one's not going out. Uh, so anyway, one of the days, it was pretty much like the kids were out there yelling for a long time about some shit, and I ignored it for the most part. But it was like when 
one of the kids was just like, I guess he was screaming at the dad back and forth. He just like, is no one going to call the cops? Is no one going to help us? Is no one going to call 911? That's when I was like, I bet. And uh, <laughs> your boy, I mean, I didn't call 911 actually. I called the uh, local police department. It was like, yo, some shit happening here. That's when the cops showed up and there was this like, you know, big argument that happened with the cops and uh, all this other stuff. And <laughs> I guess I found, I found out through proxy and that's when chat used to, that's when chat roasted me. Uh, because one of the, one of the, like the kids, the teenage daughter or something had like a warrant out or some shit. And so like they had to scoop her up as a result of all of this. And chat was like, you fucking snitch and all this shit. Which, I don't know how the fuck I was supposed to know that the daughter had a, a warrant. I don't know. I, I don't remember what, you know, I don't, I don't know how that was my issue. The only reason I, you know, called the cops was number one, no one was helping at all with whatever they were doing. I don't think anybody wanted to, because like, quite frankly, I don't think anyone's going to step into family drama. But the only reason I called was because the kid was screaming for somebody to call cops. So at that point, I'm like, okay, like, I'm going to call the cops. <laughs> I should have just check my MDT true. Like, listen, I don't feel bad about it at all. It was just, uh, chat back in the day when I told this story, we're like, oh, what the heck, dude? Why'd you call the cops? You should snitch. It ain't rushing for you to snitch. I don't know, man. Is it rushing for me? Or should I have just gone over there and be like, hey, 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 hey. you know? The dad was like twice my size, by the way. Like, so, and he was very loud and very aggressive. I'm not walking over there and being like, what's going on here, neighbors? What's happening? What's the, what's the, what's happening here? A little bit of a, little bit of yelling, a little bit of family drama, a little bit of a, a little bit of a problem. You guys are being pretty loud. Like, I'm good, dude. Echo 2 is 10 41. Okay, but I saw him in peeing in the driveway while I was an ice cream truck and told him I should call the police and they came and the guy ended up fighting the cops and getting killed by them. Alright, that beats my story, bro. For real. Radio check. Thank you. Back your dispatch is 41. Okay, so hey Alex I'm a big fan back when you had that Transformers head yeah great times anyways here's a banger just for you a bless up I'm trying to understand what happened here. My, this this report was just forwarded to me. Dispatch to Echo 2. Do you have the location on that? I don't. Actually. Oh, awesome. 
So, uh, Brian Knight. Responded to a call, the copper pot stabbed somebody. And these people were stabbed and their limbs were removed. But it's unknown whether the limbs remover will done post death. Ten four. But the individual's blood to death, and Troy believes that the cut on Bugsy's face alone wouldn't have caused it. I'm gonna go talk to Troy. Because the dispatch call shows that they found some bodies that were like partially dismembered and also That's copper so pot was like in the dispatch call said I stabbed some people. So now I'm trying to figure out whether she was arrested if there's a warrant out for murder or like what did these these buffoons do last night where they Discover dead bodies and the person that stabbed them called 911 and said they stabbed people. So I'm trying to understand what the fuck happened last night. I'm trying to look for Copper Pot to see if she was arrested. Which I'm not getting. I mean, actually, this might be earlier in the day. You guys can talk about the you can search you can search her incidents. Is that true? Oh, you're right. Okay, so I don't see anything for murder. <laughs> this was three days ago. What the fuck? Okay. Alright. Thanks, uh thanks Malton. I forgot about that. Wait, that was a month ago? No, this was this month. Wait, this was a month ago. What the fuck? Hold on. When was this report taken? This was this month. Okay, so she hasn't been arrested since then. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. All right, so she hasn't been arrested at all. Okay, I'm gonna go talk to Choi because Choi's on this. I mean, I don't have... I'll have to send an, a formal email to the junior investigators that had a murder suspect last <laughs> night admit to... Oh, that's too funny. Okay, I'm gonna deal with that. I'm gonna press, bring the charger out, even though I just talked shit about it. It does look pretty cool in the weather, though. It's me. Oh, hey, Bob. Um, yeah, somebody tried to get me to go open the door for them at the morgue, and I wasn't too sure if there was something going on there. Gotcha. Is Troy around? Uh, there's def there's around definitely here. something going on at the morgue because there's like eight units over there. I think they had like oh. some type of cult thing happening where they shot some bodies and the bodies resurrected. What so, the fuck? yeah, so that's I think what they're dealing with. I think they're dealing with zombies. Dispatch, is there a zombie situation at the morgue currently? Uh, Colton. <laughs> Copy that. Oh. Oh. Hey. Angel, are you coming outside as well so I can lock the door behind you? Potentially. Uh, oh my god, we got ghosts attacked with us. I'm leaving the morgue. Fuck this. Okay, so same traffic. We had zombies and ghosts. Uh, yeah, Troy was around earlier, so I, I gotta, I gotta mm -hmm. go talk to her. I'll be advised that I think Mike Block stole a vehicle from in front of the morgue. I'd also recommend checking a vehicle because they could be trying to like steal them. Hey, for my vehicle's been stolen. Yeah, I really want the the radio effects back. They were so cool. We're gonna have a LSPD Taurus has been stolen from outside of uh, the morgue. Ten four. Uh, three twenty is going ten forty two. You guys have a good one. Stay safe. 
Happy 320, showing you 42, 523. Bismuth, thank you for three months. Uh, so Stone Man, appreciate it. A Lonely Hawk with the six months as well. Thank you guys for those resubs. Thank you for using Prime subs as well. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Hoggers. Remember that one time Alex made the radio noise and everyone else followed? Like that shh. <laughs> On the test server, I think it was. An ambulance, dead people everywhere. Oh my god. What the fuck is that? Echo 2 is 76 to the latest 911. Oh my god, okay. Uh, 309 is going to 76 uh, to the latest 911 as well with Echo 2. Different cars. They left? What do you mean they left? They were all just thrown into different cars. People were thrown into a police car. They all. Oh my god, there was so much shooting. They robbed which me. Way, which way did they go? Uh, what went. Oh god, one, one went that way. One went that way. Okay. It was like. What kind of there cars? There like six of them. A police car and then like a yellow, like, super car. Okay, thank you. Code oh my god. Them. Yeah, it's it's code four. I guess the bodies were scooped up and put into cars. One, a yellow sports car. The other is the uh, stolen Taurus, I believe. And they took off uh, northbound or uh, eastbound. Ten four. The reason I'm going to code six for the uh, vehicles with the bodies. Cops are all driving the street used to seem like surround sound. Oh yeah, one like in your neighborhood. Yeah, that's kind of how I felt like when I lived in LA. Sometimes I'd hear noise and I'd have to be like, is that me or is that, you know, is that outside? Dispatch, I believe I have eyes on the stolen Taurus, now northbound, uh, Elgin. Occupied four times to uh, pressing additionals for the uh, stolen Taurus northbound Elgin, Hillbox Hill. Perfect seven and up. Uh, two, two. I'd love to assist, but I'm locked in the morgue and I can't get out. Copy. I understand there's a ghost situation All right, turn happening. Turn on the sirens. Locked in the All morgue right, and there's ghosts attacking us. Turn it off. Take later, three months. We know you turn off the vehicle. If you're gonna take your phone out and you're gonna oh, do that, that's gonna unlock it. Turn Stop. the car off. We need off. the lights on. Clear that. Driver. It's off. Roll down your window and toss the keys out on the road. CHND. Do it now. Pull over. Roll the window down and toss the keys on the road, driver. I think. Da, 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 da. Come on, party with us! It's time to party. Did you guys know that you again. guys are being illegal? Toss the keys <gasps> out. I will be in a pursuit of that. Someone's car is heading westbound. So, the East Avenue traffic is non existent. Weather is shitty. Uh, speed by 100. 309 secondary. Weather is indeed very shitty. Continuing westbound San Andreas Avenue. Vehicle occupied four times. Stolen LSPD Taurus. Vehicle spun out. Obviously, uh, 
They've never been inside a cop car before. Looks like hard 1050. Wheels disengaged. We're gonna go after the driver here, here red haired. Put your 26. We San Andreas hey, Avenue. The, the, uh, the Driver's the cracking up, I believe. And we continue to follow him off of North Rockford. Stop running. Make this easier for yourself, all right? I don't want to tase you. It's going to hurt. So just give yourself up. It's not part. Party's over, man. Party's shut down, okay? The party is shut down, sir. Just give yourself up, okay? Don't make, you don't want me to run after you. You do not want me to run after you. Turn the ground, juke! So I'm gonna go back to my vehicle make sure you don't steal it. Get eyes on one. It's gonna be topless, uh, Fedora. I just yelled at me that I'm topless. We're gonna be headed towards Del Piero Pier or Del Piero Freeway. I still got the driver here. He's uh, by the police station, I believe, on Marathon Avenue. Taser to the flood. Fucking bench! Bench! I told you he's gonna fucking hurt. What are you doing? Just give yourself up, okay? Just make it easy. Okay. All right. One ninety-five. I'm gonna keep tasing you. I'm gonna keep tasing you until I have to beat the shit out of you. Okay. The party. Okay. Oh, I'm done. The party's over. Stop it! Stick the fuck down. Stop the party, please. Taser, taser, taser. I'm just all on right, the ground. Right. Don't hit me. Like me. We just found human remains in a little <laughs> part down here. Oh, all not. right. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do can only be used against you in the court of law. You have the right There's to an attorney. If you can't afford an attorney, won't be provided for you by the state. Do you understand your rights as they've been read to you, sir? But uh, can I get the party yeah, attorney? Uh, dispatch, we have 195 the driver of the stolen Taurus. Uh, sir, the driver. I saw. What do you mean? I'm the I'm the one that's saying you're the driver. I saw you get out of the driver's uh, side oh, of the car. Yeah. Hold on. Okay. Okay. That's why I went after Check you in the first place. Thing. What's this bulge you got in your pocket here, sir? It is my uh, pistol. You got a pistol on you? Do you have a gun? Do you have a license for that gun, sir? Da. You do? I have gun license. Da. Oh, well, okay. Holy shit, you actually do have a gun license. Why would I not? <laughs> okay. I we were just planning. Now, hold on, hold on. We, have, we, we have a problem. We have a problem. Okay, we have a, we have a problem here, sir. Uh, no, what's the problem? You have a gun license, but... That's not, that's not a licensed gun that you can purchase in this city, okay? That's an illegal firearm that you have. Oh, I do not know. You did not no, know when I you don't... bought the license that you can't purchase it's illegal firearms with it? Officers. No, I did not know this but firearm. Now... Illegal. It was given to me. And I was like, ah, okay, you know, it doesn't matter if I, you know, buy it from a gun shop or he gives it to me. I have gun license. Now, sir, I... If, if this firearm comes back to an officer, that's going to be more problems for you as well, okay? Oh, no. Wait, I did not know this could be a poli policeman. Yeah, this this, uh, this, this could be out. very, very bad for you. So I'm going to oh, no, this... bring you back to the station. No, no. We're going to figure it out. You got some oh, drugs right. on you as well? 421, I'm going to have the radio uh, standby. I'll uh, no. 311 it. Well, I have uh, what do you mean, no, you was, know, was a bottle Mario of painkillers on you. I, got Tony Corleone's I thought that was legal. Yeah. Painkillers are not... No, sir, painkillers are not legal. Uh... In, in this, in this, uh... Oh, that's not legal either! No, they're not. Yet. Oh, oh. Sorry, there was a... Cockroach well. that crawled up on your back. Oh, okay, that's fine, that's fine. I mean, we are right next to a trash can. Famous? Can I get a 52 on North Rockford Drive to assist with the uh, taser problem removals? Yeah. Yeah. I, I can break that. these cuffs! You can't break those cuffs. I can break these cuffs! You can't break those cuffs. 
I can break those cuffs, no. Anything else on you that I should know about? Anything else that you, you should know about? That, uh, well, the party never stops. I mean, what else do you want to know? Okay, what, uh, what are these? What are what? These, what are these? I don't know, debit card. I found on ground. Debit cards? But that does it not look like debit card? They they look oddly like those uh, cards that are used to access bank trucks. Blood <laughs> what? Yeah, with like the encryptor on them. These are these are worn out. I'm not gonna be seeking to press any criminal charges. I'm just wondering well, why well, you have two of these. Well, I just found them on ground. I was like, what? Oh, no, debit card. I wonder what I can do with that. You know, make it into a you know like a guitar uh, pick. You know. You want to turn these like, debit cards into guitar picks? Da, 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 da. You even have like special cutters that you can use on uh, plastic cards or debit cards to make guitar I picks. Really I'm glad of that. Okay. Uh, 457 hey, sir? from 309. Hello. 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 Pretty lady. Hello. Did you, uh, did you happen to impound that Taurus? Oh, another pretty lady. Where's, where'd you Copy get that. these? Uh, the vehicle's coached for I went in and took pictures of it as well. It's going to be mine. Alright, I'm heading up on the rooftop. Shit. I'm gonna be on the Pacific Mouse. Okay, okay, okay. I'll take it over to the Pacific Mouse. How many times did you get tased? Well, at least four. Alright. I'm gonna do it one by one, alright, sir? Da, da. Three, two, one. Ay, ay! Alright, again. Ay, ay! Three, two, what? Ay, 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 ay. Let her! Can't you take them out a bit better? Little one, two, three. Ah! Her! Why? It's I disregard. I got. I took a picture of Bobby's car. That's Bobby. my fault. No, look at me, policeman. See, party never stops. Where did the other vehicle crash out? The only problem is I'm in handcuffs. Uh, I, there you know. go. There you go. Because I've got one that's directly in front of Vespucci right, PD. Four of those spots there. Yeah, that's the, that's the one that they used, I believe, the the Taurus. Hey, from, okay, so they sold your car then, apparently, Bobby. Uh, and yeah, I, so I'm still gonna have one that's missing. Uh, okay, I don't know how they easy. stole my nice. car. Um, that's weird, because I I impounded it, but. Okay. Are you sure? Did you run the license or registration on that car? Yeah. The Taurus that crashed out. Okay. Uh, yeah, it comes back to you, sir. That's that's really weird. I I crashed uh, my Taurus on uh, the freeway uh, like an hour ago, but I impounded it, so I'm not sure how they managed to steal one. Hey, bro, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this one then. Uh, the individual or with no. the uh, oh. yellow pants or yellow shorts. I did was come he, back. Uh, was he a passenger? But I went to Mission Row. So they stole from Mission Row. Uh, I'm I'm not certain. Uh, pro probably because I got I got the driver in custody. So everyone else that you got from that is is a passenger. Mm -hmm. Take care, hey, sir. Good to go. Uh, Four twenty one EMS. Ladies. Go for EMS. All right, sir. What's I your need name? Some taser prong removals. Uh, Dennis. Next, or across from Best Dennis. Dennis. Da. We're gonna Dennis. be on the corner of Best, or San Andreas and okay, Dennis, uh, North Rockford Drive. No, Dennis Blatovic. Dennis Blatovic. Where'd you steal my car? That was <laughs> that was your car. Yeah, that was my car. Well, uh, we just found it on the side of the road. Was it at Mission Row? Did you steal my fucking yeah. car from Mission Row? No. Don't fuck with me, Dennis. Okay, it was mission, bro. Dennis, god fucking damn it, man. No, I'm you sorry. stole my fucking I'm... car in front of Mission Row, and then you want to party with it. Ah, it's beautiful. It's like disco lights, you know. 
Alex, Come on! Look how well. bright these lights are! They, look! Dispatch, I just see... got word that the driver of the vehicle stole my car from in front of Mission Road. So, that explains that. Mother! So, you know we just want to have good time, we didn't do anything bad with it. Yeah, besides crashing it, going a hundred and fucking something miles per hour. Well, that's Dennis. your fault. You wanted to stop the party. You could have joined party and said, hey, you know, pass key over. I'm like, oh, okay, you know, have your car back. I did. Was, know, wasn't it obvious when I pulled you over and told you to toss the keys out the party was over at no, that point? No, you could have gotten out of car. We wanted to all get out of car to have party. I, did get, I so did get out of my car. I got out of my car and pointed a gun at you. Exactly. See, that hostile, but we wanted to have innocent, nice party. Okay, well, I'm sorry for being so hostile when you stole a government vehicle and went on a party uh, rampage with it. Well, well, that, we did. Probably, I probably could have been less hostile me. with that. Well, yes, we even said, hey... Dispatch, I believe I have Mike Block here off of Elgin Avenue. There's a... They're about to stab I think, they're, I think they're trying to stab somebody. I'm gonna need 77 in front of Pillbox. Oh shit, it's the fence! Peel out! Peel out! Peel out! What the fuck is going on here? Get in, I get in! Mike, Mike, give yourself up! No! Mike, put the knife down! Mike, put the knife down! Oh, for real, dog. He's speaking bad. Vehicle's taking off northbound, now left onto Del Piero. They're gonna be continuing westbound. Get occupied four times. Appears to be an Audi SUV. Hey, Jason! Oh no, there she is, there she is. Tessa, you all good? Tessa? Miss, are you okay? No. No? He's trying to kill me. <laughs> That's so funny! You I, I understand, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to, we're gonna try to get him, okay? Sorry, it's all my happy pills! Are you, okay. are you hurt, Miss Tessa? I, no, I'm not hurt. Okay. Thank you for being. I'm sorry. I'm a little shaken up. Hey, He's putting me. I see you twice in the last two weeks. Um, you've what? He's put me in the ICU twice in the last two weeks. Okay, well let's try to stay out of the ICU, okay? Please if, keep if you... showing up and trying to kill me. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna try to stop him, okay? But if if you do see him again, you know, try to let us know or. Maybe, maybe be around some friends so you're not by yourself if they're targeting you. Okay. Okay. We got a pretty busy fucking city today, so we're gonna try our best to to be in the area. But you know, uh, we, we can't guarantee that we can protect you everywhere you go. Okay. 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 Well, I'll try to be safe. Thank All right, Miss Tessa. Much. The cell box is very safe as well. Obviously, if you want to hang around the uh, Mission Road Police Station, you can do that. All due respect, sir, the last time I got attacked was in the middle of Mission Rose Lobby. But I appreciate it. Hey, we tried setting war terms. War terms? <laughs> Alright, I, I gotta go. I need... I know what you're thinking back there. Don't even think about it. Think about what? Dispatch, be advised, uh, Mike Block and gang are continuing to try to, uh, kill Miss Tessa. If you see her around, try to keep an eye on her. No, see, he was violent. Why didn't you go after him? What do you mean I did? I mean, I mean, I gave, I it, I gave been... it my best attempt. Did you not see? That was very bad. I mean, you didn't even chase him. What do you him. mean? There was like four of them. What am I going to do? Like be Robocop yeah, and like fight four him. of them with knives and shit? No, no, in car. You chase him in car. With you in the back, no. That's against, yeah, uh, that's against her SOPs. No, we don't do that. Ah, uh, all right. Sorry, sorry. That's okay. It's okay. okay. It's alright. It's alright. You didn't know. You didn't know. Am I really gonna go to jail for partying? Yeah, I mean, didn't the kid from Project X go to jail? Or did he not? Well, I can't remember. I mean, our party was not that bad. We didn't set anything on fire or explode anything. Did or they explode? kill anyone. Actually, I, I haven't seen Project X, if I'm being honest with you. Well, I mean, honestly, I just know it existed, it, and, and that kid went like in an interview and like got you know bullied yeah. some people or something like that. Yeah, the that, the that, interviewer was like, "Are you proud of what you did?" And he's like, "Hell yeah, it was a wild party." Not that, but uh, the movie is like, well, it's not a good movie. 
The movie's not good. I can't imagine no. it would be good. No, the the story is interesting and funny, but the movie itself very bad. Dispatch two oh, two. come on, on we were just having fun there. Don't be the party pooper. Dispatch, did Tessa really get stabbed inside of our lobby at some point? Yeah, Mike Black stabbed her a couple days ago. Okay, I offered that to her as a safe haven, but apparently she's safe nowhere. Yeah, Ephraim, she's Come not safe. Come on, man, let me... Come on. Now I gotta see about giving you, like, max Maybe times the and plans and shit. No, don't do that. It was just the innocent party. Bro, no, it wasn't, all right? I'm a... What do you mean it wasn't? I'm a straight-edge cop, okay? I'm gonna give you by the book everything. Eh, hey, don't be by book. Don't be by book. Call me a ba book. You're a ba book, okay? No, I said don't be by the book. I don't know what a ba book is, okay? Dennis the Menace. Blit. What? I like that nickname. How do you spell Dennis? D E N I S. Oh, there you are. Pretty. I mean, you're a violent offender, but otherwise, you have a pretty small record. What do you mean, violent offender? Like, you've been tagged as a violent offender before. I'm gonna need to take some pictures of you. No, I am not violent at yeah, all. Come on, we're gonna go take some pictures. Ah, damn it. Just around. put the, uh, you know, uh, so I can walk at least. Come on. Be humane. Be humane, aren't you from uh, the Gulag? <laughs> well, well, that. But I would, you know, like you to be. I just humane. figured. I just figured you'd be fine with me being a little rough around the edges with you. Well, that's why I moved here. To escape. <laughs> you son of a. B no, I'm not going anywhere. Dude, don't try me, okay? Is chat My... offline? Oh no. I was like confused for a second. I had two different chat messages up. We just chilling, dude. This is for fifty-seven back and That was my chance. <laughs> you know, uh, you know anything about Tennessee versus Garner? Yeah. Uh, see what? Okay. Uh, go ahead and line up against the. Uh... I'm done. Just vibing. Dope, dope. Actually, Dennis, I'm gonna have you uh, remove your face mask. No, 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 don't do yeah, that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, come on. Let me have the mask, uh, the no. picture of the mask. I for a couple minutes. No, I need you with man. the mask off. Come on, Bobby, man. Come no, on. no, there's no Bobby, man, okay? We need to see your face. It. All right. What's wrong with your face? Why, yeah, why are you so scared of showing it? Grove. No, I just uh, wanted a cool picture. For 57 and out. Yeah, but the problem is that or 21. if we ever go to court and we base your profile off of your, like, half mask, it'll get tossed out. All right. It's gonna be registered to Chet Man. Well, I feel like a model. Individuals. My price is five five thousand per picture. So, is that so? There. Why is What's it your five, location? Why is it five thousand per picture? Grove Street. All right, we're good here. Because I'm a model. All right, so to the I'm active a model lady with uh, it. You found Covenant. You know, for Edward Rainey, right? Something Roy Lowenstein. Advertising of what? Crime? Left, no. eastbound, Dutch London. Anything. Oh, yes, look at. Left, eastbound, continuing Dutch London. Seven seconds. There you know, West on Carson Avenue. Across you from Maybe this one. <laughs> we got two in this vehicle if you want me to take comments there, Grandma. Sure, go for it. Oh, okay. oh, westbound, Carson oh, Avenue. Look. Oh, jukes. Oh, blip. Oh, come on, please tell me it's all locks, please. Pass and form, continuing westbound. 
Come on, that's not Cross funny. Cross the train tracks, really transitioning northbound Alta. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, I wait, first. Cross I the Vespucci, continue northbound Alta. You lost Alta. your... Oh, sorry. Walking yeah, around the... privileges now. Force of habit. He just jumped in onto the freeway. It is wrecked multiple times. Oh, come on. Let me just walk that old yeah. door. Yeah. Stable there on foot. Oh, come on. They're running towards Integrity Mr. Way. Police, man. Never again, yeah, Dennis. Just... Never again. Four individuals. You're now the running guy. Uh, one's going to be Tony Corleone. Oh, man. Other ones are wearing masks. Oh, they're, taking, they're running up sad. the exit to Makes me very, very sad. Wait, why, why am I going in here? I don't know. I just I don't want to walk all the way. What? I feel like I'm let me, in let me, see, let me look at you. Is this better, well, sir? Well, if you're going to run around... <laughs> one oh, smoking up. Wait, what? I'm going oh. back in. I'm going yeah, back boy. in. I'm going back in. I will beat your ass. No, 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 no. Come up me. Just, she'll beat your ass. Come here I'm for the things of ours. Everyone is uh, heading Come westbound. Come around. Right. Um, Let's get an umbrella on. There's individuals running back towards the uh, Elganon ramp. Two of them are, uh, all three are up on Elgin now, getting into, or trying to get into the vehicle. Let him do his thing. I did not beat the off chief westbound. of police. What are you talking uh, one about? One is running, said, getting yes. into a vehicle. Tony's said, getting into a vehicle. It's a four-door SUV. No, I you let him do his not. thing then. Let the chief of police take also, a couple hits. Also, I did not know you're chief of police. Come back to sure. Hey! Oh, wow. Well, I'm going to save his ass. Oh, Lorraine, hey, ma'am, I'm SUV. not talking to you. Lorraine. We, uh, we got him out of the vehicle. We're going to talk now right in front of pillbox. Well, then leave. He broke out of cuffs. He's now running westbound. I'm talking to boss man here. Towards the psychiatrist's to office. He will. All right, Dennis, you got a charge of a class one firearm, the joyriding charge. They're, uh, the they're cracked out of their mind. They're running very quick. Yeah. He's going to be on power complete. now. I'm offering you parole, even Victor, though you're you uh, some of the total piece of shit. The FIP building they're what do you over? mean, piece of shit? I was just partying. 10 9 now? How much? How, how many, how many months am I looking at here? Uh, 21. Oh, 10 4. Okay, I'm guilty. Uh, Rivley, let's help her. She, they're coming right at us I'm right here. I'm very guilty. Why'd you do it? Parting my ass. He's got a knife in his hand. That's what the. Uh, what, do you mean, what do you mean why I did that? Because I was partying. Party. We party hard. Hmm. Good. See, we, uh, the hospital. He may be trying to take his hostage. Cooker. And, uh, you're, uh, he's he's just, just so you're, so you're the guy he found the cop car then. Go on lower fill box uh, now. Yeah. He didn't find the car. He found okay, the cop car in front of Mission box. Road. I'll watch no, the doors so we're going to lower. I'll wait. Is he the one that we reported streaming down the highway with it? Um, ah, maybe. see, we tried to call DOC to a party at prison. You guys did not come. Oh, shit. Da, so we actually had party. Da, da. Party! What? Da, da! You know! Oh no! Mr. Uh, boss man here, uh, Party Pooper! They pulled us over and we were like, hey, it is our chance to party with the police. And then, you know, he pointed gun. Party stopped. Man. Whoa, yeah, that's... um, you know, I could be a... I could be oh, a, sorry, a I'm gonna part... answer that, all right. Is that okay? No. Well, you didn't take my phone. Okay, I'm gonna take your weapons license if you answer it. Okay, all right. Uh, there you guys are. You have, oh, a, you have a, a decently low criminal record. Bleh. Um, I don't believe that uh, you, you didn't know about the gun... Uh, but I'm only I giving you a class not... one uh, possession charge as opposed to taking your license outright. You're not to possess any okay. form of legal firearms, but seeing as, like I said, you have a decently uh, low criminal record, I'm, I'm going to be letting you retain your weapons license. But if you're caught with another weapon like that again, and the officers look at your record, uh, and they see that you have a heavy pistol, they will take it next time, okay? Yeah, all the right. Okay. Okay. Um, Look at that 20 months and uh, 21 months in Bolenberg. I got a DOC here. Do you guys want to bring him up or how do you want me uh, to do this? Just send him let's go. Roll three. Yeah, we can bring him up. Okay. Go ahead and turn around. Blah, blah. You'd say he's a low threat, yeah? Uh, decently low threat. He can be violent, but he didn't attack me. It seems like he just had a rager that uh, ended His with him crashing Dennis. a that police car. Enough. 
Honestly, I don't know why I'm flagged as violent. Maybe just come off violent. All right, it's 21 months. So he's already been fine. Go ahead and take him whenever you guys want. Okay. Uh, Lisa, we're I'll going to bring him up. Aaron, you are going to have to go up separately because there's no reason. Do you want me to wait here for um, Anita? Uh, can I pull out Aaron right? one here at the winery she, she, because she, that's Scott? If it's Scott, it's your friend. Yeah, okay, <laughs> sure. Thank you. Mr. Bossman, next time. Come on, don't ruin party. Okay, you next time don't steal a police car. Wait here for Anita while you guys take her out. No, it's party car. We were wait, party you... police. All right, have fun. Hey, is my face better? Uh... I changed it. Wait, no, I hardly you recognize you. Back? Uh, negative. I'm good. I've got an air one. That's wrong. <laughs> 421 transitioning temporarily to Sterling one. She messaged me back. Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah. Oh, shit. I think I broke my voice box. Did you hear what I said? Yeah, I did. Okay. And please tell me you're joking. No, I'm not. All right, there's a black and color. No difference. Uh, black and color, color show cat pulling up on the top here. See what you said. Hello, Miss Dispatch. Uh, this right here is Super defeated. Jackie Snow. Jackie Snow, Dispatch. 421. I'm currently coming what? back to the city, ma'am. I got promotion to Trooper. No, I no, I know who Snow is. Where's oh, my okay. fucking promotion? This is bullshit. Okay, never mind. Where's my promotion? People can't take jokes. Your promotion. You know what? As trooper, I'm promoting you. You're an officer now. Thank you. See, Snow. This is this is why Snow's my chief. Snow. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Bites and mind, you see that. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Oh my god. <laughs> Where's Choi? I don't know. Her about something. Is she getting stabbed uh, or kidnapped or balded? Is she, getting, is she getting scalped? <laughs> Stop fucking laughing. I'm, so, I'm sorry. Hey, everybody good after the fucking ghost shit? I'm back in the city now. Is that what? Ghost shit? Uh, I think the other ghost situation sounds like it's over. Oh, okay. Yeah, me and the cops were attacked by fucking ghosts in the morgue. It does happen, uh, sometimes, you know? When you disturb spirits like that. Yeah, but I actually, I actually got punched, and it actually fucking hurt me, and then I got carried through the fucking void. Well, maybe, it maybe it's something you did in your past life, and it's carrying forward, you know? I don't know. Maybe. And then I get out to my yester, and there's a GPS coordinate all the way up in the middle of fucking nowhere outside of Mount Gordo. I go there. I hear footsteps and people running through fucking bushes, but I couldn't find them. What the fuck? I know I, I, I sound think you're possessed, crazy, man. You should probably get away from me. I don't want any of your haunting. Yeah, great. Thanks, Bobby. I'm just saying, he's, you're probably possessed, man. Yeah, but dude, haven't you seen any horror movies or played any horror video games? The, the, the police are always the end goal to get to to protect you. Nah, dude. man. Nah, we, we we ain't dealing with that shit. That, fuck that. Oh, We're not, fuck we don't, get, on, we don't get paid enough to deal with that. Yeah, but... I'm pissed. Try, like, uh, I don't know, get your friends to, like, I don't know, exercise you or something. Yeah, because Eastside Bottle Gang is going to fucking listen to anything I just told you. They're going to think I'm stupid, punch me in the asshole, and... Rob a bank. This is Choi. Right, Choi, you ran a red light. I gotta write you a ticket. Uh, I stopped. Well, you're not supposed to, you're like supposed to run the red light. I stopped. Yo, you, you nice. I just it. started listening to Rasta music last week. Hey. All right. What's up, Bobby? Totally not about your eye, huh? Uh, no, I gotta talk to you real quick. Okay. Oh, he got his eye back. I just realized. Nice. Fuck you, Choi. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys pat him down? Uh, 202 negative. What the fuck 
Normally, I shoot people for hitting the ester. Just so you know. Just so you fucking know. The ester. 42176 to MRP. There's somebody on the, the bridge just got. <laughs> <laughs> um, Shut up, bitch! He's sad! They're, <laughs> they're by those, uh. Yeah, they just got in a little vehicle. Alright, so what's actually going on? Uh, high Power Street? Uh, there was a body that was, or right two bodies that were brought in a pillbox last night. E I, I noticed that you were on call for, uh, for them. Yes. I was just wondering if, uh, if if you recall anything like happening from that. Um, we're still waiting for autopsies, but. Okay. I know that uh, Brian and uh, uh, the uh, Divine the were now. were uh, assisting with mm -hmm. whatever that was, but I, they haven't. Uh, I gotta reach out to them. I just know that yeah, you were in so... the city, so I was just wondering what the situation was with that well i mean they were clearly homicides both had mm -hmm. been dumped in the lake or the sea uh they'd been there one had been there for quite a while uh one had been there for several days at least uh both were right, that buffalo is at region square right now turning left notes. towards the pd then for we got the 95 security mr oh there actually were three bodies yesterday um Yeah, both stabbed. Uh, one of them fought back. He had defensive wounds. From being stabbed? Yeah. The one yesterday had defensive wounds. The one uh, the couple of days before that uh, had been bound. He had ligature marks on his wrist. Okay. But they're they're both clearly clearly homicides. I'm just waiting for toxicology to see if there's anything more than that, but honestly, they look pretty cut and dry. Okay. Uh, did you know if anyone got arrested from that situation? No, there hasn't even been a clue. The only the only piece of physical evidence we found on scene was a knife in the pocket of Marvin Gray. Okay. We, all, we also received no... a 911 when the bodies were discovered from somebody that said that they stabbed some people. Um... There were two more stab victims yesterday. Besides that, the ones that were dismembered? No, 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 no. That Those are the two. Okay, so we had three bodies yesterday. Two were dismembered. Uh, they were, it looks like they were related. They both had uh, the same last name. And they were dismembered. One had one arm removed. One had both arms removed. Um... They both had injuries that they would have died from eventually, but I'm pretty sure that the dismemberment is what actually killed them. They were exsanguinated. One had a hatchet wound to the face, the other one just a stab wound to the midsection. But yeah, I think the uh, those two and the other body that were stretched out of the lake they are separate incidents, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I'm going to figure this out with that, the, uh, with the detectives. Then. The I was just that uh, right now wondering if they unit. forgot Careful. to put in a report, because we literally had somebody claiming to have stabbed people right, when the bodies were discovered. So I'm, I'm, I guess I'm baffled why there's no report on that. Yeah, no, they were they were at the hospital so, and around and get behind you. I gave the information to uh, I do not welcome it. Divine about the two brothers, and then that third body that's all bloated so was brought in immediately the, afterwards. The high rate of speed vehicle heading right okay. All right. Uh, thanks, Trey. That, that, that's it. Uh, I just wanted yeah, a little bit more context on the bodies that were discovered. Yeah. And Sorry, there's been a lot of deaths lately. Yeah, well, you know, there's been a lot of life, too. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what, what I mean by that. Two or two assisting. I don't, I don't either. Okay, sorry. It's looking great, by the way. Thank you. Yeah, it, things have really changed my perspective when you ripped off my patch. Yeah, you could see with both eyes. Yeah, well, now nah, I don't look as cool. 
Oh, you look fantastic, Bobby. Oh, the earring, the earring totally makes you cool. Well, yeah, I used to have an eye patch too, but now I got nothing. What? Would you stop crying about the eye patch? What do you mean you got nothing? You got a great backside. You got fantastic hair. No, but the eye patch is really what you know. No, no, no. But you get that sexy like stubble thing going on. You're good, Bobby. You're good. All right, I'll, I'll take what I can get. Yeah, yeah, you're good. All right, good luck. Don't uh, worry, Bobby. You're who's still selling hot. drugs at Pillbox? Did you figure that out or what? 685 <laughs> activated with that buff. I guess one of the blocks was trying to buy a gun. Traffic light, weather clear. Okay. The uh, Redeemer one or whatever. Yep. Continuing now northbound LaSalle so. Freeway. I'm also going to look into that. Speed's 130 and increase. Clarkson and Hunter situation. Yeah, um. You sent me an email asking for the other officer. That would be. Continue North Bevel South Freeway, speed uh, 130. Fuck. Um, Chet. Traffic now, moderate. I had to Continue think of the word North compensating so I could remember his name. It was Chet. Okay. Chet, uh, Chet was also part of it. The water well, bike. he, he was. Down. I was talking to him about EMS being driven off uh off duty because of it and then he said yeah i'm in the same boat i'm going off duty because it's bullshit i think that's an lspd tahoe gotcha. in the southbound lane there so okay yeah when i see him around i'll have a conversation usually the okay. disaster twins Northbound cause me all types of problems whenever they're yeah. around but as you yeah. can imagine one's a trooper and the other one's on thin ice and none of them uh that that, so. yeah is okay, that definitely. what you call somebody who pleads guilty to putting a hit on people the thing is thin ice the thing is, you know, I partially believe that there is a chance that he tried to put hits out on officers, but my other instinct also says that he Pass put a hit on me. Northbound. Well, look, I mean, all of that was circumstantial, right? No, it's not. There was an uh, there was a witness. <laughs> okay, Troy, what's in the past is in the past, right? Bobby, come on. Look, I don't listen. What do you want me to do about it? I've seen the. Uh, union uh, the whole the, the whole investigation was already kind of botched, road. if I'm being honest with you. I, I personally I, I personally don't feel that there was enough evidence that the DA had, and I think there was the, a... and I think the only reason that Clarkson pled guilty is because he didn't want to go to court. Swarming in and out of traffic, continuing northbound. Some so, more. Yeah, but he I guess did we'll it. never if know. Are you fucking kidding me, Bobby? I mean, Mike Black also tried to kill him, too, saying that Clarkson put a hit out against himself. Yeah, yeah. Block put it... Block was carrying out a hit on fucking Twong Ru until he was a witness. Block... Uh... He's just not, he's just not incredible. He's just not a credible kill... agent, really, that okay. Mike guy, you know? All right, but my witness literally heard the transaction between Clarkson and the Chang gang. So yeah, but it would have been hearsay. It's, point, right? sure. it's not hearsay. It came directly from him. They're right, but I'm saying it's it's here. hearsay. But yeah, also, he's just not a very credible witness because he tried to kill Clarkson. Once they get an additional, I'm gonna go. Uh, uh, I'm on your six, continuing northbound and uh, transiting westbound Highway. Uh, uh, what, you know, who's gonna be that serving that out is... parking tickets up there when somebody parks on a trail or something? You know. Look, I'll deal with this, uh... I'll deal with this, like, thing with the... Any 52s somewhere. for Angel, uh, mm -hmm. right northbound Polito Bay. Sorry, Troy. Right. I'm gonna go take care of my ulcer now. Okay. Uh, vehicle's gonna be dropping an individual off. It's gonna be Tony Corleone. He's gonna be on How's foot. It has a pistol in hand. Believe it to be an SNS. It's going good. Hey, Pulling a baseball uh, bat out. I, I don't know if you guys are aware of the situation that's going on on I'm going to be Twitter continuing right after now. the Buffalo. Again, we're going to need 52s yeah, for Angel. It's going to be uh, uh, Highway right out across from Pluck and Bell. Be secondary here, continuing to route. Somebody possibly Eastbound Eastbound Gradation Highway. under duress. Yeah, uh, uh, the block's kidnapped uh, Tony's wife. Hey, from. <laughs> what the fuck? Continuing eastbound Gradation Highway. Tony Corleone's gonna be. I uh, decided where Mike he wants to marry Tori. Well, so, he had a baseball uh, bat in uh, hand. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I got officers chasing that down. situation right now. Apparently, the person in the passenger seat still hasn't hit puberty yet. Uh, we're gonna be continuing northbound Gradation Highway. Up for a bit, one safe. They've already rammed me off the road. Ugh, fuck, this is my fault. 
Uh, sir, can I talk to you for a second? I just had a civilian uh, yeah. tell me All that right. uh, they're setting up. Miss Tessa, the we can also, uh, fire station. if at some point you want to come here and like hang out in the downstairs captain's office or something, just for your own safety, we can do that too. Um, oh, but okay. I, I will say someone has been murdered inside of the jail cells in Mission Row before, so it's not the most. Yeah, but it's already. I understand. So. I, I appreciate that, though. Okay. Thank you. All right. All right, beware of that fire station. There's nothing oh, between okay. him and them. Why you say that? This is it true, dude? Oh, that's hard to believe. An unsuccessful. <laughs> we're, we're the right today, Chief. I think you're wrong there, bud. What's that? Got shots fired. Yeah, I think it's right now. today. Today, other than uh, just yeah. the usual kidnapping, death, and uh, poltergeists fighting officers inside of the morgue. Uh, two or two. I'm shooting at the uh, oh. tower. There's people in there shooting at the cops. Hmm. I see the shots fired. Uh, how can I help? Uh, do you have a chance to like ha do your thing on Monday or whatever you were planning on doing? Uh, like unfortunately, not. I think that, you guys were that tower. all busy around that time. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, it, 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 it was all good. Uh, I had something set up with Got no, multiple people being yeah, shot after from Tony Corleone from the top. I think he was top. also busy with some things, so. Okay. So you, you set something up with Snow already? Uh, I had tried to. I uh, It was going to be on Tuesday, I believe. I just and shot I think my block. He ran Ripley. So that we couldn't really and now uh, he ran me over. get anything oh, going. Copy that. Shoot him down. Confirm. He's down. He's down. I'm first on the rooftop. We still need to go for okay. it as well. That. Uh, uh, all right. I'm gonna forward again. you a, a payment now go for, the for, tires for this vehicle. week and your services. I guess. Um, they picked up. If you can be around, and they're, uh, like off their, during uh, these hours, a little bit later hours, I can also try to schedule you in, you in with some it. cops as well. And uh, you we're know, gonna fix my tires, and I'll be gonna do the programs that you're pitching for. Again, it it might have to be more individual based than group based, unless it's like really really slow or really late at night. Because during Ripley, uh, like really hectic yeah, hours, you know, I, the there's no way I can get like you know more than four officers in here to have a conversation. You know what I'm saying? You know, I uh, I yeah, you have that, that scene so. secured. Okay. Um, you're looking for mainly block, around yeah, this hour and a bit later. Uh, I'm saying okay. if you if you come around yeah, these I'm hours and I can help you out directly, the tires of the um, Buffalo. you know, get officers in here and stuff and really pull them off duty uh, to just come have a conversation. But if you have other ideas, you know, you're welcome to run them by and me pop as well. The tires as, uh, again. We we started this exchange together first, so I, I think people will know what we're doing. Uh, once King I, Ripley. Uh, I work with you a little bit more. I'm pinned this, down behind my cruiser department. That makes sense. I'm standing by. Can I uh yeah right i can uh this is usually the time i usually shoot for being around so i can definitely work around this time okay up to you um and again if you have like uh officers too that uh there's two of you, them you'd like to have a conversation with I'll, I'll let more of them know that we have this service as well so they can reach out um mm -hmm. I'll probably uh post your your name and number and all that uh, actually actually you might careful. need to give that to me at some point just toss me your information so I can put like a bulletin board out for officers looking to reach out and speak to a therapist. Uh, uh yeah. That can so one down, one down, one down. Right now, if you like with my number and everything, if you wanted to take it. Uh, so do you want to just email it to me like your like your official thing so I could just copy paste that? There may be others. Uh, maybe on yeah, I can do that. So you just want just you know name, number, and everything. Yeah, yeah, name and number, and uh, moving around. I can just uh, put a bulletin board on the. Uh, the the police the buffalo now. police forum so people know to reach out to you last i saw it was crashed on the road uh, uh they, yeah right. they went to fix it uh, and shot the tires uh, out. yeah if you give me your line, number two actually now. that would that would help me as well uh yeah uh so it's gonna be 415-817-9122 and what would you like me to is there like a doctor title for you or how, what would you like me to refer to you as uh, just doctors, fine. Ocean King at this time. I'm gonna have two individuals that are critically injured. Um, waiting for that buffalo. I want to see where it's at now. What was his name again? Is he? He should be in the things, right? I got all this uh, subject secure over here. I'm gonna go mobile again. I heard a car driving around me. Dylan Weston. Hey, That's how you spell it, right? 
D oh, it's Delan. Delan Weston. Fuck. Okay. All right. Perfect. Uh, the blue Prius is a reporter for Weasel, Weasel News. Uh, yeah. All right. And then I'm about to uh, email you my Jeff, number. Where's the first guy that Perfect. I'm going to go ahead and uh, forward you this. Uh, uh, it's going to be right here at the Lumberjack, actually. The uh, the private lodge. I've got the individual that was shot here. Uh, all right. Uh, he's going to be on my 20 right now at this little hotel area. Uh, if you want to grab the other one next to that tree that has the separation in it, we can condense them down here. 10-4. I'm bringing them down there. It's a bit... Uh, better for ems to get to hey from no i've never tried other cultures is that mr smith uh, i've got no visual yes mr smith you there's a man the, out here uh, bravo. there's a man uh, that's everywhere negative. always we cannot locate the 13 well, bravo can you stop it uh she might have had a head bump uh 10 4 that's what we assumed Sometimes too we have like people that leave um like notes and stuff too. Uh in this uh at this uh department. Uh okay. So if if that's something you ever want to do, like by the door over there, you can do that as well. Oh, all right, yeah, I can uh, uh which one are you? Well. Uh, sharp, sir. Sharp, okay. You change your pair? Oh, no, aren't you, I've always been like this. Brunette or oh, something before? Um, no. I was also going to mention uh, that uh, if anyone was ever going to need it, uh, I also am doing physical therapy as well. So if any officers that are injured, having trouble moving or anything like that, let me know. And I can all see what I can do. Get EMS rolled in well. for these down subjects? Okay. Uh, I think you're code for it. You're seeing, From however, your I'm uncertain it's, if this is still uh, um, going to be active here or not. Culturally sensitive. I I say a little little mobile what is for uh, Ripley right now. What is it? What are, wait, what are you doing? I'm bowing. Stop I'm doing that. You. Why? Hi. Don't do that. Why? Don't do whatever this is that you're Hi. doing right now. Do not do that. Hi. Don't fucking am... don't fucking do that. Wait, yes, why do you feel uh, like you need to be like culturally? I'll call this good for. I got respect for right new visual. things. Hi. Ten four ten go two and route. Uh, is there a problem? Oh. I don't think there's a problem with that. I think it's, you know, more of a, uh, I think it's good that you want to experiment with things, but I, I mean, it's kind of like a I mean, why? I mean, why? I mean, I know you say you're trying to do things, but I mean, why? Why not? Hi. Uh, I mean, all right. I mean, who? I am very respectful. Hi. You're doing, you're doing uh. some shit that's going to get our department canceled, Sharp. Mr. Smith, well, I, I think he just has an issue with his posture. Do you need physical it therapy, my, Sharp? It is my belief he used to be severely obese, and uh, that's why his arms are so far apart. And then the whole back issue. I'll tell it must you be like you're a fucking alcoholic. He knows I'm an alcoholic. Oh, sir, fuck. I'm an alcoholic. Hmm. Yeah, that's fine. Uh... Me too, sir. Hi. Yeah, I was, I was going to say, I'm going to tell him you're an alcoholic. Yeah, but you can't. I cancel you. You cancel. I cunt. Did you just call me a fucking cunt? No, I, I said. I oh my god! I'm opening oh up Twitter right now. Oh That's my, it. Oh uh huh. My. You're oh no, fucked. Oh no! Please don't. What's your name? Uh, it, it's uh, Dominic Toretti. No, I know who Toretti is. I was just lying. Oh shit! It's Dan. Dan Failey. I know who Failey is. Uh, hey, uh Daryl McCormick. I know who McCormick is. Oh, my name is uh, <clears throat> Jackie Snow. Oi, mate. Okay, I know who all these people are. Can you just tell me what your actual name is, Dan? Uh, I know every officer. Uh, no. Except for you. Oi, mate. I'm Jackie Snow, mate. Oi. No. Snow is like 50 years older than you. Oh my god. I'm pacing. It's pacing. I'm pacing. We love Nikes here, it's true. Hmm. Uh, throw me a bone here, sir. Uh, Alright, this is uh, Cody Sharp. What the uh, 421 fuck, DMS. Alright. 
What? Send it. You couldn't remember your name. Uh, I'm once helping you're you done out. With that <laughs> scenario, Man, uh, we still have two more I, I that have been shot over at. Uh, is that it? This Please, I bow. Area, the lumberjack. This is a uh, ten four will be over as soon as we're done with this scene. Okay, you need hey, to stop doing that. What? You told me you're not Japanese and you're just doing it for some cultural. I, I, I think you should stop doing that. What, Mr. Please. Smith? I don't know about this. What's that? Well, like you said, uh, when I walked up and you were saying he's going to get the department in trouble, I, this might be a good reason. Uh, for being culturally uh, culturally appropriate, I don't think so. Well, I, don't I don't think uh, I don't think you're doing whatever it is that you're trying to do right. Uh, mm-hmm. Uh, okay, let's. Borrow. Actually, you know something, uh, uh, Doctor Weston. I think now would be a good time to uh, talk to our officer Sharp here. Uh, yeah, okay. Because he's clearly uh, going through some type of spasm. Don't make me. Again, and, and my... Don't fucking... Uh, don't reach for your gun like that. What are you doing? It's not my gun. It's my bow. Hi. In my previous medical profession, I think he's having back spasms due to the... Weight. What? The weight <laughs> issue we had. Uh, you just you just touch her chest? Oh, no. What the that hell? Is, uh, oh my hey. god! The hell was that, Sharp? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna bring him to the captain's office. Uh, I don't know if you want to have a conversation. I feel like I need to have a promotion. Uh, yeah, okay. So that I can forget about it. Need one second. Uh, uh, sir, I'm type. Uh, I'm willing I'm to playing... settle out of court. Oh my god. Damn it. <sighs> I'm gonna have you talk to a therapist. My name is Cody Sharp. I'm 21. I'm not the this therapist. Is my first time. Oh my fucking god! I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what's gone into you. Or some type of childhood trauma that's surfacing right now. Oh, I've been told this is how you get promotions, sir. This is not how you get prom. <clears throat> Maybe talk to uh, Doctor Dylan Weston. He's uh, been contracted by the police department to do uh low-key mental evals on people but it's disguised as just uh, therapy so uh if you have any problems probably tell him about it and then Hi. i can ask him afterwards if you should be fired or not okay nice, nice right. to meet you sir Hi. Mm -hmm. nice to uh, nice to meet you as well mr sharp um so how, how have you been how, how's work been for you okay well uh old bombay over there he uh he promised me uh a promotion the other day uh yeah it was he we were riding in a car uh, we're gonna have and, a vehicle uh, that just flipped 27 times it's gonna be black and colored prius i was at the report and he said I'm not just... what the fuck and i assumed what the fuck is he saying <laughs> i assume that's you know, like the the signal. You know, you know, like how in baseball, <laughs> people like you know do the shit with the fucking nose and the lips and the fucking ears. You know, oh, I assume shit. that was the same thing. But he touched my inner thigh and he was like, "Hi," uh, like uh, so. I've been steel signs. Just as he did it, he was like, uh, it's time for that promotion, Sharp. I was like, all right, all right dude. And then he, just, he did the thigh thing, and then he said, hi. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. What the fuck is he talking about, dude? Right, but he does... I swear, I think maybe the age is getting to him. I'll be honest. He doesn't remember that. He doesn't remember that this happened. Yeah. I mean, at this point, I'm honestly thinking about going to HR or possibly even do a twat long. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. Um, 
Maybe, maybe he just wanted sushi that day. And maybe I had like mustard or something on my pants and he wanted to wipe it off or... What the fuck? I mean, it's possible. Bobby Weinstein, what the fuck? Maybe. I mean, I'll be honest. I, uh, I shoot everyone, all right? <laughs> so, uh, I don't know. You, you know, like, Bobby points. He says, shoot, I shoot. You know. Uh, I mean, the other day I told DuPont that she's a basic bitch and th that I'm whiter than Whitewood, you know. I feel like that's, uh, you know, like showing, uh, you know, that you, 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 you're the man, basically. But that was pleasing. I, 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 <clears throat> basically I did us, uh, I, I did, did an eval of her on the spot, you know, to see if I had some PC or maybe some even, you know, some other SOP stuff that I definitely read. Uh, you know, like, uh, I wanted her to call me Terry. Yeah, Terry Frisk, bitch. Got you. <laughs> no, no, no. I wanted to have PC to give her a call after, you know, my shift. Wink. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so much more, bro. I, I have a I have a black couch at home. Not the generate receipts, dude. Oh my god. Don't ever become high command, chat. If you're in chat and you're looking to become high command, don't ever get a, become high command and hire an accountant and then they ask you for receipts oh, so you have to generate okay. physical uh, receipts. Oh, yeah, I have another one. Oh, yeah, yeah, easy, easy. All right. So whenever I go patrolling in the south side, right, I tell all my fellow officers that they dude, need to fucking put the car in reverse pop the trunk and we reverse through the south side to be more culturally appropriate. I feel like that is great initiative. Right? Yeah, definitely. They're like, yo, what's up, uh, fellow gangster? I'm like, y y yo. What is he talking about? No, 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 no. I just do the, the car thing. I feel like that's, you know, sends a clear message that uh, I'm, a, I'm a tough guy. Real hard. <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> Anyone know the police department's address? Is it like... Oh, I, I, I literally just show Something up, I shoot him, I make my colleague do the paperwork, and then I go to sleep. Actually, that's that's a lie. I, I, I have binders full of women. Uh, I give them a call after. Uh, one uh -huh. street. Okay, I thought it was nine for some reason. That's on the warrants. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. Thank you. Yeah, women. Yeah.
I would rather not disclose that fact, but, but uh, I, I, I give them a call afterwards. I, 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 I bow and I thank you and I give them $5 and then off I go. Why would that be offensive? If, if, uh, do you get offended? Uh, do, do, do you feel like the valet gets offended when you tip them? Yeah, it's there. No, I'm not gonna go there. But. Hey, mom. Uh, I can't talk right now. I'm. Uh, I'm at. The, I'm. I'm at work. Oh, mom, stop. Please, mom. Fuck, dude. Mom, no, 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 mom. I will not go out with her. What the fuck? No, mom. We're done having this conversation. I am. Mom, stop smoking. Mom. This is church. I swear to God, mom. Mom, get the fucking camera. <clears throat> I gotta go, mom. I love you. I'll see you tonight. Hi. Everything okay? Yeah, my, my, uh, my, one of my bitches just called. Yo. <laughs> Yeah, I just told her what's up. Do you have any, if you don't mind asking, do you have any, like, you know, family members in the city or, you know? Oh, yeah, I have two dads. Two dads? Uh, all right. I mean, are they, like, you know, blood or are they just, you know, adoptive? Uh, I, I I do believe they're crips, but uh, I don't see how that is real. No, I don't mean, I don't mean, you know, what if they're a part of like a set i mean like are they related to you by blood or did they adopt you oh yeah no no i'm adopted uh well i mean my mom isn't really around but she calls sometimes not that i've received any calls recently or so but you know sometimes she called me at the end of the day. She's a heavy smoker, you see. Uh, I don't know. She just did some heavy breathing in the phone. Uh, and then she hung up. Okay. Not really. My my dad is a policeman. Actually, both of my dads are policemen. Yeah, that was a pain in the ass. I mean, uh, yeah, I, yeah, no, no. I wanted to be a policeman before they adopted me. That happens, that's, you know. But uh, I'll, I will say this though, my my I dad. I just heard. Uh... Uh... Eugene's voice in, this, uh, in uh, I've heard some rumors that my dad right got the Chrome his, one. his rank by <clears throat> Wait guys, we just got Looser coming our way, what? Canoeing with Bob, if you know what I'm they, saying They turned off Uh, Chet, you see where any of the shooters are right now? Uh, is that white and color vehicle pulled back up again on the hill side? Uh, one of my dad's is yeah, side? Uh, the Mad south roads, side. you know, the best police officers. Okay, uh, if Bobby's here in this, covering the south side I mean, now, after right? Bobby, yeah, L shaped to build the Otherwise, the yeah, they're gonna be the best. <laughs> and my other dad is dark, he never pays the bills, he's a shit, shit bag. <laughs> Mr. Smith, are you around here somewhere? Hello? Yeah, I was in the kitchen making myself a sandwich. Sir, would you like me to stab your eye out so that you can have an eye patch again? <sighs> Troy told me that yeah. you would like an eye patch. Uh, uh, 
I was an alcoholic. Uh, that sounds kind of scary. Well, do you want an eye patch or not? I, I do, but like alcoholic. stabbing me in the eye? I mean, I don't know. That seems a little excessive, really. Like, why don't you just wear an eye patch? Because people just make fun it. of me again for it and all this, you know. At least before I had a reason, it's because I got shot by DuPont. a terrorist that broke out of jail and had an Uzi. You know, that, that, it made sense in that a badass heart. story. But if I'm like, yeah, I got myself an eye patch because I thought it looked cool, it just what sounds fucking stupid. Give me that 12, me bro. In the face of the Uzi? What happened? I left no, don't shoot me in the face of the Uzi, okay? To do some job. Okay, well, what do you yeah, want me to do to one or both of your eyes? I need the instructions so to be clear. I had to do some uh, job elsewhere. Uh, what do you mean? The instructions are very clear. What are, you, what, are about? Well, what are they? Slaying a bunch of women. I don't want to get shot. Was not okay either. Okay, so what do you want then? I, so... I have to think about how I'm gonna try to she get an eye patch with, with a cool story and, and without hurting my eye. She was like super upset and tried to. You want like pink eye or something? Uh, okay, before I continue, all right. I said cool. Uh, tell me, tell me one thing. Am well, I wide? I'm sorry, but anything Am cool is gonna involve like stabbing or like, shooting. Am I the or... widest you've ever seen? Did you say white or wide? What is he saying? I'll be honest, bro. Like, what? I don't know. I'm okay. not listening. I'm listening. It, it is it very is, loud. It is factual. Well, it's weird. I thought we were having a conversation. Okay, but I hear some guys talking about how Just he's look wide. At these fucking pics, bro. I mean, he yeah, he used to be wide. He used to be very fat. Oh, okay. Right. What's good for good for Hitmo? What's he doing right. in there? It's supposed to be a paid therapy session. Why is he? I'm the flexed? widest. Just what? tell me I'm the widest. Why is he oh my God. flexing okay. on the therapist I'm, in there? I'm gonna walk away. I don't I don't know what's going on in there and I don't wanna know. Thank you, sir. Okay, I'm gonna walk away too, actually. Well, I can't even stop my boss in the eye without asking him, you know. Yeah, courtesy and all that. Hey, yo, what up? Hey, yo. Hello. What are you I ladies answer. talking about? Uh, Ooh. your eye. Are we spilling gossip? Yes. Oh, I can oh, with some tea. tea. Yeah. No. It's... Well, you tell me about it. I don't want to hear the deets. <laughs> fuck Bobby. What do you mean, what the fuck, Bobby? Ah, uh, you heard me. <laughs> Is I don't hear gossiping. I want to know a little bit of uh, juice. You know what I'm saying? What's what's the latest? What's the happening? Oh, we were just oh, talking about hot. your yeah. Oh my god! Splash it in your face. Maybe you'll go blind in one eye. Hmm. Uh, no. It's still not a cool story. Any cool story? Maybe you can uh, medically in induce blindness in my eye. What? That's Why? Cool. That's not a cool story at all. But I won't tell people that. I'll just lie. I'll say. I was attacked by a well, bear. I mean, you, just you could lie about the eye being blind. No, yeah. no, I can't. No, just put on I've been the having eye patch. Listen, and... I've been having problems with these blind people. Okay. Oh my god. I know. Just... What? Yeah. What does that even mean? What, what problems could you be having with blind people? Not, not like all blind people. I'm not saying all blind people. <laughs> I just mean some. Okay, which one? Do you a mean few like particular one in... individuals? You mean like blind son? I've had, I, listen, I've had two run-ins with blind people, and they've not gone over very well. I, I don't understand why. It's I'm not. not like... say, I'm not saying all blind people are bad, but my experiences with blind people have so far been soured. Thus far in my career. Hmm. Again, not all blind people. Right, right. Yes, the the blind son, and then the guy mm -hmm. that had the fucking phone app that he drives the car with that has an aggressive mode. Oh, oh that guy. What the yeah. Heck? No, the there's this guy. Gun. I yell at him every time I see him because he's driving blind, and he's like, "No, no, no! I got a Tesla." No, the thing is, he had a a Panto that he claimed was self-driving, and then I get a mechanic to look at it. And he said it was just like every other Panto, and then he claimed that it's not the car that's self-driving, it's his phone app. And then his friend said, Oh yeah, the phone app also has an aggressive mode. If you put the car in an aggressive, it runs into things. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna impound this car. Because mm -hmm. that's fucking dumb. And then he was like, well, I'm gonna sue you because you're discriminating against blind people or some shit, so. Uh. Still waiting for that lawsuit or whatever that 
makes its way to Korra. But yeah, yeah, it was a total dick. And he was pointing that at stuff too. He was like legit pointing at people and pointing at things inside his car. So some of these guys I think are faking their blindness. Like I'm not totally convinced that a whole Holden well, Block kid is blind. No, he's blind. I tested him. Very I know you thoroughly. tested him. You said you tested him, but then again, I don't. I don't know. You also said that you can't conclusively determine if someone's blind. Uh, no. Trust me, the boy is blind. No, look. I know I shot one of his eyes out. Yep. Yep. Um, actually, I don't know why he doesn't wear an eye patch. I'd wear an eye patch if <laughs> a cop shot my eye out. Damn, he should really. He should really wear an eye patch. <laughs> Anyway. Anyway. Yeah, I don't think he's fully blind in he's, his no, other he's, eye, though. He is fully blind in the other eye. he's faking to get sympathy. No. The judical system, yes. He's fully blind in the other eye. I tested him. Hmm. I don't know. But, like, did you graduate, like, top half of your class or, like, bottom half? Of yes. Your... Okay. Just making sure, you know. You know how some of these doctors are. Mike Block is at Pillbox? Oh shit. But yeah, I think uh just... Alright, limited on No T right now, I gotta go get my box and cousin yes. die. Thank you. Uh ten four, we are aware that is doctors. Hey, for... Sorry, I forgot he's a doctor now. EMS that are heading up this way, please hide. Don't get yourself kidnapped up here. Here's your 976 pill box. What's the uh, statuation? Statu what am I trying to say? What's going on there? Uh, one of you guys want help? Uh, we have nobody at the hospital studio sitting up right now. Just Holy that doctor, latest 911. Alright, at this point, it's been like. I want to say 20 minutes that we've been in the same parking lot and I haven't seen them in a good five minutes. Um, why don't we get EMS in here to treat them and then we'll... Uh, where, 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 where's he at? Like what's going on? Well, he was, but then Mike Block came in and uncuffed them. I don't know if he's... Has it been three like, minutes? It feels like it's been a long time. It's been just about three minutes. I, I do think... Right, I'm going to start a timer. Two more minutes. If we don't even get a sighting of them, then I'm calling EMS. Thanks, motherfucker. Much better now. Hold on, sir. What happened to you? Hello? What happened to you? Yo, I was tending this wedding right? I got shot up, motherfucker. You got shot up? Okay. I do shit. The Sand King out front just stopped. Okay, so did you know where the individual that uncuffed you went? Nah, B. Okay, why were you cuffed in the first place? I don't fucking know. I got shot up and cuffed. I got fucking left here, dog. I got two more vehicles coming from the west. Okay. I, I, I. All right, sir. Just stay out of trouble, I guess. Uh, vehicle Thanks, driving through the woods and south side. Hey, yo, Mike Block, where you at? Two vehicles. What the fuck? Heading to the north now. Hey, firm. What the fuck? Do we know how many times it's occupied? Negative, Yep, they're shooting at us now. Yo, Ike, Ike, I'm I'm at the hospital, dog. They have to give me physical. Hey, right? need to get get me a car and pick me up. Or some kind of comp was fucking over here asking questions. You feel? Me? Can't see <laughs> oh, there's one. Can't say shit. I ain't say shit about my dog. To go for a right? <laughs> I bet. Pick me up, all right? Pick me outside pillbox. Yo, pick up the knee, dog. Yo, son. Hey, buddy. Yeah. Hey, can, can you come in for a sec? Hey, from doing know where the other guy went? He got in with him, both in the uh, vehicle. Listen, listen, listen I, I, I couldn't hear, couldn't help but hear that conversation about someone picking you up. I guess yeah, the first one is friend, dog. Don't worry about probably abandoned. So, okay, is it Mike uh, Block that's gonna come pick you up after he bailed know, you out of here? Who's gonna fucking pick me up? Are you gonna pick me up, dog? Do you need me to pick you up? Nah, dog, I'm Gucci, you feel me, dog? I'm ice It does up. sound like dog bird. He's the only one that would give uh, RP like that, probably. You're you're iced up. I'm not sure what that means. Iced, you know, dog. I'm iced up. I got white clean tees on. You feel me, dog? Yeah. I'm out here. You Wait, what? you iced up, fam? Like, what do you mean? Iced up, dog. 
What does that even mean? What does it mean? Why do people think they're gangsters again? You feel me, though? Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what's going on here. East side, east side, east, east, east. Hey, real talk. How the fuck is Mike Block not in prison right now? Uh, because we got gang wars happening. So. I think Shit's that whack. coupled with Mike Block doing stuff and like That's not a lot of officer right? resources is probably why we can't get him right now. Yo, Mike, what's up? Don't I feel it, dude. This I feel it. Hey, stay real, dude. Stay stay real. Okay. You too. Is that Sonny? You keep saying Mike Block. Are you talking to Mike Block on the phone? I, I'll get there. You got no visual of him? I'm coming can, back can now. Uh, we can give you a why, ride. why don't you tell him? Why don't you tell him you're gonna meet him there? Okay, so we got a Huntley that's gonna be close by. Yeah, um, hey, dispatch, you flag that plate, please. son? Oh yeah, son. Are you coming out? Are yeah, you looking coming? for an SUV? Are you, green where, color. Where the fuck am I going, dog? Are you picking me up or you? I'm outside, dog. I'm outside, dog. I need soup. I soup, dog. Ready, dog. Especially, I wonder if Mike Block on my 20 here. Are you guys still dealing with? Some shit going on in the east side. Or... I think it's in Toledo. Toledo. Copy that. Okay, I'm gonna attempt to uh, get him. Uh, wish me luck. And for Sergeant Angel still on duty. Negative. We're currently at four officers on duty right now, sir. Damn! Damn! Why they ask? What? Stop the car, Mike. Give yourself up. No! Yes. What the fuck? Yo, chill, Mike. Yeah. I think we going back, dog. Damn. Wait, what is we giving our hands? Stop the car, Mike. It stopped. Have you seen my wife? Get out of the car, Mike. Oh, 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 Oh. All right, Mike, again. Oh, 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 all right, dispatch. I'm gonna give up on Mike. Uh, I just got stabbed by like three people, so I'm gonna break off of that situation. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, fuck that. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, we did get stabbed in the eye. Oh my god, that's perfect. All right, I'm gonna go talk to Choi. <laughs> that gets stabbed in the eye. <laughs> uh, I don't have any eyes on any. <laughs> <laughs> Same oh, traffic. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> Holy fuck. Want to restart that five minute timer there, Ripley? Timer starting now. <laughs> hey, is, is Troy here? Hi. I oh, think you just fuck. missed her, actually. Did I she go? She's heading to. Uh, okay, I because I got stabbed in the fucking. I got stabbed in the eye. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't get him. Oh, Sorry, Tessa. Oh god. I got stabbed. What? Sir, are you okay to drive? Do you need a hospital? Like. Uh, yeah, I, I tried to. I tried to arrest him, and like three of them tried to stab me, and one of them stabbed me in the face. So I'm gonna. Uh, Sorry, I'm Tessa. Gonna... I think you're endangered. Can, can you see oh, me, okay. Mom? Well, I, 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 I don't know. I'm good, I'm good, okay? I, I am fine. Shit. I need that promotion. Please don't die. All right, yeah, I need, I need you to pick me up. I just crashed. 400 from 202. Are you on duty? Neg negative, sir. Sorry. Ripley, I got stabbed in my eye. Sorry about that, sir. 
Like the good one or the bad one? I, I, I don't know. I can't tell. Okay. Well, Kemi, can you still see or are you like pitch black? Now's not the time to be asking me what type of colors I see, Chet. Right. My apologies, sir. Bobby, I'm coming. Bobby. I'm losing. I'm losing breath. Get in. Oh, oh my Marco. God. Marco. Oh, you found it. Okay. No, I, I can see on the other eye. It's just. Oh, oh, well, fuck off two, then. Two, two, all right. The five minute timer is halfway. What the fuck through. do you mean? Give me a ride, son of a bitch. I don't want to fucking run Dude. up there. I just got stabbed up there. Okay, all right. Got you. Oh my god. It was brutal. I was assaulted. Hey, once we're gonna oh call EMS, I really need to uh, park under a bridge <laughs> second here. That is how it works. Hi, Bobby. Hi, hello. Troy, uh, I, I got stabbed in the eye. Uh, yeah, and big uh, man Bobby, uh, well, stab the eye. Bleed. Be a man and hold it until the situation. Troy, you gotta help me. I got stabbed in my eye. I've been holding it since I got on duty. Stabbed in your eye. Troy, I got stabbed in my. Look at me. Look at my face. Fifty-four minutes ago. Looking at your face. It's beautiful. Actually, I mean, I use a bottle. Hard to get in the car. Beautiful. Uh, I don't have any bottles right now. Oh <laughs> my uh, fuck. How nurses? Yeah, I, uh, I'm serious, Troy. And I'm ready to I mingle. I pizza cut on oh, your cheek. Oh. No, it's in my eye. You're gonna I, have a great scar. I can't see. Ooh. Huh? You're gonna have a fantastic scar. I can't see out of my eye. You have blood in your eye. I can't see out of my eye. Oh, is there blood in my eye? I think I got stabbed in my eye. I felt it. It felt like an eye stab. Who was that? Uh, excuse me, can you just get the fuck out of here? Fucking people. Yeah, yeah, get the fuck out of here. What is all this? What? Excuse oh, that's me, Pixie. It's Pixie. No, oh, no, no, not it. Pixie. The fucking oh, box. Oh, hey. Uh, so, probably a delivery. Are you single? Wait, is it? Oh, my am God. Yes. Uh, wait, can, am I going to have to wear an eye patch yes. now? Hi. Bobby, oh. if you went oh out God. and got Special yourself stabbed in the LA. face on uh, purpose just so you could wear a fucking no. eye patch. <laughs> No, it wasn't on purpose. I was trying to arrest Mike Block and I got stabbed like three times and someone stabbed me in the face. But you're still walking. Do I have the authority yeah, I know. to tackle him? But I'm not, I'm not walking good. His abilities? No, Bobby needs help. Bobby needs help. Help me! Alright, interns! I can't see. I get stabbed. Troy, please, yeah, Bobby, this is serious. I, mm, yeah, no, I know. But Oh my god. Okay, doctor, what's he gonna do? Troy, I'm not gonna be able to see ever officer? again. Well, he, uh, he took a knife blade to the face. Pretty sure his eyes are both intact, however. No hostels have been Just, uh, spotted flush, for five flush his eyes out with saline, make sure. Uh, we have the uh, parking lot secure and we should be able to start transport. Ten four tango to oh and route. Okay. How, how's that feel? It feels like I'm crying, but I'm not doing it on purpose. He's crying, all right. Uh, okay, let's say let's check out the knife onto to the face. Let's see how bad it is. Oh my god! It's a chief of police over there. Yeah. Huh. How does it look? Uh, it's 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 pretty bad. It's you're lucky you missed your eyes and your and your nose. What in my eye? No, no, your eyes are fine. Your eyes I are can't fine. see out of the eyeball that I'm going to be wearing an eye patch over for the next several mm. weeks. Let me, let me see. I've been saying that for fucking days. Let me see. Oh my see gosh. Which, which, the, your eye here. You're going to be all right, sir. You're going to be all right. Yeah, you're all right. Yeah. Am I going to die? Uh, no, you're, you're not. not then die. you are right. Why, no, why are you saying I should tell my loved ones goodbye? No, I'm no, not we saying didn't. that. <laughs> oh my God. I didn't think it would be like this. We're gonna, we're gonna. He doesn't. You're, you're hearing things. Um... I mean, the, the first problem with that is, Bobby, do you even have any loved ones you, left? Chat? Hey, yo, hold up. That me, was me. me. I'm pretty sure I just had a heart attack. What the fuck, Choi? You're gonna what? tell a half-blind man that he doesn't have family now? No, I'm just asking. Running? I'm just asking. Like, I mean, you and Raven up, are what splits, are right? Down, so. Uh, left, oh my God, are you saying it stabbed my ear as well? Maybe. You know, we're hearing well, we, we're, let, let, let's let's check his ear to make sure the knife didn't just go to his ear as well. Let's see here. Could could be just shock from from getting slashed in the face. 
I think I can't hear. Hello? I'm Is just, anyone talking? Oh, there we but, go. No, we're we're here. We're here. It's probably just shock. I'm just seeing 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 knife wound to the face still. But nothing on your ear. I mean, you're gonna have a sick scar, Bobby. But yeah, you you ladies will love it. Star, ladies but... will love it. Oh no, tell, that's tell my him, worst fear. Tell him he's. Oh, uh, the oh, dudes the, the are men, gonna love it. Listen, yeah, Bobby, it. my boyfriend oh, totally wants to have like a foursome with you. So what? Oh, I'm just saying. He thought you were hot. Oh, he's. Oh, really? Yep. Okay. Okay. Let's 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 I mean... clean out, let's clean out the wound first. Okay. Uh, uh, sure. uh, 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 what are you doing? It's, it's a. I'm just I'm just cleaning out the wound here. Okay. It's, it's, septic. It's, 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 it's okay. It's going to burn a yeah, little bit. Yeah, I have sepsis. Do you hold someone's hands? No, uh, antiseptic. Yeah. Yeah, can we... Disinfect it. Yeah. He's so making sure be... it doesn't get Please, infected, Bobby. Yeah, you, you want... You, you, having a nice... Squeeze tight as you want. Bad, oh, but, fuck. Um, we, could, we could put a popsicle and you could bite it. You're saying I'm going to lose my eye due to an infection? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. That's the worst. You're, that no, means I have to start wearing the eye patch again. You're not going to get infected. Your eyes seem to be fine. Not even a little bit infected? There's only the two for no, seven. Right? Are you, you sure, are you sure you're doing everything right so you like didn't infect it by accident? No. Like you accidentally I'm wearing gloves didn't wear the right gloves or something, you didn't change it's, your gloves. It's it's, it's sterile in here. It's really <laughs> Hey Bobby, uh, I have a serious issue. Mike okay, Block what is it? Mike Block is trying to get at Tessa again. Yeah, I know that's why that's why I got stabbed. I was trying to stop him. Yeah, he's he's trying to get Tessa's okay. phone number and he's trying to lure her out for driving school. Okay, well, so, I, I told I told start, her multiple times start, what she needs to do. Check to see if he needs stitches. Yeah, she needs to go inside. I'm pretty sure Mike Blood got shot already like once today, so he's definitely knife won't definitely gonna go over his nose and mouth. He's still able to talk. Hey, but Bobby, I can't if see. He's across this... I, I just flushed your eyes with saline. You, you, oh, you know, you uh, I just had my eyes closed. What is it, Sharp? Uh, if I protect uh, Tessa, will you promote me? Hi. Uh, no, because you're doing this like weird culturally insensitive stuff. So it's a PR disaster uh, if I promote uh, I'm you. Pull off to the oh my God. PD real quick. Uh, okay, we're gonna. Oh my you're gonna have it. You're gonna, are, you're are you you're gonna have it. You're gonna have a really he nice. Ready to roll roll guys. Am I single? But am I gonna lose vision in my other eye? Yeah, I'm single. You're, you're not. Can you see us right now? Right. So I'm not looking. We'll but do I'm a looking. vision test. Oh. Why is uh, why is Troy uh, blind gatekeeping me? O2 is ready to escort EMS. I think it's more like mm. Bobby. We do you understand how much traffic. fun this is for me? I got stabbed in my face, and you're telling me I can still see. Yep. Okay. Oh, there are other parts of your face. So, oh, so, oh, so just the knife wound was like perfectly like in my face and not in my eye. There was so much just blood. Just like a slash right across your face. You're just saying it was like face. a perfect divine you probably intervention. probably lost part of your eyebrow. You know how you're going to have, you know how people have that fucking I don't give a fuck about cool my eyebrow. Eyebrow scar. I don't care about my eyebrow scar, okay? I'm just saying. I'm just saying, Bobby. Bobby, just say the word. I'll stab you right in the eye if you give me a promotion. Hi. I don't want to get stabbed in that. I already got stabbed in the face, oh. okay? I don't want to experience it again. Yeah, you, That was my one just, time, that was my one just, chance to get stabbed in the gonna, eye, and apparently it, it was a perfect, it was a perfect here. angle and perfect slice up my cheek and into my lucky eyebrow. You missed, missed your eyes, you know. Oh yeah, I'm, so luck, I'm lucky blood. I missed my yeah. eye. Yeah, okay, face, face wounds, they just bleed fucking everywhere. I'm I mean, it was like a splash. Luck. I'm just It lucky. wasn't like a, it was a splash. It was like, Oof. wow. Like a sploosh? Yeah, I mean, it just went everywhere. Mm, Bobby, you splooshed with three okay. O's. We're just going to bandage this up time. here. <laughs> We're just going to bandage this up Bye, here. Try to, keep, try to keep the bandaging dry. Okay. Um, so okay. you're just telling me I, I'm just, just telling me I, 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 do a vision oh, you're just telling me I have vision test. in both eyes is what you're telling me. Joy brought you in. She looked you over. You're just telling me. You're just telling me there's no knife wound in my eyes is what you're telling me right now. I can just see. Dr. Choi, when you brought him in here, did he have knife wounds in his eyes? Because I don't see No, it's just on his eyes. face. His eyes are fine. Oh, okay. I guess I'm just yeah. not blind in my one eye, so I don't have to wear oh. an eye patch. Like, uh, really, you uh, that would be correct. If you feel like got blurry Southbound vision, Great Ocean Highway, uh, entering these you, you know, you might need to wear tunnels. some goggles, though, Bobby. Just so, kind of protect you know, it's, your it's, eyes. It's the bald cap for me. What? What do you mean? They didn't cut your scalp, but they only cut the sleeve. They cut the side. Why of do you face. want a bald cap? I don't care. You know, just okay. You, you're all whatever bandaged you up. Do, you should. You got to do whatever you got to do, doctor. If I'm not blind, then you should, I guess you, you should be fine. If you, you know, applied some bandages to the side of your face, there. 
Um, like if you are, if you are having troubles with vision, we can perform a vision test. No, it's okay. I was wearing a vest. Oh, you were slashing my face. I wish uh, I had a knife. Oh wait, I do scalpels. Come here, Bobby. Um, no, I can just see or whatever. Finish, so who cares? By the way, your grandfather's Sorry? a mess. You're such a fucking diva. Yeah, I know. He's I've on been... Twitter. If I get stabbed again, I... and I get stabbed in the eye for real this time, what you know, the I'm... fuck? Was he? Then you get an he eye must patch. have been. And then we perform a vision test. That isn't even possible. possible. Bobby doesn't, doesn't have a partner. Was posted by UG. What the fuck? We're gonna perform a vision test. On I need to make so sure you properly. Why are you coming from my career, Choi? So Did try not to get stabbed in the eye. Okay, I'll try not to arrest. Choi having an affair. I'll try not to arrest the uh, culprits and get stabbed. Please. I'm telling you, just wear some uh, some goggles. Keep it safe. Yeah, you can wear. Yeah, you can wear like the knife proof Jeans goggles. The area they there. won't be bulletproof, so watch out. What's the opposite of like goggles? Not goggles. Okay. Bet. Oh, you can wear gla You can wear glasses, but hey, all right, I gotta get up. I gotta get up before the Tessa the goggles, gets murdered. At least would protect your eyes from a knife. I guess no, no eye patch arc. Okay, how you feeling, officer? I feel like I got fucking stabbed. We just had oh. one of our ADOC well, member uh, getting kidnapped by the block right now the blocks, to help with the right soreness, in front of PD. Uh, especially on the face. Yeah, I'll take the it. Anti-inflammatory eye right. patch. Uh, are they currently yeah, on here, duty here, right now? Here's so? some. Uh, here's some. Uh, uh some from, Um, they just went oh, northbound Sinner Street. Advil. Oof. Gladys came for you. What the fuck guys. am I gonna do with Advil? It's gonna hey, help, but, help uh, with the inflammation on of your face. Radio at this time? To be for a couple what about like some you real shit? What about some morphine or? You can't do your job on morphine, Bobby. Yes, I can. I've done my job with alcohol. I gotta go. Actually, I've said too much. I've said too much. Into the situation. With the four cops we have on duty, we can only do one thing at a time. We're gonna save Tessa. That is true. Tessa takes priority. Beautiful lady over there. Oh. Okay. What are we? Right, what's going me... on here? There's... Oh, this is no uh, one's in this car. Uh, this is uh, this is our car, Bobby. Okay. EMS head pump. Uh, what the fuck is happening? Oh my I'm god. Really, uh... Sorry, I just need to fix my throat. So, can somebody help a beautiful lady? What, yeah, why don't you bring her inside? Inside. Of... Yeah, I don't know what I should do, miss. Well, you you knew to take. 309 from 202 direct. Send it. Uh, when you're not busy, could you remove um, 457 from central dispatch, please? Send for it. Thank That's you. a disc, Sean, sir. Is he, is he blind? Yeah, he he obviously like can't fully see. fully blind? Uh, no. Well, maybe. No, I'm fine, maybe. okay? The the knife apparently missed my eye by a few inches and cut through my eyebrow, so oh, I have a cool Oh, thank God, Bobby. I'm, chief, I'm so worried about you. Instead of an eye patch, oh, right now I can just have two what working eyes or whatever. I don't care. Oh, wait. Hey, Bobby, you're secondary right now. Hey, lady. What's up? Let me have more cars Excuse me. than cops. What do you mean secondary? Oh, the cops. Oh, Sharp, oh, you're a right goddamn now. walking PR disaster. He, he's back right now. I'm not macking, I'm being uh, Listen, last time you macked, you, you fucking get a restraining order, okay? I need you to knock that shit off and actually Listen, take your we job. we need to focus on the bigger things. Tessa about 10% more dangerous. seriously. Yes, we do actually need to go save Tessa. Give me keys to this. Uh, yes, you need to oh save Tessa. God. Haul ass, let's go, move it. There you go, sir. I'll have you know she also got a, a restraint. Where the hell is she? Uh, Dupont, uh, she's back in my place. No, no, Tessa. Where's Tessa? Oh, um, fuck if I know, bro. We just probably felt the hornies. God fucking damn it. I think she's already been kidnapped. This is her car. Oh. Yeah, but uh, I'm not actually did, on did duty. Did you just take a slick top, uh, Taurus? Hey, Firm, I'm across the street. Oh, 10 4. I think that's, uh, my car, sir. What? Uh, I have no? What? This? We have keys to this. What are you... Uh-oh. <laughs> Is yours, like, still in the emergency lane? Is that one yours? Where did you hire no, this I had a slick top and now it's gone. 
This is not a slick top, my Oh, dude. this isn't a, a oh, no. slick top. Yeah, I had an angel slick top with a bunch of weapons in the trunk, and now it's gone. Okay. See, sir, this is what uh, I have to fight against to get a promotion. I drove him to like, the hospital. He's like a cadet that just got officer or some shit. Or isn't, he's a cadet still. What are you talking about? You have to fight against this to get a promotion. Uh, you have to do better true. than a cadet? Okay. Yeah, I mean, if Toretti can become a senior officer, basically anyone can. He right? actually, <laughs> you know, does work though. Gets paperwork done and whatever. And doesn't get, I don't know, sexual harassment cases filed against him. How the fuck did that happen? It is not time to How do did that ranking. happen? I don't know. 30976 latest 1013 out. Which officer is that? Uh, oh, that's the DOC up. member that was talked about over radio that was kidnapped by Mike Block. Who? Uh, apparently a DOC member was kidnapped right outside of uh, PD by Mike Block and company and then taken up there and either stabbed or shot. Bro, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna lose my shit. I'm at 76 to the kidnapped DOC member. Hey, firm. How the fuck well, did he get to? How the fuck did he get? Okay, I'm not, I'm, forget it. Sir, are you a bit tense? Am Do you I need a, bit... a massage? Uh, no, I need to, uh, kill Come Mike up. Block. If you see him reaching, just fucking shoot him, okay? You hear me? If you see him at all reach for anything or any of his buddies with a knife. Please 911, uh, 202. He's running out now. Uh huh, tell me more. What are your problems? Is that it? Hey, I'm just, uh, I'm just weasel news checking out what's going on here. Is it that easy to get out of a murder? Yeah. Oh, you truly are blonde. Uh, oh, we're looking for Mike Heaney, Block. Okay. An officer taking in a vehicle. Mike, Mike, Michael uh, Hunt. Uh, Taurus, LSPD heading northbound Elgin. Oh shit, I, I see a body down there. Oh, you do? Say. I and just hope that you're us. doing okay and I appreciate oh, you. God. No, this is not the way. Where do you see the body? What? I saw it. I looked low over the railing. What kind of fucking vision do you have? Some X-ray, X-ray shit or something? Just look here. Are you right fucking? Chat are you blind? Okay, here's the thing. All right, I'm gonna hold your hand. Uh, just reach down there, suspects. okay? Okay, sir. Okay, I got him. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, shit, that's not working. It uh, should. I've done it before. You wanna try? I, they say they said stay back. You can follow, but stay back. I've currently got a gun to him. He's got a gun to me. We have a 195 ah. still at the hospital. <laughs> the team of police. He had he slipped from the top railing on the dam. Are you okay? <laughs> oh no. I believe he landed on his eye. <laughs> Dispatch 202. <laughs> close to declaring this a times of chaos. We're about to start what patrolling fu in fucking SWAT vans if this city doesn't come under control. <laughs> his eye is drowning. Somebody get <laughs> help. His eye is drowning. It's out of it. What? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh, fuck. I was... you can hear me. I'm coming. <laughs> I meant to, I'm coming. I meant to do uh, a not, bit. Not, 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 not <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I don't want to. <laughs> I meant to revive myself, and I was going to kill myself. I didn't mean to revive him. Oh, shit. EMS, tell... Uh, Troy, we are all tied up with multiple kidnappings. I'm sorry, I can do that. Who's <laughs> officers behind me in the vehicle? <laughs> oh my god, help! His eyes drowning. Okay, he's requesting not to shoot him. He he's drowning. Oh my god! Devor, tell him I will not shoot. Oh fuck! And I need you to say you won't shoot. Help! 
Oh, His eyeballs drowning. Neither are gonna shoot. His eyeballs drowning. Oh my god, I got you, Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. Uh, Alright, he's requesting. I'm gonna give him a hug. Uh, oh my god. Oh, I got the DOC officer. You're much you more important. Wrong... <laughs> you got the wrong guy. <laughs> His eyeballs drowning. Don't worry, boy. <laughs> Sir, I got your eyeball. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh my god. Whoa, whoa. you're bleeding from your eyes. Sir. His eyeball what popped happened? out. Yeah, it's I got... drowning. I fell on my eye. <laughs> Give me the fucking car. Get me eyeball. out of here. That you son of a bitch. I'll never forget this. EMS from PD. That oh, motherfucker. Send it. You're supposed to hold me, not fucking push me over, you son of a bitch. Bottom of the dam to somewhere we can rendezvous. Uh, we were waiting for a code four. Tell him about oh, tell him about the it's eye emergency. Code four. It's code four. Uh, Bobby hit a rock with his eye when he fell down. We might need a couple of eye patches, maybe some an iPad. His eye was drowning. It needs mouth to mouth. <laughs> uh, did you say your twenty was at the bottom of the dam? 10-4, you need to go, uh, that's no, why I iPad. asked if he wanted to run the video. You, you, you need to go through the water up here, it's slippery. Much like the 10-4, we're in route. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> what? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> hi, yeah, hi, she, hello. Hi, she's a slippery snake. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Sir, can you see? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Help me. Oh my god, he aged 30 years too. Listen to him. Dude, I'm fucking dying. Help. We have a stolen cop car now headed east or west uh, Memphis, Gucci as well. We don't have enough officers for this. I know, sir. I know. Why did you fall over, Why sir? Why did you not hold me properly when I went over the railing uh, like that? And that's gonna be my cop car that was stolen. You, uh, you slipped. Right. Uh, 95's got away. I'm 76 MRPD to swap vehicles. Apparently, I have Bobby's car as well. Ow. <laughs> no, Bobby! Oh, no. Hi, Bobby. Uh, oh, 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 Bobby. Oh, my God. What the fuck? <laughs> Uh, I hope this is good. Oh no, Bobby! <laughs> listen, I read this in a book. I think this uh, is his eye socket a little bit. So he's he's drowning, you gotta help him. Okay, uh, I got you, sir. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, hey, Bobby. Uh, you get Bobby. Uh, I got you, Bobby. Hey, ladies. Help me. Hey. Can we wait for gone. me? Oh, yeah, yeah. I will. Uh, uh, so, did you get shot, Bobby? No, I, my fucking officer was holding me off the railing, and I wanted to see if I could reach down to the bottom of the dam to grab the DOC officer, and he pushed me off. It says I slipped, but I think it was an attempted homicide. Oh my goodness gracious. I think he wants a promotion by killing me. Making his way up the ladder that way. Oh, trying to make it quicker up there, hey? Yes. That's not a way. Ow. 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 You're gonna be okay, all right, Bobby? Uh, it's okay, I'll land. some ice packs. I landed in the mud. Tonic. You landed in the mud? Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry to hear. It was a mud landing. It's a mud landing? Yeah, oh your, your typical mud landing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry to hear, Bobby. Ah. Okay, I'll, okay, I'll, maybe the doctors will clean you up. Yeah, I doubt it. They just, I don't know, give you, like, Advil and call it a date. True, true. Okay, you're not drowning. <laughs> I'm drowning! <laughs> I got you on the rise! I got you on the rise! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh my god. Bobby! There's so Bobby. much water in my lungs. No, you don't! Oh. 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 
Oh shit, I've drowned so many times today. 421 is 10-8. <laughs> Landed on a game? one single eyeball size draw. <laughs> Uh, 421 to EMS. Send it. Uh, we have a woman outside of Integrity that just tried to blow herself up. Apparently, she wanted to roast <laughs> her vagina. I'm uncertain. What? what her actual explanation for that was that she said, but yeah. 10, 10 4. <laughs> if it's outside of Integrity, if you are able to, can you what the fuck uh, is take going her on into right Pill Mox? We have like us, four please. cops, and the city is an yeah. absolute right, disaster, sir? dude. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, hey, 685 uh, to Chief, where are you, sir? Um, Zafira. Yep, there you go. There you go. That's what I was gonna say. Oh shit! Hang on. Middle seat. Hey, what's going on here? Oh, wait, 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 wait! <laughs> <laughs> Bro, he just got up and walked. How is he walking right now? He literally fell off a fucking dam. How is he got up right now? All right, you good. You good. You know how when when somebody loses like a, a finger or something? Yeah. <laughs> what is bring... happening? You're Start paying off the bring... side of the ambulance. Hey, shut up, he's Bobby. in the middle seat. <laughs> I'm, I'm talking. Uh, no, he's fucking not. I am. <laughs> Bro, what is going on right now? Oh my god. No. EMS, we've taken on water here. Oh my god. There's water back here. I hope he doesn't drown. We're good. We're good. Oh my god, it, the water is filling up. It's up to like our freaking <laughs> knees. Oh, oh no. Give me a minute. Oh, Help, his eye is drowning. His eye is drowning. His eye is drowning. Oh my god. 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 Holy shit. Alright, listen. I am feeling like none of y'all have faith, and it's really oh gonna make god. this so oh much god. worse oh for you. Oh. Oh. oh my god. We have definitely taken on a lot of water back here. It sounds like someone is going for a promotion in the back. Oh. Wait, what's your badge number? Oh, 400. No, no, the DOC officers. Oh, 719. Wow. He's got some nice pecs. Oh. Ladies. Oh. Sir. oh. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Ma'am. Huh? Ma yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, I. I Alright, let's, let's stop it. Uh, <laughs> Tango 276, Pillbox Medical 213s. Oh, I apologize. Oh, I see. Yeah, sure. When you're, like, using this mode, you can't hear proximity voice. No, I don't. It's crazy. Do you need a promotion? Okay. Yeah. Can you put yeah. it back with Bobby? <laughs> don't put it back here. He's already almost killed me once today. Uh, hey, so oh my god! Like, when you lose uh, like, a finger or something, you're supposed to bring the finger so they can attach the finger back, you know? Yeah. So, Bobby, he fell on an eyeball sized rock and he poked out his <laughs> eye, I think. Uh, I brought the rock. Do you think you could use it to reconstruct his eye? You have to I mean, tell, you have you to tell Troy get cause... an eye transplant because that's a thing. If you didn't know that, really? I'll donate my eye to you, Bobby. I don't want that. Tinka two twenty two. I'll wear an eye patch for you, Bobby. You, don't worry. Thank you. Next time, buy me. A you can't first. wear an eye patch. <laughs> don't worry, sir. I'm here to guard you. Please no. <laughs> Oh shit, what happened? Uh, he uh, poked his eye out somehow. Oh shit. <laughs> Are you? Listen. Uh, all right. So Bobby was, I, I don't know. I think he thought he was like 15 or something. Uh, thrown off the top of the uh, dam. <laughs> Am I what? Allergic to medication. Oh my God. Oh. Oh. What uh, happened to him? Okay. Hold on. Chief, we need to talk. Okay, now's a good time. Yeah, exactly. Right now's the perfect time. One, we need to uh, talk to the judges about enacting Tesla's law, like creating a new Tesla law. All right, like, let me take a look. 
if you touch Tessa or any of the nice people like Ant, you instantly get like three X the time in jail. Alternatively, right. good luck I, passing that one. How do we get Tessa a taser, sir? <sighs> I don't know. I just got to apply for one with the Justice Department or something. Yeah, she's gonna judge. We need to find a judge. You need to. Sorry, leave. Bobby. This is mine, <sighs> chief. Uh, what? What? No, he's my <laughs> chief. Shut the. F he's everybody's chief. What the fuck? Yeah, he's Wait. our chief. Dan, are you are you fucking cocking me out of this promotion, listen, I bro? To, I, listen, I I'm still a cadet. Oh shit, that's right. Get the fuck out of here. I outrank you. You bitch. get mud all over your face, Bobby. I'm gonna just wash damn. this off. D A M. Okay. Good to know, just from my own personal knowledge. Right. I'm sure you had to think real hard about how to spell damn. Look, I fell off the what? dam. Mm. And I landed in mud. Yeah, you think, did land in mud. I'm washing your face off. I think my eye drowned. Mm. Yeah, that doesn't really work. See, you take a shower all the time and your eyes get wet and they, they don't drown. You don't know that? I actually do know that. Maybe this is the first that. case of it ever happening and we thought about that. Can't happen. You're literally 97% water, Bobby. Uh, okay, you're 97% water. Yeah, I am. We're all 97% water, Bobby. Oh, That's see. literally how it works. It's more like you can't like drown 70... in yourself. All right, I got your mud off your face. Are you a cucumber? Can you drink people? Ew. I mean, technically. No, I, I don't want. I don't want to hear about your relationship with you, Dupont. If you if blend you, them, yeah. If you watched uh, Killer Clowns from Outer Space, they used to drink people with straws or some shit. So I don't know. I mean, honestly, I think they were on something. The, like the notebook or something. You light some candles. You. Uh... What is he saying right now? I think he wants you to get a bath bomb, sir. Oh, I could use that for sure. I haven't had a bath yeah. bomb in a long time. Yeah. Mix it. I like he lush. Watch the notebook as well. Like the we butter cream. Police work. Uh, butter no, cream lavender right essence. essence. We have bigger things to right now. You can also get soaps too, which is dope. Mm -hmm. Yeah, lush strawberry soaps. watermelon is amazing. Mm -hmm. That's oh, amazing. look, there's so Stan. There's Stan. Why don't you go bother Stan? Yeah. Jagufa. Oh hell yeah! Jagufa. Hey hey hey! Again, just I love how way. I love how there's six of you in here when there's nobody in here and handcuffs for Eugene to come in and unlock. By the way, uh, why why are you so critical of our what? jobs when we do Make everything sure that we possibly can, Joy? Because there should but have you been be the most critical person of everything that we do. Yeah, because there should have been somebody in here. If there were two 95s in here and they were known risks. Ryan huh? Kindle, for example, there should have been somebody in here, not everybody chasing after a stolen car. But instead, you guys leave them alone and leave my doctors to be at risk of being held at gunpoint, which is exactly what happened because mm. somebody wants to come in here and free their fucking friends. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and say you're chief doctor and my, I listen to this guy, chief of police. I don't care okay. what your problems are. Okay, I'm drowning here. I you're literally drown. I'm exactly. dead. I'm going to die and then you can figure out what to do afterwards, okay? Then who are you going to complain to? Hey, before you go, do you mind signing this piece of paper that states that I will be the next chief? You will of never be after today. You've never become anything in your life. You might as well quit and get a different job because you're done ever getting. Want to be a doctor, Cody? How mu how much uh, morphine uh, do you need to make someone take a long nap? Hello, no, Chief Smith. I, I, I sounds like oh, attempted murder. Oh, he just fell on hey, his face in the, the mud. Fuck? I'm dead. Oh, I died. Okay. Oh. He's not dead. I literally died. You wouldn't what be. No cops okay. respond. Up this bruises here. We saw Jesus back. again. Sexy Jesus. Mm. Hey Tanner, Bobby saw sexy Jesus today. What the fuck? Ah. I'm just gonna clean you up here real quick. Uh, I get all the mud off his face. Why did you touch my leg? It's just bruised. What, Bobby? Why are you complaining crazy? about that? Let's I'm just not. I'm not. I'm just. I was alone together. I was thrown off. Or it is 1041. By such All a, right. you know, I'll clean up. Yep. Uh, soft it. touch. Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. On well, my leg. I mean, I, I hired well. Yes, you did. You did a great job with hiring all right, an all male staff. No, nah, it's so? not all male. I've got several. I do several... appreciate that, Troy. Let me know if uh, you need me to do any <laughs> favors in the future. I think I've done you plenty of favors, Bobby. No, you haven't. Mm hmm. If I can, you, you took the only thing I cared about. Bobby. You, the only thing you ever cared about was your eye patch, not like Raven or 
your children, nothing like that. Okay, let's calm down for a second. Okay, Zelda, there anybody else that might matter to him? You, you love I don't know who your that guy is or why he's more than Zelda. Speaking out you of turn. I don't even know him. He'll probably never become cop, that DOC idiot. But look. You're the idiot. See that? That's why he'll never become a police officer. He's going to be stuck in You're the one who jumped off the dam. You're just supposed to swallow is, when he says KDC? that. Uh. Oh, fuck. Does he still have his vision? No. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. No. Uh, it is good to he get is. back up. I don't have right. vision. Feeling good? Take I'm not feeling glasses. good. Hello? You're fine. I'm feeling awful. Well, that's just because you're. What's a chajif? What? Wait, what? What's a chajif? Oh, a Stanton's okay, announcement? I, yeah. Yeah, I fucked up. Yeah. All right, I fucked up. Right, Bobby, like I, don't, yeah. I don't want to see you in here again today, so I would like you to be Are more you careful. Me? I'm out here trying to save lives, and you don't want to see me in here. Okay. Yeah, that that means that I prefer you not getting hurt. Is what that means, Bobby. Well, I can't control how other people feel about me, okay? <laughs> yeah, I, you can't even control how my boyfriend feels about you, which is pretty shitty, by the way. Thanks here. for stealing the one thing I had. Here's my number if you want to pass it off to him for uh -huh. investigational purposes. Any questions, comments, or concerns, my direct yeah. line to the chief of police. Sure. In case he has some yeah, information uh, to tip off the police about ongoing I'll, crime. Yeah, I will totally of that nature. write you that wanna, down. You're, you're yes. not taking this. What? You what? haven't taken uh, this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Bobby, okay, got it. Okay. Yeah. Could I have that number? No. All right, I gotta get it. It's for my promotion, ma'am. Please. Hi. I'm not in charge of your promotion. No, but guys. All right, Chajif, I got All some right. fantastic news. Yeah, Chajif. I uh, to this Chajif, and we are okay to give Tessa a taser. I thought it was on y'all. Uh, well, it's a crime, right? Oh. Well, okay. Well, well yeah. I mean, doesn't Twang Ru have a uh, he does permit uh, to carry uh, a taser? Uh, yeah. Yeah, well, that's what I'm saying. Is there a special taser permit that individuals? Because it's against the law for them to possess a government issue. You have to taser. note it on the MDT on the record. That's fine. Okay. Uh, given the circumstances today, I don't see any reason why she shouldn't be allowed to carry one. Although oh, I feel like she might also get targeted fuck? for it as well. Uh, so. I got Mr. Block trying okay, to hold so me up You know what? Let's have this conversation. Fucking shoot him, Metzger, in the head. Please, yes, yeah, shoot whoever it is. Yeah, yeah he's loaded fun. up with four boys over here yeah, at uh, this Gucci bag. They stabbed me in the face earlier, man. Yeah, he just ran up to my vehicle to hatch it. All right. Uh, and tried to get me out quick. from like 40 mm -hmm. feet. Oh. Uh, between me and. Is he still Bobby. there? Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, I'm turned Bobby. around. So, I just didn't have any 77, Bobby. so. Told you you still no, had it. Not, we're not sure. I told you you still had it, Bobby. Hey, from 76, uh, and they're going to be an activated anyway. with that black or brown and colored van. Uh, right northbound so Power Street. We're, we're occupied times two. Um, yes, we can Mr. give Garth her a three. permit. Then she can become a target. Uh, what, what do uh, we... I did uh, not see if the others... What do you want to weigh here? What are you feeling? Welcome to my job. Uh, shit. I don't know. I mean, she's not safe at Mission Row. She was already attacked in the lobby. Uh, I would say downstairs, but we've had someone murdered downstairs before as a result of nice. officer incompetence. Hey. Nice. Uh, she's being targeted outside of pillbox. I mean, I just stopped her from getting attacked like an hour ago. I mean, a taser would probably be the most effective use if she's just out there by herself. So if that two on guy has one, and that's a thing. Then, yeah, I don't see why not. You know, she doesn't have a crime record. Uh, it, it makes sense for her to have it, especially right now, given that she's being constantly hunted and attacked by people Bobby. that are relentless. Yeah, please, I, please shop. We we literally in the middle of a very important conversation oh, right now. Oh. Jesus. All right, just note it in the MDT and give it one or whatever the hell. All right, I'm gonna see about uh, what two longs looks like. Shit. So, uh, now that we passed, gave her a taste, how about a judicial AR? Uh, also with, like a judicial shotgun as well. Yeah, I mean, the courthouse is basically a, a terrorist zone. Um, you know what? I don't want to open that door. So, uh, yeah.
All right, I've noted it in her uh, profile. I guess when I see her next, I'll issue her one. Yeah, um, no, I'm not gonna say a judicial AR. That'd be, Hello. Uh, I think that'd be a big yikes. Yeah, there's a, there's not a, like that too much. Yeah, I don't feel like judicial AR is ever, um, what's happening? What, did Coop say something? Never here? a good thing. Wait, is Coop in here? Although, what, what happened? We could be the first dude to do it, though. <laughs> was that was that a uh, evil laugh? Uh, a little bit of uh, silliness and evil at the same time. But we ain't gonna be doing shit like that. It's not good. It's not good for the public eye. But if it were up to me, yes, I'd say give me a judicial AR and I'd pull that shit and shoot anybody that wants to fuck with me at the courthouse steps. You will absolutely be fucked with more at the courthouse steps as soon as that probably ver like I, I guarantee you as soon as that state announcement goes out like there's gonna be 30 people running to the courthouse to attack you Yeah, I would get into that little ass corridor. I just line them up All I need is ammo Are you trying to turn the courthouse into like some type of like a zombie bunker pretty much Okay Oh, in this court case, you really trying to get your Camaro back? What do you mean? It's, it's not about the Camaro, Stan. It's about, it about justice. It's about integrity. It's about, you know, uh, right. checks and balances. Right. Okay. That is your right. Do you feel that you've been wronged? I'm not gonna hold it's it not me, though. You're saying you're making it like it's about me. It's about the police department, obviously. It's about... Okay, let me backtrack what I said if you feel like the PD has been given an injustice or an injustice has been done to the PD, that is your right to uh, try um, and rectify that. Medals? Like, yeah. awards? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Uh, no, no, have any, like, medals? Well, I have no that. idea what I'm going to do as a witness, so I'm just going to tell you that right now. Uh, well, you, you did yell at me. Um, and you hurt my feelings. Wow. Bobby, people shoot at you. What do you mean? Yeah, but they don't yell at me like the way you do. I don't yell at you. When have I yelled at you? You yelled at me that day and it the hurt day. my feelings. And, you know, I talked to wow. I talked to Crane about this and felt like there was strong enough conviction there to have you be a witness I on this very, very, very important criminal case. Literally have no idea what it is what i want to say I, I don't even remember yelling at you but all right um i just answered the questions so it just whatever, hurt that's fine you know hearing it from you now that you're just you're unremorseful about it i, I don't know what to be remorseful about <laughs> and now you know we started this whole war with the justice department and the police department you know I, we're gonna have to I, I don't i didn't even realize we were at war we're gonna have to figure out what you know what you want and you know what what we want to end the war okay okay what do you want so we want full control of the justice oh. department and making laws no okay well i'm just saying this is this is what we want right. what, do you, what do you want what do i want mm -hmm. um for officers not to fuck up and me look like an asshole when i have to tell them you fucked up okay well this is just this is unrealistic this whole conversation we're having so i don't think we'll ever progress forward if i'm being completely honest that's literally all I want. I, uh, for the most part, I'm trying to help y'all for the most part. What do you mean? The, the officers wouldn't the be fucking up department. if the criminals weren't fucking up, okay? That's on period. I, 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 wow. I don't even know what to say to that, Bobby. So, so two fuck-ups is going to make it right. No, you no, fuck up, I fuck up. We going to make it right by fucking up more. I'm just saying it's this 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 fuck up train is out of control and I don't see any brakes on it anytime soon. What a big golf. Okay. But it's not I about mean, the Camaro, just so you know. 
Okay, that's fine. I, I don't okay. know what it's about then. It's about it's, integrity, it looks honor. Like the court case is about the Camaro. It's not okay just because my name is on it or whatever, and the Camaro is being talked about and fast. The Camaro, you, you know something. Everything. Now that you do mention that, I do remember that the Camaro is a part of that case. Yes, it that, is. yes. It, yeah, okay. It is now, now that you brought it up, the, I do remember yes. that. Yes, I was called as witness, and I read the docket. Uh, I totally I, forgot it, but spaced my mind when I when you just right, were talking about perfect. the Camaro. Right. The Camaro that you had been paying on, you made nine payments prior. You didn't make the last payment. How, I mean, was, how uh, did you forget to make the last payment? I didn't. I noticed the 72 hour notice and I came in the city and on the 48th mark of my notice, the car was already gone. The 60th or something like that. Oh, I literally have no control over that. Well, I don't know. It's they the, give the order know, to make that shit happen. I think that was all Bailey. It's about integrity, honor. It's not about the Camaro, so we'll right. we'll no, figure it right. out. We'll figure it out. No, of course, it didn't get figured out. I'm figure just... out there was ill will involved. But what is figure this war was... that you're talking about? Figure out there was money full control to make what money? Figure out that there was a conspiracy. Things of wow. that nature. You know anything like that, Stan? Okay. Um, literally you know no idea. Conspiracy and no working with criminals. Not at all. So you're gonna play hardball, huh? It's not even hardball being played. You, you right don't now. think we have enough evidence to? I don't even know what evidence out, you right? have. You think you think we're just stupid and we don't know what's? Going I don't on. think you're dumb at all. I, like I said, we why are you why you problem. why you treat me like a goddamn dumb you know dummy? No one's treating. I'm speaking to you, Bobby. Are we here? I'm literally having a you're conversation. You're covering this you. up, aren't you? Covering what up? What's the cover up? I'm gonna go get a taser, a taser but. So what's Bobby, the verdict, I, sir? Bur Bobby, I literally don't know what's being covered up right now. You don't know what's being covered up? And no. you're in the middle of it? What do you mean I'm in the middle of it? I don't even know what I'm in the middle of. Stan, I can't say any more until I have you down in Mission Row under wow. Miranda. Right. How I mean, I'll go Answering down there right now. questions on record. Uh, okay, I mean, I'll go down there right now and I'll start answering questions. You will? Yeah, why not? Oh shit, I didn't expect you to. I thought you'd be like getting a lawyer and stuff. I don't really care. I don't have anything to hide. What do you, I'm just here. Okay. Dan, can you give us a ride to the Help police me. station? Of course, sir. Yeah. Oh, uh, Mr. Smith. Yes, sir. Uh, just so you are made known of, uh, there are other people, there are also other members of the uh, psych department who may also be interested in, you know, helping as well with the whole, um, they put the PD stuff. So if you, so if you like, so if you want, I can also send you more information of different, uh, psych members might also be willing to help. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm good the way it is right now, just cause I want to see what you can do. And if we need to staff more then we can go from there, but I appreciate you telling me about that. Mm hmm. Got a problem? All right. So, sirs, what's the verdict? Are we giving Tesla a taser? Yeah. Yeah, that's going to happen. I'm just trying to figure out why Bobby thinks I I, I think he's dumb or something. Uh, I, I, I'm here to help. <laughs> if anything. I mean, Stan, let's. <laughs> like, who the fuck is also in here? That's it's sharp. Getting sharp. Sharp. When the fuck did you get in this car? <clears throat> okay. Tessa. Yeah, you can. You have a taser now, but you mm -hmm. got promised me. Like, don't let them to. Like, you have to use I, it. You... Don't be afraid. Yeah, to use it. I'll use it. Like, if they run up to you, just tase the shit out of them. Legally. Are you, are you giving her one, Dan? Yeah. Yes, sir, I will. And I'll notate our MDT. Hey, Tessa, you feeling horny? What the fuck? Sharp? Uh, well... Sharp? No. Yeah. Knock it off. Bad. Bad. No. But he's just asking me if I'm feeling horny. I don't think it's just horny. Shouldn't be asking you this. Not as... What? Why? Supposed to be asking you if you've seen any crime and shit like that. Oh. Hey Tessa, how you doing? Oh, you know, I was just walking with a cane, had brain surgery, cause I've been attacked several oh times gosh. in the last couple weeks. You know, the, the usual. 
All right. Oh, Excuse shit. me, Tess. I'm going to interrogate the uh, Chief Justice here. Got yeah, any weapons I'm or anything gonna... like that I should know about? Uh, you have a gun. I have a gun. I'm going to take that gun off you. Oh, okay. All right. Whatever. Give it right, back. Tessa, let's go you got any other uh, things on you I should know bit. about? Drugs? I also have a bet. I also have a bet. Oh, my fucking God. How many? Do you have like a, a full stock militia in your pockets? Uh, no. I got weed too. That's... How much weed? Oh, that's that's irrelevant. Okay, it doesn't matter. Don't even try to break out, okay? We got max right. security dogs and all that. Right, right, right. Well, Your Honor, you are aware of uh, Miranda, correct? Yeah, just give them to me. Right to remain silent. Anything you say or do can be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can't afford an attorney, I'd be surprised if you couldn't afford an attorney. One will be provided for you by the state. Do you understand your rights as I've just read them to you today? Yeah. Your Honor. I do. I do. Okay. And you're coming down here on your own accord? I'm literally coming down here to talk to you to see <laughs> what's going on. So you, you felt like you have a guilty conscience and you want to confess I really yourself. don't. I'm just so curious as to what you're going to ask me. Okay. I'm at, I'm here for sheer morbid curiosity. Right here, Your Honor. This is our most luxurious interrogation room. All right. It's for yourself. Take a seat if you'd like. You want any coffee, any soda pop, any... Uh, Drugs? Nah. Nah. Okay. I'm here for sheer morbid curiosity as to what's about to be asked. Okay. Uh, let me see one second. I'm gonna... All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn this recorder on here. Turn. Turn, right. turn this recorder. Check, check, check. Uh, yep. one, two, alpha, beta, chart. Okay. Okay, that mm. works. <clears throat> you sure you don't want to take a seat? You want to relax? Uh, nah, I mean, we can just talk. It's fine. Interesting. So you do want to talk, so you know why you're here. You want uh, to no, give yourself I don't up. Know, I don't know why I'm here. Um, curious as to what you're going to ask me. Like I said before the recording, I'm down here out of sheer mm -hmm. morbid curiosity for mm -hmm. the, uh, the, for and, me being and do, and do you have, a witness. And, and you have, you've gone, you've foregone a lawyer. This point uh, as yes, well? yes, okay. I have. Okay, yes. so you're down here and you're on the court being drag you here. No, no, I have not been dragged here. Just, uh, just here out of sheer morbid curiosity. Sheer morbid curiosity about the crime that you helped obstruct. No idea what crime you're talking about. No idea what crime. Johnny, where were you on July 27th around seven o'clock Pacific time? I don't recall. Okay. I see. You don't remember the details of that day? No, I don't. Can you can you speak closer to the recorder, too? If you can? Yeah, I, I don't recall. You don't recall where you were on the 27th of July at 7 p.m. How about 6 p.m. Pacific time? Mm-mm. Interesting. Interesting. Do you recall anything on that day? No. Wow. So the whole day is just blank to you. Everything on the 27th is just gone. It's not it happened about a month ago. So, no, I don't remember that day. Okay. What's your relationship with Judge Bailey? He is a co-worker. Co-worker. It's interesting yes. you call him that. Like a co-conspirator? Maybe a good word to use? or No, just a co-worker. It's a co-worker. Okay. Are you aware of Judge Bailey's involvement with the repossession process in the Department of Justice? Uh, I know that he signed off on a complaint to foreclosure for the fast lane. Okay, so you're aware that he typically is the one that signs off on these cars yes, when I they're up for repossession on the government website? signs off on those things, yes. Okay. And how does a judge go about the sign-offs? Do they just wake up and say, you know something, I feel like being a dick. I'm going to repossess some cars. No, typically, um, they will go in, look at the docket, um, and give 72-hour notice to uh, make sure that whoever it is that needs to get pay up their car pays up their car before repossession. And how serious is the 72-hour notice? On the government website, it's a court mandate. But I'm curious, 
whether it's a fast lane policy that the government enforces or whether it's a government enforced policy that fast lane adheres to the 72 hour hold before they foreclose yeah, the 72 on hour notice they oh it's uh it's it's i believe the fast lane is not to close on anything until the 72 hours is passed interesting but is it fast lane that repossesses the vehicles or is it the judges that repossess the vehicles it is fast lane it is fast lane that repossesses the vehicles yes and fast lane has their own repossession department to your knowledge uh, I don't really know how fast lane goes about it. We just tell them, give them 72 hours before you can go in there and take back your cars. How they do it is not in our, uh, it's not something that we know. Okay. But according to the court dockets, judges are the ones that sign off on the repossessions. We sign off on the 72 hour notice after that. Uh, they go off and they can go repossess the cars. Interesting. Has there ever been, I don't know, a case where cars were repossessed before the seventy-two hour notice? Um, say that one more time. Has there ever that. has there ever been cars that were repossessed before the seventy-two hour notice? Not to my knowledge. Not to your knowledge. Have you ever heard of maybe a judge working with fast lanes to foreclose on vehicles? So that way, buyers would be able to access them quicker than they normally would as a result of the repossession process. Wicked Not to my knowledge, no. Four years, Bog. What's Not to your knowledge, but, hope but that's Colorado something that could happen. You hoped it would be less than three, also flexing on the scrubs. It shouldn't happen. I agree, Your Honor. I don't think it should happen. Do you know anybody at Fast Lanes? Just the owner, uh, the new owner, Leah Strong. You don't know the old management? I do know old management uh, by the name of... Well, his nickname was Red, but I don't know his real name. Do you know why Judge Bailey would be hanging around fast lanes in his spare time or on his work time? Um, I don't know what Judge Bailey does in his spare time, to be very honest with you. So you have you to ask him. You don't know what your coworker does in his spare time. Yeah, it's his personal time. It's not all his side personal of the thing time. I'm worried about, you know. Interesting. And how much of that time would have been his personal time? I'm trying to sort of paint the picture where you know normally judges, their mandate is to sit in the courthouse steps. So I'm wondering how much is time where you're a judge and how much time you're doing personal stuff. Is it like a um, five days a week you're doing work and then two days off? Seven days a week you're working. We kind of just set our own schedules. So whatever he does, set your own schedules. Yeah, whatever he does, what he does. Interesting. So you just do whatever you want, whenever you feel like it, within reason and within the confines of the law. Confines of it's interesting you brought up the law because I didn't bring up the law at all so far in this conversation, but you've already interjected the law into our dialogue here. Okay. Do you feel that uh, Judge Bailey is corrupt? No, not at all. Not at all. What makes you say that? Um, he's never done anything to show any signs of corruption. Is it because you've been covering up his corruption? No. Okay. So he's corrupt, but not because he's been covering up his corruption. Um. Sorry, no, he's never showed anything to suggest that he's corrupted. Are you aware of the Camaro that was repossessed on July 31st? Uh, I'm aware, but I don't know all the little intricate details of it, but I am aware that you, uh, you yourself came over and were very upset about it, and you told me that I yelled at you, to which I have no which, recognition. you know, is no obviously hearsay that... Of me yelling at you. Right. But you do know about the Camaro ZL1, the blown in the police department? I knew because you came and talked to me. <laughs> Prior to that conversation, I knew nothing about the Camaro. So you have a special interest in the Camaro ZL1 that was repossessed. I literally <laughs> do not care about the Camaro. Interesting that you know about the Camaro, but you don't know about the other cars that were repossessed? Unless you can name any of the cars that were repossessed as a result of that court order on the government website? 
like I said, um, I don't know anything about what was repossessed. I don't remember anything about it. Only reason why I know anything about the Camaro is because you spoke to me about it. Interesting. I spoke to you about the Camaro, but you had no prior knowledge about the Camaro being repossessed. No. And do you work for the government? Uh, I do. And you post on the government website? Yes. Where the repossession was court ordered? Um, on the government website, I pay attention to the things that I take over. I did not take over the uh, complaints of foreclosure from <laughs> Fastlane. That was uh, something that Bailey was handling. So that's what that would be. So Bailey handles foreclosures and he handles repossessions. Uh, any one of us can handle repossessions. Um, but as far as the foreclosure process and giving the go ahead to actually foreclose on those vehicles, yes, he handles that. Can I ask you why then we have witness testimony to you having a conversation with Judge Bailey about the repossessed Camaro? Literally don't even know what you're talking about. You don't know what I'm talking about? A conversation no. where when some along the lines of Judge Bailey had informed you that the Camaro was repossessed earlier than it should have been and you said some along the lines of this can never happen again. You don't remember that conversation ever taking place? Literally never remember that conversation happening. You don't remember that conversation happening? Uh, Yeah, I, I don't. I don't even think that conversation ever came about. You don't think the conversation happened? But I don't remember. You don't remember the conversation, but the conversation could have happened. I highly doubt that conversation ever came How about. How can you doubt a conversation happening where you're talking to the judge about how they repossess something or foreclose something earlier than it should have been foreclosed or repossessed on and then you telling him that this is something that can never happen again um because i'm pretty sure bailey wouldn't do something like that you're pretty sure yeah i'm, I'm sure that bailey i'm pretty i'm, I'm pretty sure bailey wouldn't do something like that but if bailey did do something like that and you helped him cover it up you could see why that would be seen as a crime in Los Santos. Yeah, I can't I can't help cover up something that I know nothing about. Look, Buck, all I'm asking for you is just to come clean with this whole Camaro thing. Explain right. why you helped cover up the early repossession. Clearly it's because you hate anything. the police department. I don't hate And this the was your department. vendetta, personal vendetta to stop the police no from having the Camaro in the first place. Isn't that right, Stan? You've made this about the Camaro. I thought this was about, you know, integrity. It is about justice. integrity. It's about finding the goddamn truth and finding out why the Department of Justice is repoing vehicles early and then trying to cover it up after the owners find out about it. Right. Um, I'm just going to say there is no cover up that I know of. Uh, if there needs to be an internal investigation, I'm sure we can get that settled. Oh, we're already ahead. doing an investigation oh, of this stand. Great, great. We are we are miles ahead of this investigation. Oh, I I didn't even okay. know. Please inform me of in, any information that you may have found, so that way I can take action against Bailey. Well, here's the thing, Stanton. Yeah, I'm thinking you're somehow involved in this. Oh well. Mm -hmm. But. We are willing to work with you, and we're willing to come to an agreement or a plea that uh -huh. uh, would possibly give you immunity some of the charges that we're looking to press. But you're going to have to work with us, Stanton. Okay. Um, I, I, I don't know what I'm working with. I'll be very honest with you, Bobby. I have no idea what you're talking about. You talk about conspiracies and cover-up. I hate the PD. I have a personal vendetta. You I've got never that on hated right? you guys. He's got that on record. He said he hates the PD. No, I, I, don't, I don't have a person. You said that I have I, a vendetta. I just, I just, listen, I haven't, I haven't been saying anything other than the true facts here of the of the arguments, okay? This is the, there's nothing but the facts right now. This is nothing but right. truth. We're spending nothing right. but facts. Right, right, right. Okay? fact is, you didn't say you had a war with the police department. 
I'm sorry, you said you were at war with the DOJ. Look, here's the thing. What is your relationship with Chang Gang? Uh, I can't stand them. They literally beat and stab me all the time. Interesting you say that. And yet, one of your own judges is helping the Chang Gang repossess vehicles through a fast lane import. Um, he's... He wasn't helping change. He was repossessing the cars that needed to be repossessed because the payments didn't get paid. So he was helping them repossess the vehicles. He was helping them foreclose on the vehicles. So Why was he helping them foreclose on the vehicles as opposed to, I don't know, literally no, anybody he's else? He's helping Fastlane foreclose on vehicles that haven't been paid on. Bailey is helping Fastlane foreclose on vehicles that Chang Gang wants to purchase once they're foreclosed on. Is that correct? No. He's foreclosing on vehicles that Fastlane have on record that have not been paid. I love this. It has nothing to do with Chang Gang. Nothing to do... Well, here's the thing. I mean, Chang Gang has purchased two of the last repossessed vehicles. Do you know why that could be? Is it just coincidence? No idea. No idea. You have no idea why that could be. Just a sheer, absolute coincidence that this is happening. I mean, maybe they have the money to purchase the vehicles. I don't know. Are you aware that Judge Bailey has been tossed off of a case involving the Chang Gang in the past due to his bias? I'm aware sorry, that? say that again. Are you aware that Judge Bailey has been thrown off of a case before due to his bias towards the Chang Gang? No. I believe he's even hired them as security before. Wow. No. That interesting. No. That's not interesting. No, I didn't know that. Oh. Been loving all the detective RP surrounding the that. Camaro and no. DOJ. About your co worker. Keep up the great work. I No, I don't keep track of every move that he makes. Interesting. I mean, let me you don't ask have a tracker, you, you don't have a GPS to track No, oh, why okay. would I want to track? That's weird, no. I mean, I, I have a GPS. I don't know if you guys had a GPS that tracks where you guys are. Mm -mm. No, we don't. Well, maybe you should. I mean, do you cause... micromanage every move that your officer makes? I'm supposed to, because I get blamed for every micro move that they make, so. Impressive. Really? Yeah. This That's RP is giving me shame. a case I'm of the sorry that that stress gets placed on you. It does, it's not stressful. It's my job. I'm supposed to oversee my department, Stan. You oversee your department? Yes, sir. Um, you even oversee the lives that they have outside of the department? Look, this isn't about my department. This is about your department, okay? Well, let me just ask you. Do you oversee your officer's lives outside of the department? No, I have no interest in their lives outside of the department. All right. They all have shitty lives, and they barely ever stop working, to be honest. Right. Okay, go ahead. Would you find it uh, weird if a judge was having conversations with, I don't know, not going to use criminals because everyone in the city is a criminal, but say people from the repo department at PDM about vehicles that are being foreclosed at Fastlane. Also, everyone wish Artie a happy sorry, birthday, say that Alex, again. Huh? That was confusing. Would you find it suspicious or weird if a judge, a sitting judge, was having conversations with people that work at PDM in their repo department about vehicles that are being foreclosed at Fastlane's, a different business and propriety in general? Um... I mean, if there's proof of this, yeah, it'd be weird. It'd be weird. Unethical, some would say. I'd say it'd be weird. Is that, all you, is that, is, is that it? Is just weird? It's weird. Um, You have to show evidence uh, of it. And um, I would want to know the context and what was going on with the, that conversation and everything before I passed judgment and spoke on the ethics of what was going on. I gotta leak the alerts. Interesting. You've never spoken to uh, criminals before about foreclosures or anything like that? Um, No, I just tell them to go look on the docket 
Um, and if they have a foreclosure going, they need to go pay it and then go talk to a uh, salesperson if they need to uh, figure out what's going on. Go talk to the management at that place. So you're saying that these people should be talking to management directly about any ongoing foreclosures or any repossessions that are currently happening in the city? Uh, yes. Do you think uh, somebody came up to you and said, I'm going to give you $100,000 to foreclose in the house? That would be something uh, incentivizing? Uh, no, that'd be a bribe, and that's against the law. Right, well, I'm just saying, if you want to talk into the, in the microphone. I'm talking into the microphone. Mm-hmm. That doesn't sound interesting. You wouldn't take $100,000 right there on the spot? No, I would just wouldn't. sell, uh, a, or to foreclose a house? No. I, that you someone know, is desperately trying me, to pay off for working extra let hours. Let me tell you something, Dad. You know, they have a wife, Bobby they have Smith. a kid. They're Look they're barely Smith. getting food on the table. They're trying to work their damn hardest in in, Look, in Look this in this if rat race. To, if you think money is a motivation for me, no, it is not a motivation for me. I have plenty of it. I don't need it. We've okay. seen money as a motivation before in your department, right. Stanton. So it's... I'm just asking very logically, very basic Wait, questions. Wait, who'd you see money as a motivation before? Look, we're Please not talking about before. Individual... We're not talking about before. Actually, I am talking about before, but we're talking about the now. Okay. Well, uh, we've seen what not... money does to sitting judges. Okay, that's all I'm trying to bring up. Which judge are you speaking of? Look, we're not talking about the past. We're talking about the present. I'm just saying. Which judge guys, presently are you speaking of? You guys really like money. It's all about money, isn't it? Really don't care for it. I mean, you you propped yourself up when I brought up money, and now you're sitting here asking me all these questions about money. I'm trying to figure out why this vehicle. No, the only was repo and what Judge Bailey's money. special it's, interest is in it. No, wait. The only reason why I started talking about money was because you asked if I would foreclose on a house if someone paid me a hundred grand. And what'd you answer I, that with? And I answered, no, I wouldn't. So you'd need more than a hundred grand. I wouldn't need. I don't need any amount of money. I just wouldn't okay, do okay, it unless so there was that's an fine. actual. Okay, we'll drop the we'll it. drop the money. Okay, we'll drop the money. Okay. But maybe services. I don't even care for services. There needs to be an, a legitimate reason. Weapons? For, no, I don't know. Drugs? No, Bobby. No, no, Bobby. Expensive cars from fast lane directly. If I can recall, I'm just going to pause the conversation real quick. I believe we have knowledge that Coupe Holiday purchased Lamborghini from fast lanes before. Interesting you say judges don't cool. care about money, but. I mean, Look, here we have a judge buying a Lamborghini from Coop. Fast Lanes you directly. Bring up Coop Holiday right now. I did bring up Coop Holiday. I'm talking about Coop what was Holiday. The last time, what was the last time he took a case? I'm just saying. Let's be, let's be real here. It's not about him taking a case. It's just about his motive, right? And we're seeing a pattern what of judges mean? taking money, using money, buying expensive, lavish cars. I mean, that doesn't incentivize you, Stan. I don't even a tiny bit. These other judges are spending all this guapo and you're over here and talking about how you're never going to take a- so it's more than a hundred thousand we just want to put that on record it's not a hundred there's no amount of money is going to get me to do anything judicially for somebody else interesting no money no favors nothing if it's within the confines of the law mm-hmm. and it is justified that something mm-hmm. needs to be foreclosed on it will be looked into and it will be measured on whether or not something needs to be foreclosed on. Okay. Interesting. So I'm just going through my pictures and my evidence here. I don't want the pictures to go through. Right. Bobby, you, mm-hmm. you're actually a, a fantastic officer. I will say that. It just... I think if the officers put in the officers under your command put in half the amount of effort that you have put in here um, <laughs> I think it, it would be a, a major you're telling me Stan that my officers aren't putting an equal amount of effort into other ongoing investigations in the city um, you thinking me having a personal interest in investing dozens of hours in this case 
is a special circumstance that isn't happening. No, Veronica. I don't. I don't think. Like I said, I don't think it's a special circumstance. I'm it's not. It's really that, not. It's not even about the car, really. I'm it's saying about that justice here. That's what I want to focus on. And what's right? Right. I'm just saying that I've seen you and I've seen another officer who have brought me. Well, well, first, Alton, this I will... question, and I will say, great. Um. Uh, I didn't even think you were going to ask me so many questions. Good job on that part. Um, but other officers that have... I think you're blowing work. smoke up my ass when the real issue here is what's going on in your department, Stan. Right, right, right. Why you got corrupt well, judges? Well, if you can bring me some evidence and proof that my judges are corrupt... Um, I well, it's hard to find evidence and proof if uh, other judges are covering for them. Um, uh, Don't you look, think so? Look... All the judges. And if you come subjects. forward right now, if you wow. come, if you come forward right now with whatever evidence you have, uh, this whole thing goes I, away. Right. I don't have anything to come forward with. That's the problem. Like I said, if you have things already, please tell me. I don't want any corrupt judges on my staff. First of all, I don't want any corrupt judges on your staff either, Stan. Yeah. So help None me us help that. you. You help me. Help me. Okay. Wow. What proof do you have? Come forward with it. Just come out with it, okay, man? I have nothing, Bobby. If you come I, out I with it, if you come out with it, I can't guarantee you immunity. I'm not in <laughs> What? What? <laughs> I'm just saying I can't. But, but, we'll be one step closer towards a better city, Stanton. Right. Like I said, <laughs> if you have any evidence uh, that would suggest corruption in my department, please bring If it you have me. evidence that would suggest corruption in your department i would i would 100 percent. i don't think I you would you investigate it. i don't I, think I, you I, would 100 percent. stan i think you're lying right to my face right now and that's and that's why you started this whole war it's because you knew you you knew Wait, that we'd be war? you knew Wait, that we'd be looking into you what war and so you've been trying to cover everything up burning papers i know i know you've been per burning files burning files what do you mean i can smell smoke about? near the department of justice when i drive by it Near the courthouse, I smell smoke. I know you're right. burning stuff. Right. It's probably the taco trucks that be outside the goddamn courthouse, brother. I'm it could be a number of right things, now. but the fact the fact that you're blaming the taco trucks instead of possibly, you know, right. someone in your own department burning, you know, files on on this investigation says a whole lot. Look, my... I'm done with this interview. All right, Bobby. I'm going home. Wow. Okay, do anything else uh, from me? Um, no, Bobby. I don't Talk to my lawyer if you need more. Uh, I'm uh, done with this okay. conversation. What, what do you mean? Oh, I gotta turn off the I, I came here all about old religion. You questioned me. You questioned me, Bobby. What, why would I need to talk to your lawyer? I don't know. I didn't learn anything, but he's pretty fucking sus tell you that much just look at him walking sus and talking sus and talking about evidence now we don't have any even though that's partially Stop true door right here i mean it's not all true because we do have some evidence but still you can't just say we got no evidence just because we don't have any evidence we have some evidence. I need to know what war we're talking about because I wasn't even aware, aware we were at war. I don't know. Maybe you should wake up earlier then. Wake up earlier? I don't know. If your leaders are going to start wars with, you know, the police department, you should probably be around to know what the war's about, Stanton. Wow. Okay. Um, I'll, I'll go fill myself in. Yeah, you're going to go talk. Talk to them about this conversation. And you're going to go oh. start burning more files again. I'm on you, Stan. Trust me, we're miles ahead on this whole investigation, okay? Nothing you can do to stop it now is going to stop this investigation going full okay. forward. Well, that mean nothing. That? Hey, is that DOC guys? Unless you lie. Uh, I didn't no, even realize he, uh, we were at uh, war, but uh, okay. Because if you lie, then we can't really prove it. Right. Um, oh, that's good. I, I just want to know, like, Maybe, like are there, like, stipulations like between us with this war and everything? Mm -hmm. Like, I, I'm... I'm so lost right now. Uh, yeah. Like nothing below the belt type shit or what? Like, um, I don't know. I, I haven't really fully thought about it yet. 
because I've been doing these okay. other investigations. But right, if if we do go to war, I guess like I don't know, first to uh, like fifteen tasers or something. Wow. Okay. Um, we could I do don't more. Have a taser, oh, but, you don't have um, a taser. You I have do not. Um, kind of tend to not carry them because Mike Block likes to pull up on me and try and rob me all the oh, time. Oh yeah, so. yeah, true. Okay. Yeah, I don't feel like just giving them free laser, late tasers and shit. Okay. Um, but anyways, it's it's whatever. I'm gonna go talk to my staff and go figure out who started this shit and what this. Oh, is Oh, you're gonna talk about. to your staff? We've, yeah, I'm gonna see. I didn't. You're gonna even leak this we investigation. Oh, you're talking about the war. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's fine. Yeah. I didn't even realize we were at war. No, I mean, this investigation, that's that's all you, the confidentiality and whatnot. All right. All right. Um. So anyway, uh, yeah. I, good good day to you, Bobby. Yeah, I, I good day to I'm you, too, right. Stanton. Or should okay. I say? What's going on? No, actually, yeah, Stanton's fine. I, I, I can think of a different. All okay. Oh, all right. All right. It's, it's all fine, Bobby. Have a good day. What are they doing this Thank time? Thank you, Bobby. I Let me know if there's any more cars for sale at Fast Lanes too when you get a chance. Um, there won't be any cars going up for sale at Fast Yeah, because you'll be buying them all so you can oh. resell them for profit. Why? It's literally no cars going in. No cars are going to be in sold right now, Bobby. I'm telling you, Bobby, there's nothing going to be in sold. All right? All right. Is there, Until next time, Your Honor. Is there any reason? All right, Bobby. Have a good one. Are you a snitch? <laughs> Is that funny? Hello, Mr. Stan. I didn't think we were going to get much out of Buck anyway because the evidence surrounding him is kind of circumstantial, but it's still kind of warranted that we have him come down here and uh, have a uh, conversation about the whole thing. All right. Well, you're talking about the boy. Uh, I got some food that's downstairs. I'm sure I'm going to be meeting Andy for a little bit longer. We still need like three more people to interview. Um, hopefully we got like three or four days to do it. So, and one of them's a criminal with a Chan gang. So I don't know if we're actually going to be able to progress far with that, you know? Uh, shit. So you like meeting on good for lore building? Uh, it's good for lore building along with some other stuff. Ugh, what's this clip? Uh, I don't talk I just, to my lawyer if you need more. Uh, uh, I'm uh, done with this conversation. What, what do you mean? Hold on, I gotta, turn lawyer, up, uh, I gotta turn I, I came here on my own volition. You questioned me. <laughs> you questioned me, Bobby. What, why would I need to talk to your lawyer? You want to give a blind person <laughs> driving lessons, Tessa? <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad to get a kick out of it. It was pretty lighthearted. Okay. Uh, yeah, but yeah, it's tough. I mean, if it really what it came down to is uh, he, we need him to have a conversation with Bailey. And if he didn't have one, then that's it. You know, it's either he did or he didn't. And we don't have much evidence what are you with thinking? that. So what are you thinking? Putting a blind man behind the wheel. if that's the case in that, you know, <laughs> Yo, it's hard to in the DOJ. I wouldn't say that much, especially when you just have like circumstantial witness testimony. You want to give a blind person a license for a couple hours, like there's not gonna be a lot of damage. <laughs> it goes to ready. I sort of process stuff of last days. I think it's all RP. Yeah, it's all. I mean, it is all RP. Originally, I mean, even me repoing the car uh, was just RP, or uh, not repoing it, but um, getting it back for evidence was just RP. So. Uh, it'll be funny either way, I think, regardless of what happens with it. I think. Uh, we've never had uh, LSPD, uh, LSPD sue the DOJ before, so I think it's kind of funny. Anyways, I'm going to go grab my food. It should take me like, you know, two minutes. Be right back.
Bob. I'm so sorry, Mom. Hi. 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 So, Bob, about that promotion, um. Just trying to get a promotion. Hi. No, but you should be soon. Yeah. Hey, Bob. Uh, Bob is not Jordan. here right now. Bob is very busy thinking very hard about my promotion. Hi. Oh my god! Why is every I can I'm I can't hear that word anymore. Promotion. Oh my god. Promotion. Ah. Uh. Hey. Oh, fuck you. What the hell is going on here? What is this? I'm your senior. Stop it. What the fuck is happening here? You see this? I'm getting. <coughs> you see, this guy wants a promotion, Bobby. Don't fucking do this shit in my office. I. Thank you. He, he, he assaulted me. Bobby. Oh, he was gonna say he started it. Oh, I, I like defended child. your honor, uh, and that uh, Jordan, why the fuck is he to talk to you? Did somebody attack me? I, yeah, yeah, Ma Cody Ma did. Mant is. Uh, These are fucking goddamn idiots. Uh, Jordan Walker's here to talk to you, I guess. Uh, before that, um, 408 is hailing you on the radio. He needs to know the charges against Mike Locke. 309, uh, back on radio. 408, did you need me? Uh, yeah, what were Mike's original charges? You said he stabbed you, so... Uh, no, I, th I think I could just give him a assault uh, on, on oh, Tesla Lamb. That's what he was originally uh, stopped for. Somebody else had, had uh, stabbed me, part of that crew. I can't remember who. But Mike Block specifically uh, got out of his car, threatened me with a, a hammer, but he also attacked uh, Tessa what? in front of Pillbox. That was the original... Uh, uh, traffic stop. Did he batter her or did he assault her? One sec. I think they're the, the same car. Hey, now, Tessa, right? did Mike uh, attack you outside of pillbox? Uh, yes, sir. Did he, he, did he tackle you or did he uh, hit you with a hammer? Do you recall? I mean, I don't know if he specifically don't, don't, tackled you know, me, but he did have a knife here. out and was chasing me. I guess, I mean, you can give her assault because he it's did the same charge, Bobby. Well, battery would be he, he attacked her, but I'm trying to figure out whether or not he, he in fact, attacked her. Um, there was a man in a brown shirt. You're a fucking asshole. I love you, too. 
Uh, there was a man in brown shirts that was also chasing me. Uh, he okay. was the one that tackled me. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. We yeah, we got him in. Uh, the I think we're gonna have him in custody here. Is Tessa still at MRPD, by the way? Or hey, for him, yeah, she's upstairs. We're trying to protect her. Well, there's nothing you can do at this point. Well, we can just shoot him. We can just arm you and give you class two. Sir Walker, do you want to talk to me? I did. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Now now's a good time. Damn. Is that already? A little more information on what we spoke about yesterday. Oh, perfect. I can't stick around too long. There's uh, terrible storms outside there. I don't know if you see them, but uh, yeah, lots of terrible storms. Okay, so it appears that Fastlane is not the only one that has uh, vehicles that have been sold when they shouldn't be. Uh, okay. The tuna shops now doing the same deal. And what, what do you mean because, by when they shouldn't be? Well, I don't know how, but I bought a M4 BMW from the tuna shop. When they were first imported into the city, so on Mr. there was Block. four He's of them available surgery. that were imported. Um, and now all of a sudden today, there's been another one sold. So I don't... I'm actually going to go to a lawyer and speak to them because I wasn't consulted about it or anything. I bought mine and paid good money for mine, thinking, you know, there's only going to be four of them available. Oh, so you're saying they're uh, overselling inventory, basically? Yeah. So and I even I even rang them and spoke to them and uh, when I spoke to Tommy there he told me that he was instructed to sell it. So instructed to sell it and, by by who? Did you say? Uh, by the manufacturer, I think, or the hmm. owner of the tuna shop, which is Eddie. Interesting. Uh, and funnily enough, it was sold to a cleaning a gang. CG member, member of Chang Gang. Yes. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So yep. I'm not real happy about it because my car's just devalued. It, it owes me like I paid like six hundred thousand for it, so it's it's worth less now because there's more of them out there. You know, it's not so. Uh, yeah, I mean the whole point was that it was limited stock, and that's what you yeah. bought yours for. Originally, was under the impression that you had a one of X Wait, amount of cars, say, which what? increases its that's value. Correct. But if what? The manufacturers now manufacture more of these cars. They're, I mean, breaking their contract as well. Sorry. Uh, yeah. Yeah. You could sue the manufacturer. Did you know the Bob is going to sue the manufacturer promotion? as well for you know just deceit or the tuner shop in this case? Thank you. Yeah. He said I had all. So I think I think I will. I mean, I if, I but wrong. thank you for that information. Does sort of point us in a direction as well that's what? outside of just oh, the umbrella of fast I lane. Work hard. Yeah. Okay. So I figured you might be interested in yeah, that. Yeah, that's definitely very interesting. Because uh, it's not the first nice case guy. where uh, it sounds like CG's getting vehicles uh, sold to them specifically. Which I'm trying to figure out why. I don't know if it's just coincidence or not, but... Could be. I mean, they yeah. had uh, allegedly somebody that had interest in uh, Fast oh. Lane's vehicles oh, just earlier that week. Something, uh... And I think Fast Lane's denied them, so I think Tudor yeah. Shop yeah. Yeah. let them yeah. have them or something, so... I'm only yeah, I'm doing not too it sure. for promotion. Okay. Hey, all right, no worries. All right thank you. That was all. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe, maybe. Let's stop all right. my goddamn stenographer. Oh, right, you don't have a key, shop. sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. Hey. Yeah, that's a mighty fine. All right, you have a good one, Bobby. You too, Mr. Walker. Thank you again. Hi, Bill. How are you? Hey. Looking good. Uh, who is this? <laughs> Thanks, like Santin. Uh. Is this four, sir? No. Uh, copper. With blonde no. hair. Reinhardt. Oh my god, I haven't seen you in forever. No. Uh, it's ready. Uh, same, same, That's, same usability mm, scale. Look at it all. I think what? Too. Same what now? Ooh. Looks great. Uh, I think her name is Trina. Uh, Bobby, I'm going to grab you. Wrong. Number. Okay. So uh, 415-017-9042. That's my number. Okay. Uh, Zose. Zose. It's not even funny at this point. 
Did Tordy fucking run out? Did he just come in for his five minutes of work and leave? Probably. <laughs> Sir, I I just wanted to let you know that I uh did uh, I did a lot of you oh people. My. I draw I drove very fast. I uh, arrested criminals, Mike Block. You know. Sir. Cody, I don't care about your personal problems. What the fuck is this? What are you doing? I... D dropped something. Okay, well... Make sure to pick it up. Put on some goddamn fucking pants. This isn't beach All season. Right. It's like fall. Uh, Cody, I see you are also blonde, hardworking, and homo. <laughs> ah. Four zero eight from three zero nine. Send it. Uh, are you uh, coming back after the storm, or is this just going to be your one hour for the week? Okay. First of all, motherfucker. Uh, ten three, ten three, ten three. Coverage. Second of all. Break, break, break. When the hell did you grow a pair of balls? Third of all, no, I I don't think I'll be back. I was just covering until storm. All right. Well, thank you. We've had a uh, fucking disaster today. Yeah, a firm. I will be back shortly, though. Um, but if you need someone, just email me. Copy that. Thank you. Listen, it, we got we got Tessa a, a taser. It's been a successful day in my book. Just be advised, Mike's gonna be in ICU, by the way. So uh, putting him on a police hold. Copying the doctors. They're aware that he's in cuffs. He's not gonna fucking run out of the hospital yeah. ICU. Okay. sometimes I'm like, I see you, and then they wake up. I'm going to run out of the hospital. Dude. I'm not saying that Penta will do that, but that's the reason why we have to be like, okay, you can ICU, you, but you're going to have to come back and tell people uh, that you need to be transported from Pillbox. Um, hey, I just wanted to say thank oh, you Jesus. for your help. Scared Sorry. me. I didn't mean to. No, it's all right. I, I just oh. wanted to say thank you for your help today. No problem, Miss Lamb. That's uh, that's what I'm here for. It's literally my job. Ah. Uh, you got your taser? I do. Great. I do. I don't want to brand this shit right now. But yeah, it's it's fine. I do. Your uh, MDT profile should be noted that you are in possession of it. I've signed off on it. So if an officer does pick you up, you just have to say, "It should be in my MDT." Chief of Police uh, issued it to me, and that should be the right. right conversation. Okay. Okay, I appreciate that. Yep. No worries. Just uh, trying to. Get murdered, because that would be bad. Okay, I will make no such promises. Thank you, okay, sir. Okay, well, I'll, I'll try. Coop, by the way. What are, we, why are you guys saying Coop? Did Coop? Did Coop come in here earlier or something? Everyone keeps saying Coop. Coop signed off on it. Well, I mean, in RP, I don't know that. Coop? Okay, that's fine. Uh, dispatch 202, show me 1042. Y'all stay safe out there and have a good night. Hey, for me too. Thanks for playing. Fuck is happening right now. What? 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 The chief of police, what are you guys talking about? Dan saved it. Nah, you guys are capping. You're saying I had a spelling mistake or something? I doubt it, bruh. Your boy don't misspell.
I have to renew my driver's license tomorrow. Do I need, should I make an appointment? I'm going to need for it. I'm not looking forward to that. Yes. Uh, okay. I didn't, I just kind of want to go in there and chill, dude. I don't really want to make an appointment. It's too much social pressure. Different types of identification. Well, I just need my driver's license. To be renewed. Yeah, it's just a renew. Do it to be safe. Proof of residency. Well, I have... I, I need my green card. And I know I need to like bring in some mail that has my fucking address on it. Like a bill. I didn't, I didn't even have to go to the DMV to renew my license. Really? I thought they like retake pictures and prints and all that shit. You need two pieces of mail. Okay, that's good to know. I should bring a crossword puzzle. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I know, I know that shit takes a while. I mean, anytime I've gone to the DMV, I've had to sit there and wait. I've got, I had to go to it multiple times for when I moved to California. It was actually really fucking annoying. Because I just bought my vehicle and um, I had to go down there like, goddamn, like seven times. Because each DMV person in California was like, you need this paperwork. So I come down and bring in that. No, you actually need this paper. So I'd go back and try to get this paper. You need the you need the uh, the car dealership to send you this paper so we can and it's just fuck. I hated my life, dude. Yo. Anna Riots, thank you for the five gifted subs. Appreciate that. Hexagonist also. Subscribe with the tier one, thank you. If you're ever in California, you can do all your uh, DMV stuff at AAA. Alex Hart. It saves so much time. Interesting. Well, good thing I'll never be in California again. Old photo and renew online. Hey, Bobby, can I have a conversation with you before I go 42? Uh, it's like the only reason why I'll be sticking around. If not, I'm going to go 42 if I can't have the conversation with you. Sure. All right, perfect. I mean, that's... Is that actually... Is that PBR or is that PB? That's not WR. Is that is that WR? Wait, is that actually WR? WR any percent? Like I said, it's post tsunami with NA times. Yo, I actually predicted this earlier. I said for it to be WR, it has to be post tsunami NA time high pop. But it was like it was like mid pop. It was like low pop. That's crazy, bro. Yo, fucking that's WR. I, I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong. We'd have to um have to fact check it. Cause like we have to fact check it with like snows and uh, ravens times and shit. That's fucking crazy, dude. That was weird. So now I'm unemployed. Yeah, sorry, I was gonna tell you. Oh. Should get the speed run timer and fuck. Okay. We're uh, dog. So yeah, uh, hey, uh, friend. So I uh, did you get my letter that I left on your desk? Hmm. I forgot to take a look at it. Gotcha. I got it though. Uh, I, just, I had some yeah. shit on it. I was kind of confused. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, the main thing is like. You know, I I really want to put my name out there, you know, to try to be better and to, and to do better mm -hmm. and like take people under, you know, especially like with, you know, stuff that's going to be happening. PD, you know, going to be getting bigger and everything in the future eventually. Hey, Brian. And like, you know, I mean, I, 
I know I made a mistake with my, you know, with the PDAR and my penis. Mm -hmm. Like I, you know, but I, I really needed my penis back because I really needed to use it. You right. know, and it does yeah. happen sometimes. You know. Yeah. You don't get your penis back. It creates all kinds of problems. Um. What's um? So, how were you arguing with Joy? In the pillbox. What was that about? Uh, just to me actually. You want to do? Uh... She what? She apologized to me. She actually just gave a recommendation to Ripley, and I was surprised the crap out of me. I was saying at pillbox like when I was dying, when I almost oh, died. Oh yeah, so she was she was coming to I me. I was on my deathbed, and you were arguing with my doctor, who was trying to save my life. Well, she wasn't trying to save your life. She was standing there arguing and yelling at me. Right. Yeah. It was a new and argument so, back, and so my time of death could have been any second. Well, you almost killed me. I, I didn't almost kill you. All right, no, Bobby, I couldn't. I there's no way I could almost kill you. Also, you don't you're not wrecking eye patch. Did you have an eye again? Yeah, it happened a while ago, actually, because Troy ripped it off. Mm -hmm. She said I was faking my eye, which had healed like three months prior to that. That's I don't know. That's really really weird that she. Um, uh... Okay, I can definitely um so... run it up the ranks. See what everyone says. See what the sergeants yeah. think. I mean, so say it said, you know, like if I'd hit the the successful raid, because I had never done a raid before. He was like, all right, all right, little one or whatever, you know, or, all right, uh, I can't do an Australian accent. I, I can try, but. Mm -hmm. oi, 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 oi. Okay, that's that's a different thing. I He was like, you know, if you. Wait, did you, did you rob a bank earlier? No, oh. uh, maybe several months ago. Different timeline, though. Okay. Uh, Statue yeah, of limitations, so, so you're probably fine yeah, anyway. Yeah, exactly. But, you know, he, he said that if I hit that raid on Buddha to get all of his houses in Grove or mm -hmm. Lean Street wiped, you know, then I'd just be senior officer, right? So I stayed awake because he said that to me like six hours at the end of end of shift, I'm right? DZ. So I stayed up for an additional, Bobby, I stayed up for seven hours longer just to make that raid happen. Relentlessly did paperwork and everything. And now I haven't seen Sozi. It's like he's winning my A. I was so I feel dead inside, you know. <clears throat> uh, yeah. And then Angel said, you know, like they, they don't even know if Sozi actually said that to me, but like he said it to me. I wouldn't just lie to you guys, you know. Is Sozi told? I mean. I mean, for God's sake, I'm the, I'm the person that came to you guys and was like, hey, I gave a PDAR to get my penis back. You know, like I I was up front forward about that. Mm -hmm. Like I own up to the things that I do. Yeah, I mean, Snow didn't really particularly like that, but. Yeah, know, well, I happen. mean. I, I think if he, if it was his penis, you know, it'd be a different story. I'm like, oi, bruv, I wish I had my penis, bruv. Oh, what's that lady of the lake? Oh, bruv, you need you need a PDAR, bruv. Sure, sure thing, bruv. Because they can't say you know, they're, they're th H's or F's, you know. Sure thing, bruv. Um. Sorry, what were you talking about? I'm just uh, uh, you know, my okay. my future. You, you know, want to be being... promoted? I, I would love it, you know. I would love to love to be a senior officer. And, and FTO, then so the they had is, some special like, condition, but you didn't pass it or something. And he, you never saw him again. No, I, I did. Yeah, I, I mean, did it, pass it. I, yeah, I, I hit mean, the warrant, and we got you know it went really good. And then look, you uh, know, the search and seizure happened. The Soze thing. I mean, those are special. Like uh, we'll call them side quests. Uh, I have no, okay. you know, I have no information on what Soze does with people. I mean, God, I heard a trooper got promoted for uh, impersonating a judge the other day. So, uh, you know, that, that's that's kind of how that uh, happens, but it's not really my department. That's just uh, trooper yeah. shit. Um, having said that, uh, if a trooper thinks it's okay for you... This coffee's hot. If a trooper thinks it's okay for you to uh, become a senior officer, I don't see why you can put your name out there. Although, uh, yeah. you know, I'm having... Uh, See, I'm I'm relying more on senior officers than I, I sergeants at this point. I seriously don't want to look into your freaking butthole. I mean, butt if you're hole. ever needing somebody what? for a sergeant position, what the fuck I'm is going on out there? Wait, where, where? What do you mean, sir? Stop shouting! Me and Bobby's trying to have a private conversation. Hello, sir. Shut yeah, up, I... Dan. 
You got your knee pads you on, Chet. Do I need them? Is that suggested? You might. No, you don't need if I hear the P word one more. It's carpet in here. You're fine. In the police force. Oh, gotcha. What P word? He probably um, has some spares in his desk. Yeah. So the thing is, you know, like even if you guys needed a sergeant someday, I mean, I know, like, I just, I'm, I'm not trying to jump ranks or anything like that, but you know, I'm around often. I take lead on a lot of things. I know Snow wants to make me a flight instructor the moment that I become a senior officer. Because, you know, I, I teach people how to fly like I can teach them because I'm really good at it. Or at least I've never blown up. How long have you been an officer for? Um, prior to coming back to the city, because, uh, I mean, I've got a complicated past, but uh, overall four years. No, I mean, like, how long have you been hired in this department? Oh, here? Yeah. Uh, four months. Okay. Hmm. Okay, yeah, you're coming up on it. Um, put your name out there. See if I can uh, get back to you on it. Uh, we will meet really again soon. Uh, no promises, obviously. But uh, yeah. if I'm seeing you around, you know, helping out with the city and all that. You know. Absolutely. The less problems you create for me, the the higher chance of uh, doing well in this environment. Yeah, well, I mean, Just outside of losing I... my penis, that's the only thing I've gotten in trouble for. Right. I'm aware of that. Yeah. Okay. All right, man. All right. Well, I, agree, I greatly appreciate it. I, uh, and yeah. The fuck is going I, on they're, out they're there? They're oh, fantastic. no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Something's on fire. It's not that guy. Wait, which guy? It's the one more job guy. Oh, that's actually really good. Uh, if that's, if that's Cop Leon, I'm working with Cop Leon along with Snow and multiple others. Uh, no. They, he's actually. No, the criminal. Uh, you remember the one last job guy? Oh, um, the Jewish guy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, but if that's Cop Leon behind us, yeah, there's actually, um, for what it's worth, a lot of people thinks that he would eventually be someone that's, uh, that would be a good addition to PD. He's been going under, like, you know, technically not under cover. He's been a CI and giving us a lot of good information. And so we're stacking up like a lot of reports and he's helping get weapons off the street too. Fuck. Okay. Oh, all right. Yeah. Well, I will let you deal with that and I'm going to go 42. All right. But, uh, yeah, good one, I greatly appreciate it about me. Yeah. Just, you know, be around like you are and I'll uh, keep an eye out for you and what you're doing. Crocodile what you're Thank you, sir. Yeah. Yeah. I guess he does. <laughs> Where have you been? What do you mean, where have I been? You, you, I, you look what different. What the fuck is this moped in here? Whose moped is this? Uh, oh. There was some kind of French guy in a scuba suit, and Wicked he stole shit. a telephone, a uh, keyboard, loop. and Dan let him get away. Well, Dan is a cadet, a so it makes sense. Oh. Oh. Sorry, you didn't see the car out there? I'm about to go in the spot. Hmm. That's pretty good. Shit. Crab, crab wonton. Oh, no chips. It's not oh, bad. Perfect. Then you'll mm. be fine. Yeah, I just want to. So, my, I guess another one of my. Oh my god. Can you chew any louder? Sorry. It's okay. I need to jump. <laughs> <clears throat> Fuck. I'm gonna choke, dude. I'm gonna choke for content. Jesus. All right. Jesus. Okay. Yeah. Wait, if I renew a driver's license? Never mind, I'll figure it out, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> I said, yeah, that's what I was looking at, Artemis. 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 Relax. Our teenies. Yo, y'all eat with chopsticks or what, dog? Hell yeah. Uh, have a good one, Miss Block. How you doing, Bob? Is this, uh, Jonathan 
Da Vinci over here. Jonathan. Hey, what's going on? Why didn't we arrest that woman that stabbed people after you guys found murdered people that were stabbed? Uh, we could. We don't have evidence. That's the issue. We could, You don't have a 911 that says I stab people and you found well, stabbed bodies? Well, I don't. I, do, I actually don't know. Okay. Me and Brian want to interrogate her. Okay, because so. you could have arrested her based off of that is what I'm trying to say. Okay, well, I mean, I didn't have the 911. I didn't see it. It's all the Brian has okay. that. You want to talk to Larry about it? Because he's going to be pulling on here as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's the one that got on my ass in the first place. And then I saw your name and blood boiled through my fucking veins and start, like started sticking out of my forehead. Oh, I see. So. I never do that to him. Um, No, you absolutely do that to me. Well, on multiple <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a good one, Bob. Uh, <laughs> I see. Put away a bunch of murderers last week. For this week. Yeah, I put away a, a guy who killed seven people. Mm -hmm. And raided Sonya Summers. Okay. Damn. All right. Go Devon. Well, I put away four murderers. Fuck yeah. And uh and I put away six cultists in the morgue. Well, hmm. I didn't do it. They did themselves. But, yeah. Wait, that was today. Wait, what? We had like poltergeists in the morgue. Ghosts attack people. The fuck? Col I, cultists the summon cult spirit. Well, I think the Steve cultists. Shit, yo. The cultists died. And they uh -huh. got resurrected in the what morgue, the and they channeled ghosts. That's my understanding. <laughs> hey, uh, do we have the Ghostbusters division? All right. Oh, good. The, the chief's actually not in his oh, office God. for one. They're swarming. Run, Bobby. Run, Vincent, run, they're swarming. What is... hey, Wait, hey, Brian. Brian. Bobby, get on. Yeah. I'll get you Brian. out of here. Brian, I got to talk to you and Divine. Wants... Yeah, the chief wants to talk yeah. to us. Oh, my God. Hey, it's Larry. Owen. My favorite cop. Larry, let's go. We got to... Sun Sensei. How you doing, buddy? Larry. Hello. How you doing, sir? I'm doing all right. How about yourself? Yeah, How's the eye? How you doing, uh, uh, Mr. The eye's yeah. perfect. Yeah. That 2020 no, vision, sir. What, um, what about your other eye? Uh, 2020. Too louder. Okay, so you no got. Why do you have an eye patch? Uh, to see in the dark. Oh, okay, like a pirate thing. Yeah. Oh, okay. That actually, makes eyes take about 40 minutes in order to adjust to the dark. Mm -hmm. So the eye patch What's allows me to. So you take it off uh, every 40 minutes. No, you oh. swap it over when you have to go into a dark area. Oh, okay. Got yeah. you. It's what pirates used to do in order to get to the bottom deck. Wait, is that true? Yeah. Uh... People typically associate uh, eye patches with having some kind of, you know, eye issue, but normally that wasn't the case. Larry, these are the officers that were on that... Uh murder report we wanted to ask them why which one were you talking about copper pot murder. wasn't copper arrested problem. oh copper pot yes uh, oh that one wait hang on so we tried to reach so. her we couldn't reach her uh it's unclear as to whether that phone call took place in relation to that killing uh therefore uh putting out any kind of Thing beyond a bolo would have been not so yeah, ideal. Yeah, was the interrogator. Yeah, but she was nowhere to be found. It's gonna hold up. Yeah. I mean, we don't even like. I, I can't even claim that she's. We have so many fucking murders in the city that her saying, "Hey, I fucking killed two people," could literally be anything. Hmm. Amen, brother. Uh. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing wrong with the report. I was just asking if, like, anybody was caught. Or I just, like, was wondering if anybody was caught from it or, like, what, because no, I didn't hear about any of this. Wait, hold on Whoa. a second. Let's pause. You had to go to the chief of police. You had to go all the way to the chief of police to ask a question that could have just been directed at one of us. You know, he's a well, very busy talking, man. First of all, first of very all not busy true. Man Bobby here. was not busy at the time I asked him. I was very Secondly, busy. He's very always busy. busy. And if he's not busy, he needs his goddamn rest. Oh my God, first thank of all, you, Bobby Brian. doesn't rest. Second, so I went to him you. because I was already in the middle of a conversation with him and asked him about it. Okay, thirdly, so you're like already I said, bothering I wasn't... him, so you figured you'd bother him more. First of all, it's not <laughs> bothering if I'm already in the middle of a conversation with him. It's not bothering. It's like the first it's, part it's of the conversation was the bothering. This is the word you're looking for, Larry. What? You're inciting or instigating, I think, is the word you're looking for. I'm instigating? Yeah. Instigating what? I don't know. So I'm not instigating. 
you're uh, inciting. Inciting what? Riot, We're supposed to be on the same team. I'm here, inciting a riot. I mean, how it sounds. Yeah, just is stop dodging uh, the conversation. Yeah, it seems like you're just <laughs> what? You're taking up all the chief's time over here. I can 100% guarantee I'm not the one taking up his time. I'm asked. I asked literally. He did does, this he person get caught or anything going on with this time? Though you guys are right. Okay, you want to go? For, you want to go through the Camaro? Oh uh, yeah, just, just calm down. Let's talk about, let's not talk about the Camaro. Okay, let's talk about the murder. All right, yeah. Let's not talk about taking up your fucking time then. Larry, all I'm asking is if anybody down, was caught right? for this. You're, you're sweating. You're freaking all over out, the place. Ryan. I'm freaking out. Were you gonna punch me? No. What? You gonna you gonna strike an officer? I had to put you in. No, he needs his. They're probably shooting you. Don't do that. I'll shoot them back though too. Don't worry. Larry, you gotta jump there. I've shot Brian before in the kitchen. Wait, what the fuck? You remember when fucking you and uh, I think it was Pratt or Jordan Steele fucking attacked me in the kitchen? Wait, did we? Yeah. Oh fuck! And like one of you, you shot me, or uh... I had to fucking shoot at you. Uh, hey, listen, I, I, we moved past that. That was months ago. Oh. Yes, sir. While we're on the topic of getting a hold of you, were you able to get in touch with my DA or ADA? Uh, pertaining to... Well, I think there's like two different investigations you wanted to talk to him about. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with me. Uh, finding, me with cities, <laughs> fi finding me in the... Unless I recognize what photograph you identify with, I you're mm -hmm. probably buried in... in loads of un of of messages that i'm it's unable okay. you know hey so what you're I'm telling so me is it's just, awesome. it's just best to try to catch you in the city do you think you can get me a better train ticket please oh shit. Okay. yeah i feel that true so you're telling me that it's, or it's like, just best oh to my god to like you. here's this problem yeah, about some bullshit. Wah. and then i have to like i leave them open because i actually respond to them all but then if i don't recognize it you know i don't want to click it because if I click it, then all of a sudden it gets marked as red and then it disappears in the in the in the list of like yeah, anyways. Yeah. Oh, I actually better to I reach me in the city. Spiritual level. Okay. True. I'm I'll, I'll be out there in a second, Molten. Yeah, hey, firm. Uh but okay, yeah, I was you just wondering if uh, the person was go. caught for that or if it was just ongoing or whatever. Uh yeah, I mean it's pretty simple. We didn't have enough to convict her, so we want to bring her in for interrogation. And I, I'm guessing when you say you don't have enough to convict, that's just because you don't know if it, that was pertaining to her or somebody else. Yeah, I mean, okay. like, like Brian said, I mean, anybody can phone and say they killed somebody. There's so many murders in the city. Who's to say that she's the one that killed these two people? Now, obviously, <clears throat> we can talk, bring her in an interrogation room and get way more out of her. Yeah. Okay. But like, that's not gonna, you know, that's not gonna hold up. I don't think. I mean, like, hey, we got a phone call, and then we found these bodies. It's got to be her. Was she who who did both of y'all respond to it? No, Brian responded to it. I wasn't yeah. on duty yet. I responded to there? it. There was two dead bodies. No, she wasn't. There was a third okay. body that was unconscious. I didn't arrive after the 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 the, the You'll buy R2 Green. Uh tsunami. Uh there Have was another day. another search circumstance that happened uh which I place at a higher <sighs> importance for a number of reasons that I'm not gonna get into. Uh and then Copper Pot was unreachable after we were free. And uh, so even tying her to the scene would have been very difficult at this stage. Yeah, I got you. All um, right. We also did not have a doctor that was able to identify the unconscious individual before the tsunami occurred. So, yeah. yeah. Oh, so basically that whole thing's botched then. There's no point even looking It's at pretty it. botched unless that oh. unconscious person uh, ends up turning himself in or uh, starts talking for whatever reason. Yeah. I mean, we don't know if he, he wasn't <laughs> okay. able to get through the tsunami or maybe it was just somebody who actually killed these two individuals and then, uh, you know, swam away with the tide of the tsunami to get away with said murder. I mean, it could be anything. But yeah, um, that pretty much literally the only thing me and Brian could do about it is bring her into an interrogation room, talk to her try to get uh, the truth out of her if she was the one who killed him. That's fine. Go from there. <laughs> All right. Any more questions? That wasn't even the reason I came here. All right. Fantastic. All right. Good speaking to you, Chief. All right. Good luck. 
Can you say I'm the one inciting shit? Are you serious right now? Oh my god, man. What are you- You're such a, a what's it called? Give my Camaro a back, okay? You're such a, a what's it called? I interviewed uh, Stanton. I didn't get jack shit. <laughs> what? I interviewed Stanton. I didn't get jack shit. Well, well, well Which part how did that? he react to everything? I mean, he was just like, oh, I didn't know this was a thing. I'm confused by what you're talking about. Uh, just so lies he's the whole time. I think about lies. Mm. You hate to see it. Mm. Uh, Although when I asked him about the conversation he had with Bailey, he just... He didn't outright deny it, he just said he doesn't recall that conversation happening. Oh, so he remembers that he just doesn't want to talk about it. Well, I don't know. It just He wasn't like that never happened. It was more like, Ooh, I don't recall that conversation. I don't think it happened. I don't remember that conversation happening. <clears throat> mm -mm -mm. So he's pretty much guilty. But, oh, is he? Uh, we still need to get some other people in here, so I'm going to keep an eye on them today. One of them being Charles Prince, so I'm not sure how I'm going to get him down here, but we'll see. Yeah, he's going to be tricky to get in here. From... I think we'll just have to arrest him and interrogate him, basically. Uh, Yeah, that would... Uh, well, I mean, that might be your only bet, to be honest. I don't think he'll come in willingly. Yeah. Are you good? Yeah, I was just eating. No, I mean like in general. Uh, yeah, I'm all right. Okay, so the hesitation, the sweat dropping down from the top of your temple, and the "I'm all right" tells me completely otherwise. What's going on? <sighs> you know, it's just it's just been a lot of stress. You know, Troy won't let me have an eye patch. Um, our search and seizures keep going out the window, and I think we're at war with the DOJ. We set terms today, so let's see how you, that goes. Hold on. Hmm? You completely skipped. Was that with Stanton? What? Setting terms. Yeah. Okay, you completely dodged that. What, what are the terms? It? We tried. To, I think we discussed first the 15 tasers, but he said that they keep getting kidnapped for tasers, so. Him and his staff are going to talk about it and get back to me on uh, what exactly we're going to we're gonna do. So what are you doing? Just going to start going at each other? We might as well at this point, you know. So when I see eight cops roll up to a judge, I expect a shootout. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. I mean, it's eight of us, and how many of them? Like four? Max? Five. We'll, yeah, easily, five we'll easily take them. They won't even stand a chance. Our, uh, my main goal is to, uh, uh, if we win, is to take over the legislative process of the city and to be able to write and change the laws in the police department. I'm sorry. I want to be, I want to be Tsar one day. You want to be what one day? Tsar. Dude, what the fuck? Just like three days ago, you are talking about you wanted to quit chief of police and now you want to be the Tsar? Yeah, why not? <laughs> what? Hang on. I want to be the czar, and I want to make my own laws, and I want to have a full police department at my disposal to use at any inconvenient notice. Really, I'll probably make public executions legal. <clears throat> Alex Hart. And then probably execute all of the Justice Department. Well, let's be honest. With the amount of public executions that happen now, they might as well be. Wicked sick. Yeah, I mean, it'd be like that. All right, well, uh, how's the... So is, is Buck the only thing that you got done on the Camaro thing today? Yeah, and then I got stabbed by Mike Block's entourage when I was trying to save Tessa's life. Oh my god. Are you okay? Uh, Yeah, they just stabbed me in the face, so I'm good. But you didn't even get an eye patch for it? No, because according to Choi, the blade just missed me and 
you know, nicked my eyebrow. But I'll have a cool scar on my cheek. Wait, hang on. It nicked your eyebrow and your cheek? Yes. So, no, it missed my eye, according to Dr. Choi. It's a pretty awful day so far. Didn't even get a fucking eye patch. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> but then we gave Tessa a, a taser license, so. Oh, that's good. Is uh, I hope she doesn't go around. I, I know Tessa, but I hope she doesn't go around bragging about that because then people are going to start asking for him. And that's yeah, probably. Mm -hmm. It's true. So, but now that she's being adamantly attacked, sort of how that uh, Kim guy was, remember? Kim. Yeah, that uh, Tu Wong. Oh, Tu Wong. Yeah. yeah. So what you <laughs> you think somebody's putting hits out on her? No, she's just being attacked every single day by Mike Block. She was even attacked mm. inside of the Mission Row lobby, so. Can't protect her in here, can't protect her out there, might as well. Yeah, people are getting ballsy with coming into PD and doing shit. What? I'm surprised you guys aren't just shooting them down the second they walk in with the gun. Uh, Yeah, I'm not sure what the circumstance of her getting like attacked in here was but i'm pretty sure he was shot down it's just uh do you, know. you dude as a czar maybe i'll implement some shit on like, site policy i don't even know how to ask this question oh uh, sorry as a czar i'm gonna change all that oh my god do you is it like a i don't know how to ask this i feel like cops are kind of like hesitant to shoot sometimes do you know what i mean uh yeah do, do you actually or yes okay so i i was just like thinking why you know i guess it would be more court i could see that being more court stuff which is why they don't do it I don't know, I'm kind of thinking out loud. Yeah, I Have mean... You... I don't really know how to answer that conversation in this city. Unless it was, like, based on this city. I mean, there's definitely lawsuits that can occur as a result of uh, cops shooting early. Which, they've happened before. Mm-hmm. But I mean, like, technically, I can just shoot somebody for having a knife and walking towards me. Reminds me of one time when I was responding you to a should. jewelry what? store. And I had a woman inside that saw me with a gun. And then she ran out of the store without saying anything to me. Uh, and then I shot her tires out. Right? In mm -hmm. her getaway car. And she stopped the car and said really you're gonna shoot you're gonna shoot at my car with a gun really you're gonna shoot at my car after i have a knife wow i just can't believe you're really gonna shoot me when all i had was a knife but okay with the same attitude and everything yeah <laughs> what the fuck? and then they didn't talk to me when we apprehended them and in the cells really I'm just surprised you shot at my car when I ran at you with a knife. I didn't even have a gun. So that's okay, the, that's so the I can general, see why that's keeping a lot of cops the from general at attitude. Um as a different example of the other night we had uh people that looked a lot like Chang Gang uh rob a jewelry store. And then they started to drive around on motorcycles and started kicking cops. Um, like, you know, on the bike. On their bike, yeah. And I had two cops that were knocked out. Uh, I had officers asking to use lethals, which I stopped them from doing. 
on the measurement that these individuals were armed with guns and had PD rifles. And I was afraid that uh, if we shot at them, they would pretty much shoot us back instantly. Mm -hmm. As opposed to us having tasers while they're on bikes. So there's like circumstantial stuff that happens between officers shooting, but if you strike an officer with a car or you attack an officer, generally speaking, we open fire. But uh, I think there's also been cases for excessive force that we've seen. Mm -hmm. uh, oh my fucking God. The arguments for the excessive force is... I had my hands up, or um, I was running at the cop, but I never shot. Things like that. Yeah, I would... Um... Which, uh, I've noticed that they've won several cases where a cop didn't use the appropriate measurement to match the civilians or the suspects' Chip, use of why force. why are you knocking on the door like... Yeah, I've no. I, uh, it's really frustrating because the. I mean, Chip? first of all, with the knife thing, you have a twenty-one foot rule, which means if they're within twenty-one feet, that means they're a deadly threat, regardless yeah, of if they're running at you, standing still, yeah. or whatever the fuck. Ah, oh, what the. So obviously, if they take a step forward towards you, you should be shooting them, kind of deal. You know what I mean? Like if they're acting acting threatening and they're uh, stepping towards you with a knife in their hand, so you should be shooting them. Mm -hmm. they're looking at um, office, so if somebody has a gun in their hand and they're pointing even in your direction, you should be shooting them because you, there's a gun in your face and you have a gun. Like you're pointing a gun at each other. I don't know why people aren't shooting. Yeah, like, why I mean, I, I like shot like three women down the other day when they rolled up. Jesus, on me. dude, you belong in the HOA. I mean, I had to, dude. It was me versus four of them. That's OK. I squad wiped. Look, the point I'm trying to make here is the circumstantial stuff that happens and we've been brought to court for worse. So an officer not shooting. I mean, we generally get pissed when there's absolutely no reason they shouldn't shoot. But there are some dodgy times when cops have shot uh, when they shouldn't have. And I think as a result, some of them are scared to shoot. So generally speaking, I usually, if I'm around situations like that, I feel like all of my officers rely to see if I'll shoot. As a general example, before they do. No, yeah, that's understandable. They want to make sure they're doing the right thing. Right. Which is hard to gauge given the different examples I've just given you. And given the legal proceedings that we've had when we've shot people down. I guess, okay, so uh, I'll tell you. Go, uh, give some, uh, an officer called me here. He wants a uh, suck suck. He wants a suck job in the back. And then Charlie comes out oh. of the back. Okay. Um, as the DA, I'm telling you, you're okay to tell your officers if they feel that there's okay, a threat, a genuine the threat to their so life, could, uh... they are, okay yeah. to job, which I'm sure they know, yeah, it's over here, but just sir. to take out that I'm waiting for somebody else to shoot factor. Oh, oh he might be back. You know what there. I mean? You, if there's bitch? somebody, well, I mean, we've freaking... had, we've had suspects jump out of the car with a gun yeah. in their hand, you know, technically Suck job officer that's a threat to us. Right. But yeah, but if you're telling them to put their guns away multiple times, and they don't run away and they're still running. I would still take that as a major threat and act on it personally. Right. And, and you would. Well, we've had other officers that wouldn't. Which I understand. It's a lot easier said than done. I, I get that. Right. But um, I'm just letting you know that I will sit there and defend them in court if it comes down to it. If they feel there's a genuine threat to their life, they're allowed to act on it. Just so there's not like that the hesitation whenever they're waiting for somebody higher ranking or just somebody else in general to shoot first. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, I've noticed that warnings usually go well. I don't think officers warn people enough. Like I'll say, I would say like, de-escalation would be a major know, part of that. Yeah. If you don't stop, I'm going to do this. And if I tell them enough times, I don't see why they would don't. complain, I guess. You know? If oh, do... like you warn the criminal and then they complain whenever you shoot them or something? Right. If I warn them, I'm going to tase you if you don't stop running. Or if you take out your knife again, I will shoot you. Things like that. Are they empty threats? Uh, they're they're uh, uh, magazine empty threats. What does that mean? I'm oh, like saying... you'll empty your mag on it? Yeah, right. I got you. I'm just saying they'll... They'll listen, but I mean, I've had a I had a jewelry store robbery the other day that I showed up. 
and I was like this. Mm -hmm. And a guy to my right just, he, like, take out your gun. Okay. I had a guy that was like this. He just, like, walked up and circled you? Oh, and what the fuck? Yeah, so that's that's kind of what we run into. The, the, the us having guns is no longer a threat in this city to anybody. Wicked so uh, I would have hey, shot him. You know. the fuck? Yeah, I should have shot him. But the second one had a hostage, so I think they felt comfortable knowing that. Uh, oh, you have to take care of the hostage. Okay, I got you. Yeah, I had two hostages at that point. And they were asking me what the fuck is wrong with me when I was like, "What do you guys want?" Like, wow, this guy's had a fucking bad day. That was wrong with him. Yeah, I've noticed when people take stuff seriously, they get called a grouch or grumpy just because, or they're having a bad day just because they're taking shit seriously. The thing it's is, kinda... I, I don't like criminals. Period. I'm not. I don't want to be friends mm -hmm. with them. I don't want to be like, hey, what's up, cool guy that shot at me yesterday? I don't give a yeah. fuck. I hate all of them. I want to jail them. That's it. Bottom line. Chief of police. I want to see him locked up. There's no friendly banter that I'm going to do with them. If you're robbing a place, I don't like you. Okay? Now if you're speeding okay. or okay. something or a traffic, whatever, maybe I'll, I'll be a little lighter and we can joke around. But like I arrested a guy that uh, stole Look, a cop I gotta car. Look, I got to talk to the DA boys. And this but he didn't fucking gonna, shoot gonna, me. So, I'm gonna chew him out. you know, I was a little bit lighter with him. Hang on. I I'm just gonna have... go in there and I'm going to start screaming. I have Wrangler saying he's going to chew me out. Okay. I'll try to serve some warrants with you, with you and then I'm going to serve a... Uh can of kick-ass to the DA. Okay. I got a pretty uh, sick sense of humor, you guys. The only person, uh, you know, the only kind of criminal that's good. Need to jump Dead on. One? Jesus Christ, Molten. The fuck is going on out here? We're, we're getting ready hey, to uh, serve warrants I gotta talk park. to the DA. Okay. I'm gonna have to wait a minute. Is there an officer suck job? Are you wait wearing, a minute. What, you, what, what is this mask you're wearing? Look, I thought that maybe if we, uh, you know, dressed up like pigs, they'd stop calling us pigs. All right, take that off. You look like a fucking idiot. He can't. Uh, my, my face is a little... Oh, my God. Well, what's wrong with his face? I'm gonna keep this on. Hey, uh, listen, DA, I got a bone to pick with you. Wait, what's, what's wrong with your face, Wrangler? Yeah, what's wrong you with look... his face? Isn't that his normal face? No, 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 it's not. That's not your normal face. Usually, I have to change uh -uh. outfits to do to get that. Look, I got to talk to you, sir. To who? To the DA or me? No, to you. Why do you have to talk to me? It's not good. It's a bad situation. Oh, I mean, usually when people talk to me, it's about good situations. So this is shocking. Spencer. I think he's being paid by Dr. Troy or something. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh my god. Okay. I had her in handcuffs. I had her in custody for identification fraud. She wanted a bench trial. I had a judge come in the city. And uh, Spencer downstairs. came in. He shut the whole thing down. Okay. I don't know why. He suspended me for the night. For 70 from 4 For no reason. Gave me 15 strike points. No reason. Are you able to uh, come upstairs? 15. Jesus Christ. The same amount of suck jobs I had to do on the way over here to uh, stay okay, undercover. He's, he's, he's saying if I up. give you 15 more for that pig mask, you'll be suspended for the rest of the day. You kind of need him for the operation. What operation? Actually, don't tell me anything ever. You just call Svensson. Yeah, you to he's it. coming up. Okay. You guys can hash all this out. Oh, oh thank there, you. there he is. Okay, there, there we go. Oh, is, this, is this a rare cast in the presence? Are you going to press charges on this, uh, Chief, with all Sonia? due respect, what? Hey, Casterman, how have you been? Sonia. I haven't seen you in a long time. Well, we did this whole raid Chief, thing. what? And we got all this shit. Yeah, what? what? Yes. Not, not for all what the about stuff me? that were in our properties. Casterman, do I sound Scottish? Really? Yes. I don't know. How Doesn't long did Casterman sound like this? Metzger, uh, Before, uh edited onto our time again. No, to find... not me. There yeah, is. I think we have enough officers to go through with this operation now. Metzger's already how much been the one dealing with it. There he is. I don't All know, right. The 88 dealt with it. Him and Metzger were talking about it. Oh, okay. All right. Well, well they're they dealing with this. Her time, let's let's her go deal, deal with this. Straight. I told you what I was going to go on this one, Spencer. I told you. You screwed me. You screwed me. 
All right, come on, Curdy, let's go. I need to see this. Chief Svensson Dwight, shut down oh shit about a bunch of warrants. Right, right, I'll talk Troy to go. Svensson. Go do your whatever the fuck your operation is about I tried dick. to tell you, Svensson. I don't know what you're doing. Just I don't want to hear about it. You just had to take Troy's dirty money. Uh, Malton, if you cause me more Rango, problems, I'm going to demote you. What? I, said, I was talking to Malton. Are you going okay. off with him or what? Am I what? Are you going with Malton? <laughs> Uh oh yeah, Jesus fucking Christ! <laughs> All right, what do you what do you need, uh, Svensson? I gotta talk to you, I guess. Yeah. Hey, listen, Chief. Hey, uh, Chief. Just rang the what? guys a loose cannon. What and... drugs are legal to sell? None. None. You can't sell any drugs. Yeah, I just found oh, out about shit. it the other day as well. Oh fuck! Please unless you have joking. a unless you have a business license, then you can sell marijuana or some shit. No, no, Jesus. You have you to own no. a dispensary, not just a business license. Ever, Larry? Just chill out, dude. You're being such no, a fucking you, narc right now. You're gonna piss me off. Yeah, I tried to. God. I tried to buy a weed from Mike Block, but then I looked up on the MDT. Yeah, you rates. got robbed. Yeah, you told me. Okay. Why'd you sound surprised then? You're like, what? What he told you about it? What? When you got robbed? Yes. Because I didn't know your. I didn't know it was Mike Block that was gonna rob you. Yeah, you want some of this weed? I actually still have it on me. You already gave me some. Yeah, do you want the rest of it? How much do you? What the see your fuck, fucking hands. dude? I didn't pick it hands. up, motherfucker. Let me see your hands. Try. Nope, I didn't pick it up. You have three officers that went. Shoot them out, chief. I didn't pick it up. You so can't charge me for nothing. Why do you have so much, dude? It's for evidence. Then put it in evidence. Why is it on your person? What? I'm always in meetings, okay? Uh, so it's like I gotta talk to you. Okay. By the way, for tackling me. That's I can't a, hear you if you're talking. I was saying that's assault. Okay. I'm holding an assault charge over you for the next Trust 30, me, the 30 days, me, okay? If you act out, I will arrest you for this assault charge <laughs> just in place in the next 30 days. Yeah, all right. Okay? That doesn't scare me, but okay. Okay, well, I just, I'm just saying I'm going to arrest you at any point. I'll assault you later. What the fuck do you say to me? <laughs> Motherfucker, I'm timing. trained for this shit. Okay, that's not bad. All right, <laughs> keep you on your toes. I'll be honest, I almost missed it. Uh, what's this thing about you shut down an operation and then you violated someone's rights and Wrangler had them in cuffs and you're getting paid by Doctor Choi? Yeah, that's about the size of it. Okay, well, I guess I don't know what I'm supposed to. Uh, well, okay, can you explain why you did those things? Dr. Choi's paying me a lot of money, Bobby. How much money is she paying you? Nothing. All right, so the situation was that Deputy Wrangler was arresting... And she's paying uh, you nothing? I'm so not you're doing it for I free. was joking. I was joking. It's a joke. Okay. Relax. Oh, my God. He's a Jesus hippie. Christ. I thought you would... Okay, anyway. Um, Deputy Wrangler tried to arrest a woman on the basis that she had um, orange hair, I suppose, and that she was a woman. Um... As I understand, is that Leah Strong? Yeah, it was Leah Strong. I thought you wouldn't be happy to hear that. Okay, no, I wasn't happy to hear that, considering I needed her to come down for a yeah. very important investigation the day after yeah, she got falsely arrested. Hey, you know, good news is I let her out. And I disciplined the officer who did it, so you know. Okay, well, maybe she, she doesn't hate you. No, nah, she she was fine. She was just upset, but she was like, I don't want to see anybody fired. I just was uh -huh. confused why I got locked in yeah. the cell for several hours. Yeah, that's, that's, I mean, pretty much Wrangler just like, I don't know, he was doing this whole uh, I don't sleep until crime's over thing, and I deemed that very unhealthy, so I didn't suspend him per se, I just told him to go home and get some sleep. I offered him if he wanted to, he could sleep on the couch downstairs, you know, just to get some sleep before he went back on duty because I didn't want to suspend him, because technically nothing was really wrong because I intercepted it, like no, no, no you know, no rights were violated yet because I got there in time. But he ended up just, uh, I don't know, he just went undercover or something. I don't know really know what he did, to be honest with you. So he's going to dispatch. Is, is 317 still part of, like, a, a sex operation that's happening? A sex operation? Uh, I, I would like 317 to assist with the rest, but if he's really needed for a meeting, he could go to that. Yeah, well, considering he made me start this meeting, I'd, I'd like for him to be in here. 
a firm. Do you mean like reassignments here or? Do you need to talk to 317? 317 it's like you have to say the one. same thing six times. That's what happens when you have so many senior officers. Yeah, fucking... You have position on the south entrance. You're senior, all right? Bro, let's just go. Let's just go ahead and roll. Put <laughs> them to uh... get it because they're old. Uh -huh. I don't see any car. Is it senior or senior? Senior. It's it's senior. Okay, good to know. Senior would be if they were employed by like the Mexican police department. Hey, what do you think if we bring corporals back? I mean, I was always a huge proponent of having vanity ranks as i think copper called them because yeah, the, the... it gives people something to do and something to show off but it doesn't actually require us to like assign responsibility yeah they just all suck though they don't do any corporal like things yeah we now do suck i mean Malden's doing all right yeah, he's actually isn't, working isn't senior officer what came in place of corporal or was, was no, no, already no 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 a while ago, oh. the way it was, it was like, I don't know, cadet, officer, senior officer, corporal, sergeant, lieutenant, captain. And I agree, captain and lieutenant were probably redundant, <sighs> having both of them. But corporal was all right. And I think, I think lieutenant, lieutenant or captain was all right. Yeah, I'm one of the two. Yeah. Somebody's outside your door, by the way. Yeah, there's always someone there, literally. Any time of day, if, if Bobby's in here, there's someone outside this door. It's guaranteed. <laughs> There anyway. So was that it? Can I help with anything else? Yeah, I just wanted him in. Three seventeen from three zero nine. Three seventeen. That pregnant woman's a liar. What's your uh, ETA? Uh, where do I? Uh, I just got to the HOA. Do you need me down at the station? Yes. Okay. I'm seventy six. No. Actually, yeah, I'm I have 76. a question for you, Chief. Code threes. Okay. So this whole Supra thing, my car, um, am I supposed to let it get repoed? Because some lady was threatening to the other day. Wait till it gets is that? Wait till it gets on the docket, okay? You get a, no, no, no. She, keep... she was saying she can do it right now because it's in the city. Wait, who said that? Wait, what's going on? Some, I don't know. I, I don't we're know trying if she to, We're trying to have like a sting out for his repo by Alexander, letting it... Alexandra something? Oh, don't she worry was about like, her. She's not repo. I... She's just some fucking... Lady that buys cars. Up. I'm get she was here. saying that they can repo my car right now, Bobby. They can't repo your car. They ha it has to go in the docket. She was saying they can, and they, it, it sounds can't, legitimate. Okay, it can't. They can't repo it until you get put on a docket that gives you a 72-hour notice, okay? Do I actually have to, like, call her down here and rip her out for it? But, like, no, you she don't. was saying no. if someone informs me in the city, and then they repo it in the city, it's fine, apparently. It doesn't make any sense. I don't. I don't want my car to get actually repoed, Bobby. Well, then pay it off. Well, no, I, I can't told, because he told, I told me not to. Because I want to see if they'll repo it early as well. <laughs> Poor Owen. <laughs> I don't want to I, I, told, <laughs> I mean, isn't that correct? I mean, you could correct me if I'm wrong, Larry. I mean, it sounds right. Because this woman doesn't work for. Why are you in here, Toretti? I was with. Wrangler. I don't need you in here. That pregnant woman is a liar, sir. Hey, if it makes you first of all, I'm not even I only pistol whipped her because I that. had to. Okay. What the fuck? Uh... Listen, I'm not even pregnant, Wrangler. So okay. suck on that one. Oh, oh, that's what this is about. No, Spencer yeah. is a liar. Listen, and you're a loose cannon, Wrangler. All right, shut up. I get results. Shut up. Explain to me this whole thing with Doctor Choi and you having her down here, and somehow Miss Leah Strong is involved. Look, here's the thing, all right? I pulled over Dr. Choi. Okay, she had three individuals in the car with her. They all confirmed it was Dr. Choi. All right? There's no proof that woman was not Dr. Choi. Except for the fingerprinting that we did. And the fact that she had Leah Strong's ID. And the fact that the car is probably registered to Leah Strong. Well, look, why would everyone in that car admit that that's Dr. Choi? Uh, probably to fuck with you. Look, I know Dr. Troy. I've seen her multiple times and I'm on the verge of death, okay? That was her. Are you sure? Because I saw Dr. Choi and she's been wearing like a bald cap. And Leah kind of looks like her, but... See? They were both in the same place. Well, which one had hair? Uh, Leah had hair. 
What? Well, Leah had like uh, bright red hair. Wait, hold on. Since when is Doctor Troy a bald woman? She's not. She's been wearing like this cap because she got shot in the head, and I, I don't know if she shaved her hair or something. But she's been wearing like a yeah. She looks so she hair could have hair don't. under there. Maybe no. I'd... She doesn't have any hair. I've seen it without her. She doesn't look, have hair. sir. Okay. With your permission, I'd like to get a warrant for her to take off that hat. I've already seen it without the hat. It's not required. I think he's lying. Okay, he thinks I'm lying. Mm, I don't think, I think he's well, a liar. I mean, Larry, could we get it? We probably couldn't get a warrant to see what's under. Chief, we don't. You, you don't need a warrant for. That. You do on this. Oh, I guess if you're conducting an investigation for criminal charges, you could technically ask her to remove it, and if she doesn't, it's obstruction of justice. But you will have to hmm. advise her of her rights and tell her that she ha can have a lawyer present before you remove the cap. Make sure you have an actual charge you're looking to charge her with before you do it, not some BS. And infraction does not count as a charge. All right, I'm going to get down there. Um, are you sure? Because Le I had Leah down here for questioning, like, yesterday, and she wasn't very happy, concerned that we just ripped apart her business as a part of another investigation. That she was arrested. Yeah, so. maybe she's going to do a new business now, selling fake IDs. Boom. But she had her ID. Why didn't you arrest time. her yesterday? He didn't actually arrest her. He tried to on impersonation. Why did you bring her into custody? A traffic ticket and then impersonation. Who is she impersonating? Dr. Troy is what mm -hmm. Rangler thinks. Dr. Troy is impersonating Leo. So you did arrest okay. her because you brought her in here right. in cuffs, right? He, he listen, he detained her for an investigation. You can't, de you can't detain her in here. Well, it's an early arrest. I arrested Dr. Troy for impersonating Leo. You didn't know so. no arrest was made because she didn't go did to jail. The charges aren't on her record. You searched mm -hmm. her. You did? Yes, he did. He I did yeah. okay, so just just to be clear, you you did violate her rights. So we're going to put this out there. What rights uh, did I violate? You, uh, you, you searched her right, under, okay. under a false was arrest. Was she under arrest at the time you searched she her? She was under arrest, yeah. Well, actually, listen. Mm. It was a false it's arrest. It's technically not violating any rights if you're removing the weapons for safety reasons because she's yeah, in a cruiser. No, it still is because you searched her instead no, of No, I searched her because she pissed her. me off. Oh, you off. searched her. Okay. Yeah, so you'd have to frisk her if you're doing oh, that. Oh, listen, listen. She was under arrest for impersonation, and then I searched her. Okay, well... If she was under arrest, then you could search her. But if you were detaining yeah. her pending the investigation, you need to frisk her. No, she was under arrest for impersonation. But the arrest well, was a false clear. arrest, right? But no arrest was actually made because it's not on her record. Well, well you because dropped the charges. you stepped in. Yes. So, wait, Svensson dropped the charges, but there was an arrest. Svensson dropped the charges just like he was dropped on his head, I bet. Okay. That was Dr. Troy. So Dr. Troy was impersonating Leah Strong? Yes. I got the proof. All of her she friends. Buying this, Chief? Her friends called three one one. I mean, I wasn't said, there, but I mean. But I'm telling you that Doctor Troy was in the lobby when what I proof got do you here, got? and Leah Strong was in the cells when I got there. How do we know and that there wasn't were two Leah Strong? People, and I ran both fingerprints and I checked both IDs, and they both matched the person who said they were. Okay. All right. Fine. You know what, sir? You want to see the real proof that's in the pudding, huh? You want to see the pudding? We'll crack open this snack pack. Look up Leah Strong. No. And look up Troy. Look They're up the even, records. It's not. Look it's at not. the records. One has second degree, one has third. Look at it. Okay. Look at that shit. Great. Huh? Okay, Leah Strong. Failure to obey traffic control devices, second degree speeding. Yep. Hope you like tapioca because you're about Joy, to have a whole spoon. Failure to obey traffic control footed. devices, third like, degree speeding. Same speed. exact record almost. <laughs> okay. They're the same person. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Damn, dude. That's pretty fucking creepy. Here's the thing. Okay. Those are like the only charges you would have if you were a civilian. Look, here's How the thing. I got, I got all these, all this evidence, all this proof of impersonation. And Svensson is just going on his gut. He's the loose cannon. Okay. So I think the fingerprint <laughs> evidence can be uh, disputed. But no, no, if we get a picture go the roof. of no, Troy no, without no, her no. hat, we can definitively say whether or not there was Leah. Because Leah had a ton of hair, okay? Chief, you're making a mistake. But then at the same time, you might need to pull on you Leah's hair to see if Leah's wearing Chief. a wig. Chief Wrangler's going to okay, kill someone. So I'm going to get out He's... there, I'm going to make her take her hat off, and then I'm going to pull on Leah's hair. But I need you to get a picture of Troy with her bald cap Don't so we can update her uh, profile. 
And she, don't pull on Leah's hair. Don't kill I'm someone. Going, he's a loose cannon. Ask Ask Leah if she could demonstrate that she's not wearing a wig. Don't a actually to pull on her hair. Do not pay oh a crackhead to pull on her hair. Oh. Regular, if you do that, I'm going to suspend you. For how long? I don't know. As long as it takes a month. No, you won't. Three days. Really? Again? Look, I need you to not hire a crackhead to pull on another woman's hair. Just Listen, ask sir, her to demonstrate. I don't care if I get not... suspended for 12 hours. All right? If that's what I got to do to get to the bottom of this investigation. If you hire a crackhead, I will suspend you for 12 hours. Indefinitely. Look, what? sir. What? Damn your suspension. And damn you, Svensson. I'm getting to the bottom of this. You're, God, he's a loose cannon. You're a goddamn you loose what cannon, cannon Wrangler. City, Chief. You don't I don't know care what, what it done. takes. That's a goddamn order, Wrangler. You can take your order. You can shove it up your ass. Are I'm you, going to go find a crackhead. You're pushing it now. Okay, I'm sorry about that, but I do care about this investigation. It's keeping me up at night, sir. I can't sleep. Get to the bottom of it. You're losing your day job for 12 hours. All right, look, I got to do some other stuff here. What's, uh... Okay, I got to throw myself off the roof. All right. So, uh... Shoot people when they have their hands up. Got it. Uh, Please don't. what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What am I doing today? I'm bored. What am I going to do? Hey, can I come in a ride along? Uh... A judge did. Yeah, he's the reason that we lost our ride alongs. We talked about but he had another one. Oh my god, what does this one want? Who? When did he have another one? I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know if that was me or not. The members. What do you need? Oh, hello, sir. I was just uh, coming to compliment you on your, your hair and your beard today. It looks very trimmed and groomed. Are you trying to go back to DOC? That's what I'm going to put you if you're going to come into this lobby and blow smoke up my ass instead of actually doing police work. Sir, I would never blow smoke up your ass, you beautiful, handsome Cause if, man. Because if I need someone to compliment my appearance every fucking day, I, I would literally just go down to the Bolingbroke Penitentiary and stand around their offices for a couple hours, okay? All I'm saying that you are a very handsome person. I don't need to hear that. Sir. Is there anything I can do for you, sir? When did you lose so much weight, Dan? I you had like liposuction, a, sir. You, had like, you look like a different fucking person, man. Yeah, everybody kept calling me fat and I was unhealthy, so I got lipo. You don't even look like yourself. You look, you like, look more unhealthy. You look like goddamn fucking sob at this point. Well, I feel better. I can run longer. That's good. Jesus, man. Okay. God. Okay. You're a good kid, Dan. Oh, good thank kid, you, kid. sir. I'm trying out here, you know. The, the, the streets are cold. <laughs> True, dude. The streets are cold. Wow, wow, wow. What is this? It isn't my old Uncle Larry. Shit. <laughs> what do you want? I want my five grand, motherfucker. What the for fuck what? is this? You know what for. For what? I never gave you. I never asked for any money. Yes, you did. What is this? No, I did not. Two months ago, this guy comes running up to me. He knew I came in a little bit of money. Who is this? He says, there's a drag queen coming to town. And if you give her <laughs> 5K, fucking... she, put, he, she puts her entire foot in your mouth. Chat, who's this? What and the he fuck? said, I need this money right this second. And this son of a That's bitch has not true. You know it's true. It's not true. You know it's true. Why are you making shit up? I'm not making shit up, Uncle Larry. You owe me five grand and you I'll know it. I'll, I'll give you five grand to get out of my face. All right. Who is that? Hello, sir. Hello. What the fuck? Oh, hi. Oh, hello, Bob. I got something for you. That's why I'm here. Uh, who uh who is this? I just gotta go downstairs and get, get out it. of here. Wait, oh, you gonna like whoa, this, Bob? Yeah. You gonna fucking like this? Like who's the Trust streamer? Me. I'll be right back. Love you, Uncle Larry. You Fuck you, Johnny. A fucking freak pervert. What? You know Fuck you. you. Are. Yeah, I'll figure it out. I'll figure who's it out. Who's that? My disappointment of a nephew, apparently. Who was that? Apparently, it's my nephew. Yeah, well, I didn't know I had. what's his name? His name is Johnny Naruto. What? 
Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. You, you related it. it. Makes sense. Makes a lot of what? sense, Larry. What's that supposed to mean? Oh. I didn't yeah. even know he was my nephew till like a week ago. Yeah, does anyone uh, know who New Cop 1 is? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was just thinking about throwing myself off the roof, and I, you know, I talked hey. myself down. Don't you dare be like ashamed of what happened. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be ashamed. <laughs> All right, you have strong, strong law, Spence. <laughs> strong law, <laughs> just like Raven <laughs> and me. Yeah. Watch me eat all fifteen of these burgers. Oh, oh fuck! Uh, Bob, I got you something. Uh, so now, do you want to be chief again? No, fuck you. Okay. Uh, please. Larry, what? Yo, fuck you, Larry. Yeah, what the I mean, fuck? I'm, just help, I'm back Little in Bobby bitch. up here. <laughs> Maybe he what? was asking. Whoa. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> I got you this. This might it seem weird, but it, it is clean. Okay, so I want to stress that. What the fuck? Ooh, just well, thought, I was you know, one of these to shove. Up. Wait, what? What, that, what? Where the fuck is your eye patch? What? What? Oh, fuck. He got rid of it like a week ago. It's not, it wasn't a week ago. Oh, bro, I got what this. Is it? It's an eye. I... Andrea! Hello, Choi. What's Hello, up? Hello, Bobby. Look over. Was, look at the sunset. The sun okay. over there. Can you take that off again? Here you go, Choi. No, I won't. Why? I just want to see again. I want to see what happens. No, Bobby! What the fuck? Now what? No. Looks like I've won. <laughs> now I need an eye patch. You can't. That's my special eye. Your special eye? Give me that back. What, what the fuck are you doing? What? What did you do? Look, it's none of your business what I'm doing, okay, Larry? You're what just are you a, doing? You're just a district attorney. You'll Nobody, never understand. I'll give you an eyeball, what is that You'll never what understand. None of you medical, will. Bitch. None of you will. How are you in my cart? I got in. What do you whoa, mean? Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm walking. <laughs> He's like, I'm walking here. <laughs> oh my god, that guy almost died. What? What the fuck was that? You'll never understand, okay? What what did you what did he even give you? An eye he said he gave you an eyeball? Are you still back here or did he already go to sleep? He left, he went to sleep. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna put this I'm gonna put this eyeball into my locker. Man. Oh my god, dude. Okay. Everything okay? In case I need to access it. Yeah, everything's fine, Molten. <laughs> Alright, did you want me to try to get Bailey in here by the way? Yeah. Bailey yeah. or Janelle or if we can catch Charles slipping. All right. I'm going to give him a call real quick. I sure. interviewed uh, Stan today. I have it all on record. Oh, how, how did that one go? Uh, didn't really learn a whole lot. Well, I mean, However, we didn't really have much of a case against him. I got them. some information from Walker that was kind of interesting. Oh, what he's. I'm not really sure what's if it's pertaining to this investigation or not, but... Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Okay. I think there's. Hey, Chief. Yes. I just want to say your eyes are very beautiful. Hold on. You're not getting promoted. That's wrong with you. Shut up, Walton.
Hey yo. Hey, hey yo, who up? the who were who the fuck responded to my three on one? Who was that? Uh, that was Randy Wrangler. That just I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. All right. They responded to you. I think son of a him, bitch. Right? Anyway, what's up? Do, is the eye been? Have you got? So you don't have an eye patch. That's but you just ran off with the eye. So I Look, assume that's. Listen, okay, it's what? complicated. Okay, it has a. There's a lot of moving pieces here, with the oh, eye right. patch. Okay, according to Choi, my eye has been working fine for the last three months, and then today I get stabbed in my face. Guess what? Guess what? She said it just barely missed my eye. Okay, so now I'm convincing her that I just gouged my eye out. She held the physical evidence, so no more Dr. Choi says I don't have an eye. Holy shit. So I'm going to put an eye patch on. We have to pretend that I'm missing an eye, okay? And then I, I gouged it out. She tried. Holy she even tried shit. to peel my eyelid open, and then I, I ran away, because that's violating my rights. I got to tell you, Bob, that's fucking genius. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Snow. This, uh, this is going to do miles for my, uh, yeah. for my character arc. Anyway... You want <laughs> You want to know what's crazy as well? Is that I have another one. <laughs> Holy shit. Yep. Good. I was going to give it to Angel. I don't know if she wants it or not. Is, we'll that, like, see. is that part of her, like, cyber thing? Oh, these definitely aren't cyber. These eyeballs in particular came from a uh, cultist that set himself on fire in front of me and McLean. 26 of his teeth then fell out swiftly after that. And then I grabbed his eyeballs. Ew. They've been... Uh, I took them to a priest. Uh, they've Ew, been, man. What the fuck am I going to do with cultist uh, guys? They, uh, you know, they're, cult, they're, they're kosher. They're, you know, anointed saints. I don't know. What's the word? Holy. Sure. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not religious. Uh, okay. Better, better than nothing, I guess. Yep. Yeah. Well, just, you know, I just thought I'd uh, just give you an eye. I just, you know, I got those recently and just thought, well, you know, Bob could deal with, with, with an eye. He needs one of those. So, you know, I just kept it on ice. Congratulations, Bob. See you soon. Uh, again, that's kind of gross, but I appreciate it, Snow. Thank you. Welcome. Oh, oh also, Evil Internet's <laughs> back. Uh, see you later. Oh, also, the races are definitely back. Saw him two days ago. He's definitely back. Titanium's back. Races are around. Driving really fast on the streets. I don't know what you're talking about. I gotta go find cars. an eye patch that matches my skin tone. Nice. See you soon, Bob. See you later. Bye. Eye patch arc back, baby. I wish there was more. There isn't. There isn't re. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, is that new? Hold on. Was that there before? What does that say? Does that say the lost? Oh, it says the lost. Damn. I thought that was like the uh, MRPD logo. Fuck. I'm gonna get really hyped for a second. Yeah, but this time the arc is really based on a lie. Well. Do what you gotta do out here, you know what I'm saying? Oh, fuck. Big Bob Pog. Feels good to be back, baby. Uh, 
What happened, sir? What do you mean, what happened? I gouged my own eye out. You you gouged your eye out? Yeah. Why? Uh, fifty-one fifty. I did it because I want to stop crime, and until I stop crime, I won't have an eye. Fifty-one fifty. So once you stop crime, you'll put your eye back. Yes. Wait, what'd you gouge your eye out with? A spoon. What'd you do with it, sir? What with a spoon? With the eye, yeah. The eye, it's stashed away in a secure spot. On ice? No. Can we put it on ice at least? Fuck. Sir? Oh. What did you all do? Are you. Do you think you're a danger to yourself or others at this point in time, sir? Yeah, probably. Hold on, I need to go find ice. Uh, okay. Let me just, uh... I need ice. I need ice. Where do you keep your ice? This is a senior officer Lance Bond with the LSPD. Is there a psychologist right now uh, at Pillbox? We now we're good. What the fuck? What the fuck is that? Hey, sorry. Hey, Bob. Oh, is that Coop? Hey, uh, Bobby, like, scooped hey, Coop, out his eye you? with a spoon for some reason. I'm good. I'm good. No, How's he's got an been? eye patch on and. This is a new car? He said he's. Yeah, it's a new car. What uh, happened to the Lamborghini? I own that too. I see. From fast okay. lanes. Yeah, please. please uh, and if you yep. can, can you yep, yep, yep. like three one one or Interesting. something? Interesting. Okay. Yeah. Right, Bought thanks. it but... nine months ago, maybe. So when so you were a off. judge. Interesting. Actually, yes, yes, I was. What's your relationship with fast lanes? Um. Uh. I've always, been, I've always had a pretty good main, maintained a very good business uh, standing there. Very good. Um, I would say exceptional. Exceptional with fast lanes. Yes. Right now, demo. Yes. I can't yeah, see right that I'm still adjusting to. They. Right. It's kind of I scratch your back, they'll scratch mine. You know what I'm saying. How did you, uh, how did you scratch their back as the chief justice at the time? Um, am I under investigation for a crime? No, we haven't even read you your rights. We can't even use anything we say against you. I mean, do you, you suspect me for something? No, actually. I'd like to invoke my Fifth Amendment right at this current time. I'm actually just drawing a, uh, octopus on my notepad. But if you'd like to come down for a formal investigation and have it be on record with everything that oh, you're an saying. An interview, not, not investigation. Interview. Sorry, an interview. You're not getting anything out of me. Really? Huh. That's really? the way you want to play holiday? Deals have been made. What, what if we offer you immunity? Hey, do you want immunity? Maybe we already got something, Mr. Holiday. Mm. As my reign of chief judge... I was the one that put in most of the uh, fast lane owners. <laughs> Have a good one. Is that bad? Well, you didn't do a very good job if they threw it down the drain. He pled the fifth, which makes me think he's guilty of something. That's usually what it means when people plead the fifth. Yeah, can honest. I? Can we use that against him, Larry? The fact that he pled the fifth. 
No, he wasn't under Miranda. Fuck. Also, I can say Trey did that to a, in a court case once, and he was so guilty. Exactly. We have precedent. Mm-hmm. That anyone that pleads as a fifth is generally guilty, I think we can use that in court. Yeah. I don't think that's how it works. Why not? Yeah, what do you though? Because it's a basic right doesn't mean they, they're they guilty of something. Is it in the Constitution? Yeah, is it in the, uh, the, uh, constitu in the Constitution? <laughs> Why'd you turn <laughs> Italian? Look, we have got bigger fish to fry. Okay. I gotta go to Target today. Why? You get Target? Is that person standing on the thing? The fuck am I looking at? No. Yeah, everything looks fine for me. Looks like they were standing inside of their buggy. Hey. What's going on, Sun Moon? How you doing? You got a second to talk? Hey, we need to talk to you. Yeah, I gotta talk to you. Oh, Wait, shit. Talk to and, you? And, the, and Bobby as well. Oh, right, let's talk. In. All right. Oh, shit, hold on. There we go. I follow you. <laughs> hop <Next>. in. <laughs> Listen, I don't have a car right now. Who's your next? Okay, we do. PD with 11095 for processing booking. What? Wait, whoa, whoa. Wait, no, that's what? just code in case anyone's watching. Oh, okay. All right. Listen, I just came out of prison. I ain't going back. For what? Store robbery. Uh, so you're used to swindling people out of money, then, Mr. Mayor. Hell Mayotte. yeah. Um, Everyone does it. Sorry, Mary, Mary, by the car? way. What's going on, Svensson? Yeah, we're arresting people. Oh. Yeah, we're doing police work, sir. Nice. And oh, I think okay. I just... All right, Mom, can you interview him? Because I... No, I mean, Bobby? I'm going to say... It, wait. Bobby? No, I sir. Like sins, what I said sir, no. about Malden. Sir, please. I do not think he's doing a good job. Sir. Oh, yeah, Malton, actually, uh, speaking of which, I need you to write a, a letter of apology to Judge Katya. For what? For <laughs> your outmarks last night. For saying she sounded moody? Yeah. You want me to apologize for my opinion? Yes. Your vocal opinion that made her very upset. I would also like a written letter okay. of apology. Okay. Mr. Implying I don't do police work, I, I, didn't, I didn't mean to imply no. it. I was just stating the no, fact that we, we were, we we were arresting someone. Oh, yeah. Hey, did my bed sheets just arrive, or what's going on? My bed skirt? Hell yeah. Not bed sheets. Bed skirt. Skirt. All right, read the way. I don't know where to go. Uh, we could... Okay, we could go in the kitchen if you want. All right, kitchen it is. All right. What are we talking about? <sighs> what do you want to talk about? Okay, well, who's that cop out there? Not Malton. <laughs> Svensson. Svensson? Svensson. That guy. He accused me of being a dirtbag. Well, he did just say you got out of jail for store robbery. So yes. then you pled guilty to robbery, kidnapping, evading, receiving stolen property in third degree, and possession of yes. a stolen ID. Oh, fuck. Yes. But That's I'm not upset about that. Bag. I'm not upset about that. Okay. What I'm upset about is that he accused me of using a, a radio scanner to know when you guys were coming. Damn, dude. Did that's... you have on you? I did. I was doing the news yesterday. <laughs> but... Okay. But watch <laughs> this. I wasn't even signed on duty, yo. How can I know when you're coming if I'm not on signed on news? Okay. Uh, I don't know. I guess he's just guessing based off the fact that you were doing news and then a scanner on you. Uh, yeah. I was doing the news yesterday, not today. Okay. Well... And he took my radio scanner. Listen, I do not want to go to the Bahamas. That's dumb. That's dumb. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't think you're gonna go to the Bahamas. So, no, that's people do. You do go to the I Bahamas. I know, but I, I, I think I think you're good. I don't think. I don't think Svensson's interested on pressing. But he accused issue. me of that. He says, "Why you were? Why you have a radio scanner? You trying to know when we're coming?" Yeah, I but said, he'd no. have to like file like a government thing, and that's just too much effort for us cops. You already do too much paperwork, so I think you're good. I, all right, then can I get my radio scanner back? 
All right, now you're just like fifteen hundred dollars, you know? It's expensive. Brook Bobby, I'm trying to get to ten million dollars. There you go, okay. All right. Is your damage stipend or whatever the fuck you want to call it? Hell yeah. Yeah, there's one way you can get to ten million dollars quickly. How's that? Selling uh, expensive cars. Oh, listen. Other, another thing, I keep getting my listen. I take pictures of criminals doing crime, right? Mm -hmm. Yesterday, I gave one to Bass. Uh, Mike was shooting a cop. My friend got paid a thousand dollars for the picture. And then th today, I, t I took a picture of someone being dropped off at the train in the Mount Chibia. But the police keep taking my camera. So I can't take these pictures anymore. Why do they take the camera? I don't know. They said you use the crime. Did you use the camera in, in crime? I said no, I didn't. They take it anyway. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, it really, it it really be like that though. Yeah, it do be like that. Hey, listen, uh, Senor Officer Mullen has some questions for you. All right. Uh, well, I guess this is just general questions about uh, when you owned Fast Lane uh, back okay. in the day. Mm -hmm. uh, did, just, did any of the judges have any stake in the company as well, or were you sole owner? Uh, as far as I know, I was 99% uh, owner, with 1% owner being... Uh, fuck, what was his name? He's going to get mad at me now. He's going to kill me. Um. Mm -hmm. The guy who used to own it before I did. Negan? Negan. That guy. Okay. I haven't heard seen him in a hot. He, he had like a one percent one percent shadow because he would like uh you know, say like, okay, don't do that thing. Right. But no one no one had uh besides me. I had complete ownership of everything and no one told me what not to do. Gotcha, gotcha. Did did uh, the did any of the judges like to hang out around fast lane a lot? Uh, no, but they bought, I think they bought some cars. Unbelievable. You hear this? They're buying cars. Do you know, uh, what do you, do you know if Judge Bailey bought any cars off the top of your head? I believe he bought, um, we'll be right he did buy a Supra for this. Baby, the guy that has the deep voice. I'll, uh, I'll go let medic spin bell. Thanks, cousin. The hell? There's like fighting going on here? What's. Bobby, what's up? Is that you, Dr. Choi? No! Jesus! Choi doesn't have red hair like this. She has natural red hair. I use a box. Jesus. How many? Who is this? I'm Violet! Jesus! Oh, you have red Popper hair. Popper is technically a redhead too, no? Yeah, she's natural though. She doesn't use a box. I like the chemicals that go straight to my brain. Makes me smarter, you know? Interesting, okay. I'm like, uh, Spider-Man. Wait, you got your eye patch back, Popper? Yeah, it was a pretty serious, tragic thing that happened to me, really. You didn't have to hit me. I don't want to talk I about it. I'm a little traumatized you, right now. You didn't have to hit me. Wait, what, what happened? It's still tragic. Yeah, full of Wait, yeah. if it's tragic, Sorry. I I want to know about it. Wait, why the fuck do you have one? I got five fingernails shoved into my. Eye. You're you're fucking faking it. No, I'm not faking. You're it. faker. His, yeah, you he, are. He he is faking it. You're faking, faking it to he's people that have a real it. disability. Yes, he is. He is. What's wrong he with you? Faking Wait, it. you he have a disability? It, so yeah. <laughs> I got injured. Unbelievable. No, I think Bobby's wearing it. Is I think Bobby, have you actually got two eyes? No oh, medical. I'm I missing don't have one. Okay. Bobby Unbelievable. Does, so just Bunch of fakers. Of You're lying to everyone. Then, oh, well, yeah, I actually have. <laughs> Bobby gatekeeping eye patch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Hey, how you doing, Chief? <sighs> Terrible. What's the matter? Hey, hey, Chief. <laughs> What's the matter? It's just, it's just bad, man. Have you walked out in? Oh, shit. I uh, just had such a rough day yeah, today. Up? My face well, just... Just you need stings. to cry face, somebody's shoulder. Okay, my face you really hurts. Hey, so uh, Sun Moon oh. was actually the owner like last year, so I don't think he's gonna be. Uh, he's okay. not gonna build. Yeah. Have you stepped out of the uh, the, bu the MRP building once today? Yeah, and then I got yeah, stabbed yeah. by Mike Block's entourage. Oh. So. Hey, well, hey Chief. If you need anything? You reach out, okay? Tell me the story of how you got that eye patch again. Uh, it's a. Very complicated and tragic tale with a lot of sorrow and sadness and... Why don't we start don't, with the spoon? Just... What is this? I'm just curious again. Who is this guy? Was it an interrogation or something? I haven't read you your rights, sir. Oh, my lawyer. I don't want to be here. We could get you a lawyer. Not, not right now. Not right... I'm done right, with this conversation. Sir? I think he's resisting. Wait, Divine. 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 Yeah, yeah, Divine, wait, Divine. Yeah, just go, 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 go. Sir, you, a bitch. you scooped out your eye I... with a spoon. Molten, I didn't fucking scoop out my eye with a spoon, okay? You. Cr oh, Jesus Christ. What did you do? What the hell was that, Divine? Why'd you say well, you did that? I thought you needed then? me to use my evasive tactics. Yeah, to get him not to be in the back of the car because he's trying to fucking get a therapist or some shit to talk to me. And that was uh. The, oh, who's the, back I'm there? Sorry. First off, crying. first off, the DA made me do that. As as okay, the first, well, what, what the, the fuck DA's just I jealous. Here? Okay. Look, I, the last thing I need right now for this case is for you to get fifty-one fifty. So I, you're I, trying I to fifty-one fifty me, you son of a bitch. I was didn't fucking scoop my eye with a spoon. Okay. Oh. Okay, look, that's I just what having the... an eye patch, okay? And then Snow has gave me an eyeball, all right? That's it. Okay, I, but the DA wants to 5150 you, not me. Okay, well, we're going to have to get rid of the DA. Okay, well... Bring him up to Sandy Shores and sign of him of... off of duty. I don't think he's on duty. Well, then he's not the DA then, is he? All right, look, so you, you didn't scoop out your eye? No, I didn't scoop out my eye. Okay, but you got to keep it on the down low, man. I got a rep now, okay? What rep is that? The eye patch, man. The eye patch is bringing in all the men. You're fucking is ruining it? my vibe. Yes. And Doctor Choi's been cucking me from wearing one ever since she took my original off. Oh. Christ. All right. All right. Are you gonna leave me alone now? I'm gonna try to uh, kill yeah, me in a sure. fucking psych ward because it's not it's not illegal to want to wear an eye patch, Malton, Okay, and like that so you faker, can see just... and like that faker Ellis Pinzone. That guy's right. fucking faking it. Okay, I know a faker when I see one. That guy, so you... that guy does not deserve to wear an eye patch. Okay, so you he can got see fingered. Just fine okay, the... that's it. He only got fingered. <laughs> okay, so you could see just fine without it, sir. Yes, I can see just fine without it. Okay. All right. Christ. Can't get I'm a hold of Janelle, by the way. Otherwise, there's like four people deep in this card. Hey. All right, good luck, Divine, catching the murderers. All right, do you have Judge Bailey's phone number? I don't know Judge Bailey's phone number. Hey, Molten, I had to talk to you anyway. I mean, oh, somebody okay. from Fastlane does. What's up? Ah. <sighs> Are you racing in that? Oh, let me, let me figure this out first. But I'll hit you up. No. Better not be. Why would I? Okay, hey, You're what's up? Right? Stay safe, okay? How are you too? Yeah, right, he's, uh, care. he just kind of ran out of there. I'm talking to him now. Alright, but. Okay, I, I'm, I'll get, I'm gonna get rid of this therapist. Maybe. Anyway, let me let me see if I could email the judge. What, what does this guy want? Can we help you, sir? I'm He's just, he's just kind of staring. What? Did you scoop out your voice with a spoon? 
uh, more of scoop sand into my throat. But yeah. Okay. Yeah. What the fuck? Are Walk you just here? Walk. Are you just here to like make a report? No, I'm here to get food. It's a weird place to get food, isn't it? Yeah, it's all right. You know, I get to meet friendly faces. Friends are downstairs anyway, so you know how it is. I think, need, I think you need better friends. Eh, I like them. If your friends are downstairs being arrested. Yeah, yeah they are. Yeah, that's, what that's what I'm saying. You probably need better friends if your friends are getting arrested. Oh, I'm normally down there, too. You get arrested as well? Uh, no. Not this time. Do you want to be arrested? No, thank you. Okay. All right. All right. All right, I'm gonna try right. to email the judge real quick. Okay. Okay. All right then. All right. That's fine. Nice eye patch. Thanks. There's a tragic tale behind it and how I lost what my eye. What is it? I just can't go into it right now. It's too gruesome to even. That's like I literally just had my, you know, my neck, my wrist, my and elbows, my knees, and my ankles all cut open. Yeah, but my story is way worse. It's way, way more tragic. Way worse, really? And then yeah. you had sand shoved into all your cuts? It's just, it's and then just hung up on yeah, this Yeah, I'm with him now. He's saying that it was I, uh, I... just a J, what he was telling me. Were you lynched on this tree? Yeah. He... It's a tragic yeah, story. Yeah, he could a bear. see just fine without it. Oh, I see. Yeah, very tragic. Very mm -hmm. tragic. No, that's just the that's just what we're telling people. So he can Are you snitching seem, on me? Seem hard. No, I'm not snitching on you. I'm saving your ass. So, yeah, I, I don't know. Maybe this is like. Look, a if you don't believe issue, me, look at he, the glove box, okay? He's not scooping out his eyes or anything, so we're good. Don't what the fuck is don't this, sir? It. Put it back. Put it back right now. You suck. I, I, you dumb son of a bitch. I, I gotta call you back. Put sir. it back. Wait, what is this thing? Uh, what the fuck is this? What am I doing? Okay, all right, I'll put it back. I'll put it. Oh, you took it back already. Wait, is that yours or is that? Is that yours? Look, just I don't want you touching it like that, okay? It's not for you to touch. I mean, special people can touch it. Okay, so, but is that your physical eye? <sighs> Let's get on patrol mall and actually do some police work. Okay. What, what did Vincent say about me, by the way? Uh, he just said you're not a good officer. Shit. That doesn't sound like him. Yeah. Alright, now I'm actually gonna talk to the ship. You don't like the eye a bit? This is like me playing Dirt Rally this morning. Alright, we'll see what the judge says, but I think if he says anything other than, yeah, I'm willing to come in to do an interview, it's uh, very suspicious. Is it suspicious if he died? A judge? Yeah. I mean, is he dead? I'm just wondering if he died, if that would be suspicious. Um, yeah, probably. Okay. I mean, here's the thing. If 